good morning, everybody. Honestly, if you could hear what goes on <laughs> behind the scenes leading up to... So we're having this... this I won't talk, we won't talk to you about what the conversation we're, we're having. Not appropriate. Very not appropriate for this time of the morning. <laughs> and then we're blah, 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 blah. Three, two, one. Good morning. <laughs> It's hilarious. <laughs> Honestly, it's so funny. It's really good. You're me again then. Yes! It's I've amazing, got the lovely it? Mark Smith. Yeah, Can good. I show your hair's looking good? Even Michael commented on it this yes, morning. Yes, looking good. Yeah. Michael. Yeah. yeah. You get, you've yeah. almost got you've almost got the yeah. quiff going Long now. Hair. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I've got a quiff. You have. It really suits you. It's getting there. It's getting getting there. there. Yeah. You want the long yeah, on top yeah. Chris yeah. Pine look. Yeah, yeah. Love it. Was it Chris Pine? That it was. Had... Yes. That, that was the catalyst for it. Yeah. He's a handsome mm. chap, is yeah, Chris yeah. Pine, as are you, by the way. Bless you. Need to point out. You'll be modelling for Dior next. <laughs> <laughs> oh, imagine. Mark, it's lovely to see you. Did and you have you, a nice weekend? Yeah, we had uh, we had pizza night Saturday. Lovely. We always do. And then uh, I remembered what I did Sunday now. It okay. Seems, it seems long ago. So we went to um, Abingdon to see a work colleague of Andrew's called Heather. Mm -hmm. And we had a lovely lunch. We had, we had a raclette. You heard yeah. of a raclette? Yeah, I've got a raclette. Little, little slicey things and you melt cheese. And yeah, I got one at home. It was really interesting. Lots of touchy-feely food. Yes. Yeah. That yeah, was really nice. You need, you need a raclette and a fondue. Do you know, I'd love to have a fondue, but it do, and doesn't appeal to Andrew at all. And I even said that you can have a chocolate fondue, yes. but even that didn't sway you. Really? No. Or oh, cheese fondues are the best. Yeah. Never drink white wine with a cheese fondue. Why? Because it solidifies the cheese in your tummy and it gives your tummy ache. Oh. Yeah, I'm fairly, sure, I'm fairly yeah. sure I've done that in the past. Have you? <laughs> fairly <laughs> sure, yeah. <laughs> because if you're having a fondue, chances are there's wine. Chances are. Normally, actually, mm. well, thinking back to when my mum used to cook them, she used to put white wine in Indeed, the cheese. Because that, that keeps the cheese yeah. really liquidy. And, yeah. yeah. No, it can't be to fondue. Oh, lovely. yummy, delicious yeah. stuff. And yeah. it's really good when it starts going all stringy and yeah. starts scraping the bottle. Mm. Um, anyway, happy Wednesday, everybody. We've got a fantastic show. Draw day today. Oh, yes. We got that. Got about later that. On. We have got the Wall of Fame drawer. On. So, so two of you will be a little bit jewelry maker richer. We've also got Dave stepping into the studio we have. with one of my favourite gems. I know, I love it. Me too. It's amazing. First time um, getting it in faceted because it was in plain rounds and plain shapes before, wasn't it? Oh yeah. So first time ever actually seeing it with all that surface luster and sparkle, totally and utterly natural. Which I've said this so many times before, but. Red is not a natural colour that forms no. in the quartz family, so that's why this variety of quartz, and I use the terminology, very gemology terminology, it's a sargonetic quartz. Uh -huh. I, know, I, found, I like that. Yeah, look, that's natural, totally and utterly natural. Um, and that's wow. coming up at 10 o'clock as your deal of the day today. Amazing. What about your kits, though, Mark? They're really... Oh, so... Lo I think somebody must have heard me whinging about the fact that I've not had nuggets for a while. So we've got amazing nugget kits this morning uh, in the nine o'clock. They're so beautiful. Nuggets with cords and sterling silver. And sterling silver, cute little charms. We've got, oh. nef we've got nephrite, malachite, aquamarine. We've got kyanite, peridot, beautiful. I've not had peridot for such nuggets. a long time. I know. They're and amazing. I've been mixing some of those colours up They're as perfect. well. perfect. They all work together beautifully. Yeah. And then at 12 And then at 12 o'clock? We might we'll have move, something... Um, let me just move yeah. them out of the way. <laughs> they are amazing. Mark, let me just move my star by sheets as well. Come on, I'll get with it. Um, talk, us, talk us through these, because uh, Mark, something very exciting about... Yes, um, about these I've, I've designed these, these cords. So if you bring the... You yourself, that, that, yours truly. That little T-bar across. You sure. See, so what I've done is I've made five twist rope bracelets at the end. So you can <gasps> see the oh, ombre colourways. So we've got five colourways. We've got... So if we start here... So what I've done, I've taken... We'll, we'll show you in depth, in depth at 12 o'clock. But I've designed the colourways for the ombre. Mark, they're so, gorgeous. So we've got the green. Look at this purple look. We've got the purple. Oh, that's lovely too. All ombre. Oh, teal. I like the teal. We've got the pink going into the fuchsia, and then we've got the pale blue going into the dark. So just so the everyone knows, blue. this is a global launch. It is. This cord has never been available no. and will never so be the So the cords are available worldwide, but yeah. not in this specific colourway. So basically, I, have, I was given, if you imagine a Dulux paint chart, yeah. of, of, there were over 2,000 colours, so there were all these variations of greens, and I was told to choose five colours mm. and then choose the ombre tones Ooh, for those wow. five colours. So you have a very artistic eye so, there Yeah, so that. and this is this is the outcome. This See, I love this bracelet here, look. Yeah, that's gorgeous. The teal is lovely. The teal is just 
beautiful. All ombre, all done for you. Loving Lovely. these, Mark. So that launches at 12, 12 o'clock today. Yes. How many do we have Amazing. in terms of quantities? There big quantity of them? I think so. So we've got we've got 10 reels, yeah. five half mil, five one mil. Okay. Oh, we have got big quantities. Yes. That's good. I have so no idea what the price is. Um, you're talking about 170 oh, brilliant. upwards in terms Amazing. of the quantity. And you can see the prices, Mark. Wow. Amazing. Yeah. Yeah, absolutely amazing. Fantastic. Now, <clears throat> should we get cracking? Because your early bird as well is all about the toggle, the beautiful I toggle. Aren't they lovely? And we've got them in oh, three no. colours. Um, what was that? Sorry, Roscoe. Mm. Hammered effect. Yeah, very, very, very popular. Um, now, these are available to pre-order right now. So if you want to go onto our website, I'm showing you the rose gold. We've got oh, it in no. the yellow and we've got it in the silver. Um, <clears throat> yeah, if you want to shop ahead um, and pre-order yours, guarantee your places, um, then you can do that because you know it's lounge hour this hour. So there they are in items number one, two and three on the website or the W's at Um Ignore that price tag though because they are going significantly lower. Um, as if you look through all the other items, a lot of other items will be going lower too. Um, but other than your early birds, I think this is a, I'm generalizing, but normally they are quite low in quantities in this hour. So um, do shop ahead. Some are priced, some are going even lower than what you see. So for example, those pearls are going lower. Um, you've got sterling silver, you've got some lovely bursts of jade, you've got your multi gems in there, some sapphires, oh, some malachite, tanzanite, look. malachite, beautiful. Um, extender chains, there's a real mix a concoction yeah, it's nice, isn't it? a beautiful concoction the elephants oh. there peg bales is that jadeite yellow jadeite that i can see yes one of our last few opportunities of the yellow jadeite white jadeite so there's a really oh what's that one there that blue coming through those are elephants the dingling elephants <gasps> ah dingling elephants yeah. <laughs> dingling <laughs> Ah, they do have a dingle, they though, do. don't they? Yeah, they were cute. Um, oh, you've even got magnetic class. So definitely worthwhile having a look, a look on the website. I tell you what, shall we start with not the dingly <laughs> elephant, but a different type of oh, elephant. Okay. And this one's absolutely beautiful. In oh. sterling silver. Look at him. He's absolutely stunning. And text in. Come and say hello Come to say us. hello, yes. Yeah, we'd love to hear from any you. Any gossip. We're on for gossip. Oh, yeah, today. yeah, gossip. We need some gossip. What gossip? Do I know yeah. of any gossip? No. Sorry. No, I don't think you I think it's, I'm, yeah. I, I'm, I'm rubbish for things like that because I don't tend to retain information anyway. Right. So, and I haven't mm. done anything exciting, so no <gasps> gossip. What was your gossip, Ross? No. <coughs> Nat oh, Natalie no. Portman's free. Oh, no. Oh. Sad about Sandra Bullock as well. What about Sandra Bullock? Her husband's passed away. Oh no! Yeah, oh he kept gosh. his illness secret. Yeah, sad, sad, very sad. Oh dear. Uh, Sandra Bullock, her husband. Whoa. Yeah, very sad. Anyway, sorry, sorry. Yeah. Um, <laughs> let's let's have some more upbeat gossip, shall we? You started this, Ross. <laughs> you started it. Oh dear. Uh, well, yeah, I guess. <laughs> I guess. I guess. <laughs> That's beautiful. Um, <laughs> how about some beautiful iridescence, uh, mother of pearl, on your sterling silver? She's beautiful, Natalie Portman, isn't she? I have to say, she's got to be one of the most beautiful women on the planet. She's your number one. Yeah. Oh, really? One of the, she has to be. Vote. You know they do that hundred most sexy oh, yeah, yeah. list. She's got to be up there, isn't yeah, she? Must do. Got to be. Um, anyway, your elephants. Wow. Um, beautiful sterling silver. If I turn it round as well, you can see you've got a hidden bale on the reverse. So that you could just cute. feed that on to a chain. I love that design with a, with a shell. Yeah, it's gorgeous, isn't it? Absolutely beautiful. Text in if you've got any more upbeat gossip. <laughs> <laughs> Not the ones we shared. Um, 19.99, I mean, that's a fantastic price. How many do we have oh. of these then, Roscoe? To only 12, yeah, they did fly. I see an elephant fly um, on the launch. 14.99? I mean, I don't know anywhere else that would be bringing no. you something this beautiful, 14.99. There's 12 left, Julie's got hers. Oh no, that's the wrong screen. Sorry, beg your pardon, we're looking at, uh, we're looking at, at, at um, Hobby Maker. I went blank then for a second. Yeah. Um, well done. In 60 seconds, we're going to go even lower. So 12 available within the vault. Once they are gone, they're gone. 
Okay. What you, 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 you look like you're thinking something then. What were you thinking? No, no. You looked all pensive, like you're about to come up with something, <laughs> but, but then stopped yourself. Stopped, stopped yourself. The final 12 of these available. Let's get them gone. 12 is not a viable, uh, viable quantity for us to actually have within the vault, is it? So it has got four legs as well, look. <coughs> we talked about that the other day. We did, we, we did. Four legs. Hi, Jen. Saying my rescue what? Spoodle. spoodle. What's a spoodle? Spaniel poodle cross. Ah, oh, I bet that's. Yeah, can you Thank imagine? You. Um, is off, off to the groomers this morning. Hope he doesn't go from looking like a teddy bear to a convict. <laughs> I saw the funniest one, Jen, the other day, and um, and it was like a video on Facebook. You know, they pop up those reels oh, yeah, and yeah. whatnot. Yeah. And the title was "Regretting Sending My Dog My Dog to a New Groomers." And this oh, must have been like no. a spoodle, I guess. It was like really curly haired. And this little dog came out and it had like, his legs were completely shaved. So he just had like these little stick legs and his body was just like a big puff ball. It looked ever so strange. Cute, oh, but thing. ever so strange. Yeah, just his legs had been cut, that's all. The rest of him looked like he'd been backcombed, oh, no. basically. Oh, we'll have to send us a photo, Jen. Spoodle, I love it. See, Brutus is a jug, a Jack Russell crossed with a pug. He's far more pug than he is Jack Russell, though. Twelve ninety nine only. Well done, everybody. We've got all these. Basically, they're Heinz, aren't they? They are. Yeah. They're just a mix. They're a mix of, of what, different. What a spoodle looks like. I'll have to try and a picture. I bet they're very cute. Can you Google? Uh, Google. Google spoodle. <laughs> <laughs> Ross, can you Google a spoodle? Uh. A cockapoo comes right. up. Oh, okay. A spoodle. A spoodle. Uh, Twelve ninety nine. Hiya, Susan. Hello to you, Fife. Hello to you, Kent. Hello to you, Dagmar and Lorraine. Good morning. I hope you're all well. Oh, they are very cute. Very, very cute. Little fluffy ears. Is it? Do, does your spoodle, when, it, when its ears dip in its dinner, does it suck them afterwards? So my mum and my mum, no. my mum and dad apparently I, I never met this dog, but my mum and dad had a basset hound. Um, oh. <laughs> yeah, he was very cute, um, and he his his ears used to go in his dinner, and then he'd flip his head over and suck his ears just to get the gravy <laughs> off his ears. Very cute, um, very cute. Moving on to sapphire. Yeah, got it. Got it, it's amazing. Wow. Full of sparkle. Mark this. Look at this. This might go with your 12 o'clock kiss. It kids. might actually, it's lovely. Isn't it? Look at or a bit of kiss cross. Like a sparkle kiss cross. on this. Yeah, unbelievable faceting and polishing on this. It's like a midnight blue, deep midnight blue. Look at that color. Beautiful light performance on this strand. Genuine sapphire as well. How many do we have available? Down to the final 15, incredible quality. You know, you always say that Zircon, that Topaz. This is that Sapphire, isn't it? <clears throat> and we had that Aquamarine the other day. And we might have that Turquoise as well coming up in today's <laughs> show. Um, yeah, what we mean by that is basically one of the best strands that we've ever seen. Even here at 59.99 for 30 carats of natural, it's natural Sapphire. Look at that. Only 15 available. I love that deep blue. Now, Roscoe says I'm going to get everybody on the phone line on the first prize crash, but this first prize crash is not your final. Totally natural, no fissure filling, not even heat treatment. Wow. That's amazing. Ooh. Was it me or did those arrows yeah. seem to take ages? T 20 pounds. Just, it's one of those moments that I feel like we need to say it's £20 for 30 carats of genuine sapphire. Yeah. You know, it's one of those pinch me moments where yeah. we wake up and realise that this is one of the world's most valuable components, most desired components. It's also in that regal blue, you know, the Royal Engagement Ring blue. And um, there's a clock ticking on our screens to go even lower. I mean, uh, this with the strawberry cords. That Coming up at 10 o'clock. Yeah. Oh, straight away, lots of collectors. I'll put it with this jadeite, this yellow jadeite you've got. Next <coughs> That's a nice really idea. Nice yeah, yeah, beautiful. Like jadeite and Spice. sapphire, both completely natural. Yeah. There's a piece of jewellery. Oh, I've got a story to tell you about jadeite as well. Um, hi, Liz. Oh. It's my sapphire wedding anniversary this year, so I'm glad I have lovely jewellery maker sapphires to make something beautiful. Oh, huge congratulations. Surely Liz's husband should be buying her something. Absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. How many years is sapphire? I'm trying to think. 
Um, 30? Yeah, it's one of the... I think it's 30. It's a higher yeah. number. Yeah, yeah. <coughs> it's definitely... It's 45. definitely not two. 45. 45 yeah. years. Ah, it's amazing. Oh, congratulations, Liz. 45 That's years together. Yeah. Oh, thing is, Liz, we, you know, that probably won't happen these days, will it? Because not that many people, I'm not saying none, but not that many people. No. Everything's that little bit later on in life, aren't they? We're getting married later, having children later. We were talking a lot before our last show about all our grandparents and, you know, they were yeah. married 50, 60 years. And yeah. And uh, you just don't. Not going to see that it. Very often now, do you? Not going to yeah. see it. No, I mean Tom and I didn't get together until I was like in my mid thirties. Mm. So yeah. yeah, that's true. Yeah, and then it all happened yeah. <laughs> all at once. <laughs> uh, Fourteen ninety nine. Well done, everybody. Wow. Elizabeth, Sharon, Samantha, Una, Dawn, Leslie, Rhonda, Maker, Kent, Jane, Five. Hello to you all. Make sure you check out your baskets. How many did we have? Sorry, Roscoe. How many? Uh, Forty five years. Forty five years. He buys. I make things. That's nice. That's a true partnership, oh. isn't it? I absolutely... 45 years. I, lo I love it. Well, it is a good partnership, isn't it? He buys things and you make it with it, yeah. Um, <laughs> hello, oh. Elizabeth saying, morning. Uh, could I use the sapphires for spacer beads with my peach and lavender pearls, please? Very Ooh, nice idea. I'd say that would look absolutely incredible, Elizabeth. In fact, I've got some pearls here that I can show oh, you alongside. I think perfect. <gasps> Lovely idea. Yeah, what perfect, a regal Elizabeth. piece of jewellery that would be. Amazing, loving that. Make sure you send that piece into the Wall of Fame so we can admire it all the more. Fourteen ninety nine for thirty carats of sapphire of this quality, unbelievable. How about this too? I'm unsure what that is. That gemstone, jadeite. Do you know? I wasn't sure whether it was jadeite or really posh amazonite when I came in this yeah. morning. It's, it's, it is jadeite. I've it's not it's seen probably this up there in one of my favourite yeah, strands of jadeite gorgeous, ever. I love the shape. Yeah. Um, also coming up within this hour, folks, you can shop ahead on that one. Elizabeth, I can see you've got yours. Leslie and Merseyside, Patricia and Beverly. Rhonda and Midlothian, Jane. Um, well done, everyone. Make sure you are checking out. Moving on to three of your big five. Quick message. Okay. So, oh, Ross is saying congratulations. So, okay. Oh. Uh, hello, Smoffy. My gossip is I stepped on the scales on Sunday wow. to find I've lost over seven stone, more than a hundred pounds. Still a long way to go, but I've been on cloud nine ever since. Well yes, done. Smoffy, that's awesome. That's incredible. Well done. Well done. What? Yeah, amazing, oh. Smoffy. Fair play, lovely, because that's a lot of work to do that. Well done. A lot of yeah. dedication and commitment, darling. I can't Incredible. stop myself from eating, <laughs> <laughs> genuinely. So I really admire your commitment. So when you get when the kids have gone to bed at night and you're sat on the sofa watching a movie and you feel peckish, what what would you would you grab a bag of crisps? Or I do would like you make crisps. Some toast or no, I you... avoid toast. I do. Oh. I love toast, but I do try and avoid it. Yeah. Oh, I don't know. Yeah, maybe a bag of crisps, probably. Right. So you go for savoury rather than yeah. sweet? Yeah, I like sweet things, don't get me wrong, probably. Mm. A bit of cheese. Yeah. I do like a bit uh, of cheese okay. and crackers. That's, uh, that's yeah, my so downfall. Yeah, I'm a savoury person. Cheese and crackers. Yeah. Um, <laughs> Amazing. Wow. Smuffy, that is absolutely awesome. Well done, lovely. Well done. Um, okay, keep those at her gossip. I like that. Achievement, that is. It's yeah. not gossip. That's a huge achievement. Yeah. We could. That's what we could talk about, our achievements. What have you achieved that you're incredible? Other, other than sort of, the, I guess, the obvious things. Because I'm going to be really cliche oh. and say, well, my children are my greatest achievement, obviously. Yeah, absolutely. It's quite cliche, yeah. but no, they are. No, no, no. They are. E I'm saying that even in the school holidays where I'm going slightly <laughs> stir crazy. <laughs> you find things to do in the rain. Oh, no. It's quite hard. No, it's hard. Got yeah. Two days of sunshine today yes. and tomorrow, and then it's raining again at the weekend. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. they. Yeah. Um, is it the days that we're in work? Yeah. That figures. I am going to Drayton Manor on. I'm taking oh. Willow to Drayton Manor on, on Friday. So, um, That'd be nice. Yeah, what's that? No, Drayton Manor. Oh, is Dra Thomas Land at Drayton Manor? I don't know. As in, I've as just... in the tank engine, Yeah, Thomas. I don't oh. know. I've just booked tickets for Drayton Manor. Right. Can you? Okay, so it was Willow's part of, rather than the party, because I was like, Willow, at seven, you're a bit old maybe for parties. Mm. Plus, you know, they're a lot more work um, and a lot more expensive. So I said, we'll go to a, a theme park with your friends. Oh, so it's going to be me and, and Willow's little friend. 
Oh. After Drayton Manor, yeah, it should be fun. She'll oh, be fun. She'll love it. Nice. Even though she's a bit chicken, she won't go on all the no. way. Um, anyway, back to the gym. <laughs> she is. I've not heard that expression for you. <laughs> a bit chicken. A bit of chicken. She might be a bit braver with her friend mm. there, I feel like. Mm. She'll go on some rides, but she won't go on the big ones. No. Which wow. is perhaps a good thing. I don't think they'll be. I don't think they'll be. I don't think they'll be tall enough anyway. Uh, oh really? Thomas Lander's got younger rides. There we go. I'm, I've never been to Drayton Manor, so that'll be experience. We're I at love, 19. I really like all these big white knuckle rides, but I can't be asked to queue for an hour and a half. You can buy passes no. now. Can you? Or you get speed passes. It's like an extra, I think, 20 quid or something right. like that. What you go to the front of the queue? <laughs> yeah, I wouldn't want to do that either. Queue no, there's a, there's like a short a queue. Yeah, but you've paid so, for it. Right. Yeah. You have paid the extra for it. I didn't bother with that because I figured the girls aren't going to want to go on those big rides anyway. No, no. Uh, <clears throat> so, yeah, it's good. It's really good. And actually, as a day out, um, you pay, I think it's an extra, I don't know, fiver or something like that for the two girls. And they get their lunch for a pound. Oh, amazing. So little packed lunch. Yeah. Oh, you get a lunch nice. for a pound. I have to pay full price, of course, but they get yeah. their lunch for oh, a pound. I thought, cute. nice little day out. Um, yeah, looking forward to that. Nineteen ninety-nine for three of your big five. <coughs> That's incredible. That yellow is stunning, isn't it? A parcel. It? Oh, yeah, it's lovely, isn't it? The canary yellow sapphire. A parcel of three of your big five. Twenty-eight carats. Wow. Twelve pounds and ninety-nine pence wow. only. Amazing, and it's all totally and utterly natural, beautiful richness of saturation in all of those gemstones. So you've got the red's obviously your ruby, um, your green is obviously your emerald. The colours in between, they are your beautiful rainbow colours of your sapphire. What's tickled you, Michael? What are you laughing at now? <laughs> oh, what have I said? <laughs> what have I said? I feel like I've said something. <laughs> no? Okay, no, no. fair enough. <laughs> fair enough. I do say things on air. I came out with a few the other week, didn't I, Adam? Quite a few on-air blunders. <laughs> they don't go unnoticed by Director Adam. Um, good morning to you, Helen, saying, my niece, when Little went to Camelot with her friend, she whispered to us, tell me I can't go on that ride. <laughs> 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 yeah, I think we'll all be the same. She's, where's Camelot then? Oh, I don't know. Is there, is there rides there? Um, um, Elizabeth, hello, look, thank you. Good job I bought them um, and all from Jewelry Maker. This will be my first attempt to make a piece of jewelry. Well done. Um, wish me luck. Well done, Smoffy. Ah, oh, isn't that amazing? Wow. You can do it. You yeah, can definitely yeah. do it. I know. I'm loving the praise as well for our gorgeous Smoffy. Um, okay, let's bring you some. That tanzanite looks nice. It does. Yeah. Yeah, Should we do the tan tonight? It's really nice. Look There's 20 that. available. Sorry, I feel like this is my fault. I haven't. I, I, we, we, we're on a go slow. That's because I've been just. I always think that we should go live at seven till eight and just chat. Just chat for an hour. Yeah. I think that'd be amazing. And then start eight o'clock and then. That sounds nice. Yeah, ease into the morning. I went that'd down. Be I went we'd have toast and a full English oh. and everything on screen. Oh, that'd gosh. be amazing, wouldn't it? <laughs> Yeah. A full English breakfast every morning. Yeah. Yes, please. Yeah, it'd be amazing. Um, I went down to see my mum on the weekend and I was chatting to one of the amazing carers. They are absolutely amazing, the work that they do. Anyway, I was chatting to her and she was like, um, Mum says, what, what are you doing? I said, oh, I was working this morning, Mum, and I've just come straight down to see you then. Um, and she said, oh, what do you do? So, of course, tell her, OK, I work for I work for jewellery maker. That's normally where I work for jewellery maker. Oh, is that one of the shopping channels? I said, yeah. She goes, oh, what, what do you do? And I was like, how do you know you? Anyway. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, and, uh, and she was like, okay. So <laughs> she goes, oh, okay, I think I know. She goes, I'm going to watch it. So it's, it's really awkward. We were sat there and she's sat on her phone watching Joy Maker, you and your safari hat oh, really? <laughs> on oh. YouTube. Yeah, um, what was the point about what I was saying? Anyway, yeah, and she's like, oh, I'm going to start making jewellery and whatnot. And then she said, do you just, do you just chat then? <laughs> 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 because for the beginning of the, the whole time that she watched the intro of the show, we Didn't just we just it. chatted. <laughs> we didn't actually do anything. Yes, I do that for five hours. Just chat. <laughs> just chat. Do you actually? Do you... Oh. <laughs> Sorry. Right then, tans light. Yeah, let's talk about beautiful tans light, shall we? Um, now, let's be honest. It's quiet because I've just been waffling. That's why. That's my fault, Ross. There's plenty of people watching. Um, he, he says, I thought the Ruby Emerald and Sapphire would have sold out at 12 99 That's my fault, Ross, because I've just been chewing the fat. Um, okay. 
Let's wake everybody up then. Should we just like myself included in that, by the way? Um, first price crash. We're already at 39.99. First oh. price crash. We're going to match the price of the ruby, emerald, and sapphire. And I'm going to tell you, we're not even stopping there. Now, did you say there's 30 or 20 available? 20 available. Clock is ticking. Look at where we are. Seriously. Already. Already. Tanzanite, 12.99. I remember when strands like this, Mark, would have been 70, 80 pounds. Yeah, absolutely, it's beautiful. Part and of not the media. No, I love, I love Tanzanite yeah. long fasten. When we were part of a media, this strand would have been probably around 70 pounds, mm, wouldn't yeah, it? Absolutely. Um, because it was, you know, we didn't have the same contacts that we do now. Um, in 30 seconds, though, we're going even lower, even lower. 12.99 for genuine sapphire. Even if we've got a very well-established stash of Tanzanite. I don't think we're ever going to regret those decisions, are we? Those purchases of this gemstone that is, um, will, will deplete in the foreseeable future. Straight away, Ella's there, Jane's there, new customers getting involved. Good morning. Keep those messages cut through, though. I like the fact we have a nice little chin wag during the first hour. Wow. You know, just talk about nothing. I'm, my, I'll, I'll, wait, I'll, I'll wait for a minute. Okay. Something just popped into my head. Ross is, Ross is trying to, like, get me focused and... <laughs> <laughs> Sun shining. Sun is shining. It's a beautiful day. <gasps> wow. Nine ninety nine for genuine tanzanite. Oh wow. That with your pearls, just one rondelle, smooth rondelle dotted in between your pearls. I think would be, be absolutely beautiful. That jade, I think, would go really nice. This one, with it as well. yeah, that's yeah. good. I like that color scheme as well. It's the smoothness, mm. isn't it? The beautiful smooth cuts. Yeah, that would be absolutely amazing. Just break them up. What a, what a tanzanite either side of the round, yes, do you think? Yes, yeah. Love it. Absolutely love it. What's your favourite? I thought of you the other day, Ross. I was driving back from Wales. I thought of you the other day. Yeah, yeah, I, I do. I do. Um, so I was driving back and on the radio, this song came on. Here comes the sun. Do -do 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 -do. Here comes the sun. And it was the Beatles, and I thought, ah, oh, Ross will be in his element right now. He loves a bit of the Beatles, doesn't he? Um, <clears throat> it is a nice song, that, mm. isn't it? Uh, 9.99. He wrote it in Eric Clapton's garden, did he? Oh. Ah, there we are. That's a fun fact there, Ross. Does that, has that been up in a, uh, come up in a pub quiz or something? Or you just know about <laughs> a lot about the Beatles? So uh, you should go on Mastermind. And that should be your chosen subject. Yeah. That should have been your chosen subject. Is Mastermind still going? Yes, it, it is. New presenter. Dun dun. Yeah. There's a new presenter. Yeah, love it. Uh, Nine yeah. ninety nine. Well done, Barbara and Marion and Sharon and Ella and Surrey and Jane and Leicestershire and Sussex. Hello to you, new customers. Good morning. Wow. It's lovely to be with you all. I hope you're well. I hope you're excited for what will be an amazing show. Also, mark this with your kits. So with that aquamarine or with that oh, kyanite, I think it would be lovely. Look at that aquamarine. That that aquamarine. aquamarine is incredible. Isn't that gorgeous? Love that, that yeah. blue. Yeah. Alongside the aquamarine coming up in the nine o'clock hour would be absolutely amazing. Check that out. Yes. Wow, yes. Now, lots of you are shopping ahead. Love that aquamarine strand. That's beautiful. It's gorgeous, isn't it? Absolutely beautiful. Now, a few of you have shopped ahead on this, and I don't blame you at all. Um, we always talk about the quality of the pills, the strength of our pill buying here at Jewelry Maker. Generally, I think it's one of our greatest strengths. And there's a certain ilk of pearls, certain uh, shape of pearls, certain colour of pearls that are firmly in the limelight at the moment. And it's what I'm about to show you. Um, some refer to them as fireball pearls, some refer to them as baroque pearls. Know that these are totally and utterly natural, and we're really celebrating right now. The pearl market is really celebrating sort of not just your, you know, conforming spherical pearls, which are lovely in their own individual right, uh, <clears throat> but actually embracing sort of the more irregular shapes. Well, they actually heighten iridescence. You know, you get more surface luster, more generally, you get more of your uh, color overtones. So that's the joy, I think, of fireball pearls, is that you have this, with those undulations and swathes, with that thick nacre surface, which um, these all obviously are, um, you don't just get one stagnant color. It's not just, you know, oh, they're white, oh, they're purple. You get purple with a sash of pistachio or a sash of papaya-like color. These are giants. They're absolutely huge. And, and again, I can confirm my experience when I was over in Tucson two years ago, on the back of the pandemic, obviously, we knew, know the pearl harvest was oh. decimated. They do sell these individually now. So to get 
get strands is very, very expensive wow. ordinarily. Now, there's just one of them available. Look at that. My goodness me. One of them available within the vault. So once these have gone, they have gone. And I'm not sitting here telling you that we're not going to get any more. We will endeavour to. But remember what our suppliers have said. To bring strands like this is not impossible, but it is expensive. Um, so even here at £1,479. I Genuinely, that is a great price. Genuinely. Because when I was at Tucson, that was wholesale. And they were mm, at yeah, least yeah. $50. At least. And that's one of the smaller Baroque pearls. Totally natural colors, no dyeing, all mother nature. So the mollusk itself has shared those beautiful, but you've got, you've got aquamarine blues in this as well. Various different overtones. Look how like an ametrine split, isn't yeah. it, some of them? Lovely. That one there is my favorite, just. This yeah, one? With the dark face, that's beautiful. I love that. Yeah, you've got that beautiful yeah. deep ultraviolet purple. Look at that. They're amazing, aren't they? That's beautiful. Folds of silk, which of course are nacre. Look at how beautiful each and oh, I like that one. Each and every single one of these are unique in their own individual beauty, full of colour, totally and utterly natural. Just miracles, aren't they? Absolute miracles of nature. And there's no way of saying, right, okay, you need to produce a Brock pearl. You need to produce a button pearl. Yeah. You, you know, it is basically what the mollusk oh. dictates. Wow. £299. These are absolutely huge. Just to give you an idea, they go to 23 millimetres in their size. Um, it is enormous. And you, <laughs> when you actually put into, when you imagine it forming within yeah. the actual mollusk itself, um, these will be one per per mollusk. There's one of them left, and I've got people with it on their fo in their um, in their baskets and also on the phone lines. You can of course use your split payment. Look at that, seventy four pounds and seventy five pence, and that is naught percent interest. Um, so get it home, start making it. You can be wearing it whilst you're actually paying this off. Um, I've got Cheshire. Pembrokeshire and Fife showing interest in this last strand. Oh, it's gone. Oh. Well done. Well done. Fife and Pembrokeshire, you've got it. We've got a delay on our call screen, so I can't oh. quite see you all. Um, okay, remember, coming up, your toggle clasps. Um, these are your early birds. We've got them in the three different colours as well. So I'm showing you the... Oh, not very well. Let's tip it out, actually. I'm showing you the yellow gold colour right now. Lovely texturing and a big investment of your sterling silver into these as well. So look at how beautiful they are. Um, so shop ahead on these. Nice to be able to have the three colours as well. Because not often, not often we actually do. Um, let's do one of the most popular colours of jadeite. And I call it dippy egg yolk yellow. Gorgeous, isn't it? Stunning. It's one of my favourites as well. Mm. Are we just coming into autumn? It was, it was really autumnal this morning. When is it officially autumn? October onwards, isn't it, I think, when the clocks go back. See, I associate September as autumn. Oh, OK. Well, it's October right. when the clocks go back. Is it? Yeah. I, think, I think that's it for our summer, you know. Sorry, Adam. No, I, I, agree. I agree. I don't think, yeah. I don't think we're going to have much summer now. I think we need to embrace the fact there's going to be pumpkins around soon. Yeah. Isn't it? Pumpkins everywhere. Um, <clears throat> this is a very warm autumnal colour. It goes with your shirt, mm. actually. Totally and utterly natural type A Burmese jadeite with this wonderful honey colour. We know that in the uh, jadeite colour wheel that this comes under the reds um, and it forms from the oxalisation of the boulder. It's incredibly, incredibly rare. Now, there's only five of them left. You can get jadeite, which is bleached and dyed no problem with that whatsoever but it doesn't have any inherent value what we are looking for as collectors is type a grade which is what you're looking at right now you know completely void of any enhancement whatsoever now there are already how many <clears throat> three in baskets for the final five it's not yours until you make your confirmations though so make sure you do check out it's one of the most desirable colors uh, most certainly I was uh, um, looking on first dibs over the weekend, actually, saw some very expensive yellow jadeite pieces of jewellery. I've stopped looking on first dibs. It's Have just, you? It's just ridiculously expensive. I wish I hadn't looked on first dibs it's on the so weekend because I had um, a little bit of a... Um, let me explain. No. You know, you know Dave has shared with you the story that I, we've got a jade carving in our family mm. that my mum bought when she went over to China many, 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 many years ago. And um, anyway, it's been stored away. 
I won't say who, because he feels very bad about it, but it got broken. <gasps> Not badly broken. Recently? This... <laughs> This the, week. True, the only man in my house. No, no, no. This was a while oh, ago. It was right, about. Right. It was about. It was about a year ago. Anyway, um, but it got broken. Not badly broken. I'm. Um, I'm um, bless. Bless him. Yeah. Sorry. I'm not giving. It to, if Tom was watching right now, he'll be like, oh. Um, anyway, he came upstairs and he was completely white and he was like, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I said like, it was an accident. Don't worry. I saw the same carving, on first dibs. Unbroken. Obviously, unbroken. Yeah. Just say it was worth a lot of money. <laughs> but can't you get it filled with gold? Because that that's what they, they say, do. isn't they it? Yeah, that, I did tell. They? I did tell. Yeah. I did tell him that. That, that would make it even more expensive. There you go. Yeah. Five and a half million. No. Oh. <laughs> no. Do you honestly think I'd be I'd be sat here and live living where I do? No, not million. No. Oh. But there's a lot. Imagine of money, if, he, isn't if it? you had he had broken it and then you had a look and it was five and a half oh, million. Oh gosh. Yeah. Imagine. <laughs> He'd be, like, be like winning I'd the lottery and losing your ticket. I'd still forgive him. I would forgive oh. him. Um, <laughs> anyway, £499, no way near our closing prize. All totally and utterly natural. Good luck, everybody. There's a producer, there's a producer here, by the way, um, who's... Oh, I don't know if I should be saying this on air, but I will. Producer um, does the same wow. numbers um, every year for the Euro Millions. Oh, yeah. Um, Sent uh, sent their girlfriend off to get the t to get the numbers. Um, she forgot to do it, or no, she didn't check out. That's right, she was doing it online she, and, and didn't check out, and they came in. I'm not even joking. The numbers came in. Euro millions. Um, mm -hmm. Would you forgive? You'd have to forgive, wouldn't you? Oh my word. You'd have to forget. We know them. We know person. them, yeah. Yeah, we do know them. Um, £129 only. It's totally natural. Look at that split payment. We are genuinely looking at one of the rarest of all colours. Uh, one of the rarest of all colours. Uh, natural Burmese type A jadeite. London Fife maker. Well done to you all. Make sure you do check out your baskets. £43, goodness me. Um, of the strands of, of, of honey yellow jadeite that we have within our vault, there's many. got to be like a handful, isn't there? It's mm. not many at all. No. Um, barely any, says Ross, confirming. Yeah, absolutely. We couldn't do a showcase. We couldn't do, you know, um, we, in future as well, our gem buyers have said, look, we can bring you yellow, but we can't bring it in its natural variety. It's heat treated and it's actually more expensive than what's on your screen so if you are a collector and in particular you've got your eye on um, yellow jade um, then get it now because it is going to be if if we see it moving forward probably heat treated and more expensive uh, make sure you're checking out your baskets on that one I like the idea of using yeah. this alongside that strand that gorgeous I love that color. Strand. it's lovely isn't it it's really, like a spearmint it's gorgeous isn't it yeah I'd be using those two yeah. together make sure you are checking out those baskets everybody and congratulations to each and every single one of you again I think it would be lovely with those pearls also wow. um, if you've got hold of those pearls how about that just pulls out the papayas Amazing. doesn't it the papaya colors of the pearls make sure you check it out folks and good luck to everybody this oh there's one left there's one left of those so i'll leave it's our that screen on you. logo again it massively yeah. so <laughs> it's, it's really infuriating annoying. isn't it yeah. we need someone to sort out our call screen because yeah, yeah we're like in the auction yeah. before um pinch bales yes oh yeah adam What's with our call screen? These have been on air once. Oh, look at these. I love a pinch bale, because you kind of go at it like, like almost like tweezers, don't yeah, you? Yeah, so like easy that. for your top drill drops. If I turn this yeah. one that way, you can see you've kind of got, oh, it's hard to see, isn't it? Sorry, against that white background. If I pick this one up, these were a previous oh, deal of the day. That. Um, you've got beautiful white topaz. Can you see how there's a little peg inside, but it's actually split into half, so you kind of go at it like so. Goes through your They're side amazing. drill gemstones. That's, that's right. Yeah. Carvings. All your smaller rounds. That yeah, you perfect. Or your high goos, anything like that, your little donuts. Oh, yeah. perfect. Yeah. Absolutely perfect. Uh, we're at £59.99 and pence only. Now, these were an early bird a couple of weeks ago, apparently, and we have the final 30 of them available. So first come, first serve, can't say any fairer than that. 30, they'll fly out. We don't see bales very often. We don't see the kind of peg bales or pinch bales when, um, that often, and when we do, they always sell out. Um, we're talking about what? For 925 sterling silver with your, with your topaz. Oh, £10 well. each. £10 each. 
but we're not stopping there. Oh, and you've got the little loop at the top. Yeah, yeah. they're quite art deco, aren't they? Yeah, definitely. I love the fact you've got your own brilliant cut stones set inside as well. Uh, make sure you're checking out mm. your baskets. We're going to put a 60 second clock onto your right. screen. And we're going to go even lower. Now, remember, all the items on the website, including your early bird, is only available to, until the top of this hour. So you've got 20 minutes left on this hour. Make your confirmations. Um, yeah, available till nine or until stocks last in more reality. Um, in 45 seconds, we're taking these previous early birds even lower. Peg bales, pinch bales, wire guardians obviously all your findings you know these are french wire these are components that we rarely see but when we do they absolutely fly and it was i want to say amanda was it amanda or it might be angela i can't remember but anyway a viewer that actually said we need that 50 50 split we don't do, we absolutely yeah, is it yeah. as important that we get findings yeah. as we do our gems our jewelry makers at the end of the day yeah that's like trying to sew a quilt without thread Ooh. Or Very fabric. Yeah. Fabric, yeah. You wow. need them, don't you? Mm. They're integral. $29.99? <laughs> you all right, Adam? <laughs> or $24.99. Amazing, amazing, amazing. Yeah, it's solid sterling silver with genuine gemstones as opposed to your uh, cubic zirconia. Make sure you are checking out your baskets. Yeah, they will work with a multitude. I bet there's people with lots of gems in their stash that they haven't yet mm. included or turned into jewellery as of yet because they haven't got the, peg ba the pinch bale. So if you're one of those people that I'm describing, then make sure um, you shop ahead because these are limited in their right. quantity. Amazing, amazing, amazing. You could use them with the strawberry quartz. I was wondering there. the other day, because you, your mind wanders when you drive, doesn't yeah. it? And I was wondering what percentage of the world's gemstones are now owned by jewellery maker customers? Ooh. It'd be quite a high percentage, I would imagine. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, because our, you are collectors, aren't but we've you? Been, we've been, what, 20 years, is it? For Gem Porian, yeah, Australia. yeah, that's 20 years, including us, and we've just worked and worked and worked to bring all these gemstones. Yeah, there must be quite a percentage of the world's, I would imagine yeah. so, especially because yeah. you've got you know, you're buying strands generally, yeah. aren't you? Yeah. So, yeah. yeah, absolutely. Um, oh, I've got I literally took this off this morning. I thought when I came in, you didn't have it on. Yeah, I've, I've been wearing it well ever since I bought it actually, and I thought because we've got the strawberry quartz showcase, perhaps I should take it off. Um, I wish I hadn't now, to be honest, because it would be quite nice to put yeah. one of those on the chain. Um, so I've got this in the yellow gold. If you're a silver, um, if you're a silver wearer, you get such beautiful sparkle, and I can tell you, I get lots of comments on that necklace. Lots of people mention it. Um, and again, you can go to places like Monica Veneda. You can go to places like Thomas Sabo all the big designers, Gucci, etc., cetera. Um, and, <laughs> yeah, and they're going to be more than 49.99, but we're going even lower. Um, Ross has just said this is a brilliant oh, price. price. It's ultra designer. Without the designer price tag, though, I might add. We're at 29.99, but going even lower. Three grams of solid sterling silver. These have absolutely flown. We had them in the yellow gold, the rose gold, and in the silver, and they've all flown out. There's also been matching bracelets. I think they've flown out. And I think I saw some matching earrings not so long ago. Did, did you have earrings the other day? Matching earrings with Zena the other day? Ross? Thought yeah. so. Be beautiful. And all those elongated links you could absolutely attach. You could put one of those big brock yeah. pearls. Be inspired by the likes of Mulberry. Um, what you could do is, if you've got the ring, if the um, six-step bail making pliers, yeah, is you could place each of the links while it's still attached to your necklace. Because it's silver, it's quite malleable, and you can actually make them into rounds. Oh, nice! So you'd, you'd mix you up the mix patterns. Up there. Nice. Maybe maybe every other three you could turn into a circle. That'd yes, nice. lovely. Oh, nice. Ross has just said you could put those little uh, dingly, dingly elephants. elephants. Dingly elephants. They're in item number oh. 24. You get four of them. Happy at 29.99? Um, I'm more than happy, especially in a, a Pandora. You're talking about £100 on top of that, pretty much, for their equivalent. Three grams of sterling silver, £19.99 only. I... I 
That's ridiculous. It is ridiculous. You're going to get at least two bracelets out of that as well. So yeah. I'd get two and make matching sets. And yeah, if you wanted to deconstruct yeah. it, you absolutely wow. could. That's Being amazing. jewellery makers, you've got lots of opportunities to attach to if you want. Make sure you check out those. How many did you say we had, Roscoe? 20 remaining, Margaret, Lorna, Janet, Rosita, wow. and Doreen. Hello to you, North Yorkshire, Tracy, Julie, and Lorraine. Make sure you are checking out. 20 does not hang around, especially when people are multi-buying. Um, I've been saying it, well, I say it every year, but, you know, Christmas. Christmas gifts, how perfect would it be to gift this on Christmas Day? Mm. Or all year round, absolutely. Birthday celebrations, anniversaries that we've just been hearing about. Amazing. You know, this is the kind of jewellery that I think goes through... Um, all ages, you know, if I was to gift this to my niece, if I was to gift this to my sister-in-law or my mum, um, we've got, what, a, a necklace here, I'm looking at Monica Venada, yeah, it's, oh, granted, it's a bit chunkier, but £495 for that necklace, it's a lot, isn't it? That's a lot. Or something like this, a little bit lighter, three fifty. Still a lot. Oh, I like that. You could do that with this. You could Squeeze pinch, it in. Yeah. pinch the inside so you have lots of little egg timers. I like that. Oh, yeah, like the, yeah, the hourglass. You could do that yourself. Beautiful. It wouldn't, it wouldn't £350, £350 would it? No, definitely not. The, uh, I've got a bracelet which is almost exactly the same um, at Selfridges & Co. £95 for that bracelet. 90... I asked this before. She's still with us, Monica Venado. Yeah, I think so. Yeah. 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 She's young, is she? Yeah, she's been. Right. She's one of the most successful right. um, yeah. jewellery houses. It was Harrods oh, right. that kind of were the catalyst oh, to her success. Right. Oh. oh, really? Someone she knew knew a buyer at Harrods. Ah, right. She was a normal jewellery designer, and then she just. Oh, there you wow. go. It's not what you know, who you know, it's and all that. knowledge, isn't it? He is, isn't he? Yeah. Full of information this yeah. morning, aren't you, Roscoe? <laughs> He says, believe it or not, I do know a thing or two about jewellery and gemstones. <laughs> no, you don't give that perception. Yeah, I believe that. You're pretty knowledgeable. So now Mastermind, uh, Roscoe, sat to, there. I'm trying to think of my favourite Beatles song. My, I've, got, I've got the greatest hits in the car. I really like the Beatles. You've got to like, love Hey think. Jude as well, haven't you? Hey Jude. Yeah, I think, yeah. Here Comes the Sun's probably mine. Mm. Is that Beatles? Um, what else? Name your favourite Beatles Eleanor song. Rigby I quite like. Sergeant Pepper. Rigby, yeah. yeah. Didn't, was it a keen on the walrus? But no. That was a bit I am a walrus. Oh, strange. Cuckoo, cachoo. Yeah. That one. Um, my dad used to sing me, Elena G, I think you're swell. That one. Aww. I know. That's the Turtles, I think, who sang that one. Mm. Yeah, I know it's not the Beatles. Um, check out your baskets. I've got one more auction before you're early, bird. Oh, I've been showing it all morning. I absolutely love this strand. It would probably go down as my favourite jade strand that we've ever brought to air. I love the shape. You actually get two shapes, don't yes, you? Yes, yeah. That's Amazing lovely. translucency. We should ask Ross that question. Ross, what's your favourite Beatles song? It, it changes. Oh. Year Blues? Oh, never heard of that one. Name one we know. <laughs> <laughs> Because you, you, you've probably listened to all the bonus tracks and everything. Something. How does oh, that go? Yeah. The way he moves. Ah. Yeah. Um, oh, you that's really nice. even sounds like the Be yeah. Beatles. Shirley Bassey may have done a really nice version of it. Uh, Wasn't it written for Shirley Bassey? I don't want to lose you now. Is it that one? Yeah. Ah, Frank Sinatra oh. said it's the best love song ever written. There we go. <laughs> Tune into Jewelry Maker, you'll get all your Beatles facts. Amazing, amazing. Sharon and Joan and Doreen and Anne and Lorna and Janet, amazing. Well done, everybody. <laughs> I do like that song, though, that's lovely. They did some odd ones. Um, I'm sure that was written for Shirley Bassey, wasn't it? Uh, yeah, I think it was written for her, wasn't it, I believe? I don't know. I'm not sure. Yeah, no. She's Look. done an amazing version of it. Yeah. Look at that. Seriously. Oh my goodness me. Serious 
melting ice cube luster remember that's the quality that we're looking for when it comes to your type a jade I, you want it to its color its translucency and it's the crystal structure i.e how fine of course this is ultra fine it's the last auction of the hour before your early birds this is my favorite strand of jade I, I i love it i'm smitten by that shape we've got um, these beautiful vases which are of course very auspicious and luster uh, very uh, meaningful plus you've got your four millimeter rounds that natural color which is a perfect spearmint green look at the one at the back in the middle of the screen now in that round look at how close to imperial green that color mm. is we've got 13 did you say Th 14 left we're at 99 pounds and 99 pence for two effective strands do you see where i'm coming from in the fact that you've got the different shapes the finest crystal structure the most amazing luster and that is because of the crystal structure natural color natural translucency it is genuinely if you value my recommendation this is one of the best strands we've all launched i think um yeah i love it i absolutely love it 14 of these were available but they're absolutely flying vases are symbols i'm no expert on this but i think symbols of good luck um and what sorry abundance thank you yeah abundance that's why you see them quite a lot vases not just in carvings of gemstones but you see them in sort of your pottery um in in, in chinese uh, history as well you can get hold of it on your split payment as well so it's naught percent interest split payment so that's working out at what 33 pounds and 33 pence there we go on your split payment to linda and lorna and fife and london and maker and maker well done new customers getting involved on the phone it's my favorite strand there I've said it That's so cute I love it I absolutely love it and the fact that it's not symmetrical and you can you can put the, the smaller ends together or Lovely. back to back like oh yeah that. like yeah, create like yeah, a like yeah. like an hourglass actually hi Lorna yellow submarine <laughs> we are living the yeah what's the most famous Beatles song that's got to be the most famous isn't yeah. it it's got to be up there isn't it or here comes the sun hey Jude or help I need somebody, yeah, yeah, help, yeah, yeah, not one. just anybody, please. Um, amazing, make sure you do check out, folks. Um, it is time for your early oh. bird essentials, and we've spoken about this, I think, recently, how it is important. It's as important not only to have your beautiful gemstones and inspiration from our designers to make sure you have the components to piece them all together, and that's where your trusty toggle steps in. <laughs> Okay, now starting with your rose gold. I'm going to put them all together though so you can see just how beautiful these hammered toggle, uh, oh, yeah, hammer toggle class are. So um, I did a bit of reading some well, a couple of months ago actually about the toggle clasp. Um, who knew there was history in a toggle? Mm. Um, dates back to medieval times. It's one of the first class that we used to use in jewellery and adornment. Um, and it's quite straightforward. They're much easier to put on, particularly if you're using them in a bracelet um, or a necklace, actually. So, um, and now, these days as well, the, the, lots of designers aren't just putting them at the back, you know, where they're effectively hidden. They're actually wearing the toggle at the front. We showed designers like Ralph Lauren, didn't we? We showed designers like Dior and Mulberry and Chanel and Tiffany's and co that are all working with the toggle front and center as opposed to at the reverse and I, I i get that i mean it's a really lovely yes it's it's it, it's functional yes it puts your necklace together but it also um can be a feature i think tiffany's and co when they launched their sterling silver collections um it was very much incorporating embracing the toggle class let's flick through a, a few of these so these are just some pieces of jewelry that i uh, uh, i searched online um not necessarily all the big brands um i like that one i just thought okay that's very jewelry maker i know our audience could make something like that um and you could make it for significantly less than 135 pounds um tiffany's and co it's nice isn't it yeah. more of a lariat than a toggle but mm. i st still think yeah. worthy of yeah. uh, including in the presentation um the open heart lariat necklace um again you can imagine the price tag of that one next one mulberry oh, we show yeah, this quite a lot yeah. i like that the only thing i would say is i would prefer it not to be two-tone i don't know why oh, i see yeah I do like it though. I'm not going to turn my nose up at it. It's really nice with one of those big feature fireball pearls. Yeah. Just one. Um, so if you were lucky enough to get that strand. But again, the toggle's at the front, isn't it? 
alongside your uh, alongside your pearl. Four hundred and seventy-five pounds for that one. Ralph Lauren. Yeah. Now, these are um, faux pearls, as they say. And it doesn't mention that it's gold-plated 925 sterling silver. I would hope so, though, at £89. I would hope so. But that's pretty, really pretty. I think you could make a version of that. Maybe Christine Dior. Again, not so much a toggle, but it does show the clasp is very much a, a feature at the front. £380. <laughs> 380 pounds and it look gold finished metal it's base metal as well um toggle pearl sterling silver necklace in it with your initials 168 pounds oh, that's, that's nice it is nice isn't it i like that yeah. one too i like making that as you said making a feature of it at the front with all your little charms and things yeah why not, why not? as a charm carrier yeah. yeah i like the idea yeah. of actually loading it up a little that's bit cute. with some really nice yeah. pendants etc so you get the idea i mean we've got um we're talking about the rose gold right now it's a gram of sterling silver and you've got that really lovely textured a bit like the lovely. necklace that we saw a few moments ago really lovely textured uh precious metal um and that's both in the ogle and the toggle so here we go if i turn it around here's the rose gold how many do we have of the rose how many do we have the yellow how many do we have of the silver 30 rows yeah. 50 yellow, 200 oh. silver. We're under 20 pounds. Um, big amount of your precious metal. These aren't hollow. These are solid. 925 sterling silver. And you know here at Jewelry Maker, we're going to bring it to you at the best possible price tag. 12 pounds and 99 pence only. Just imagine some of your, I don't know, maybe your, your pearls, your turquoise. Here we go. In fact, let's do it. Let me just scooch that one out of the way. So imagine this is knotted or beaded together. There's your toggle. And I'm just going to go with this. Oh, yeah. Just with rose gold, I think it looks absolutely amazing. So imagine that as a necklace. Yeah. Look how pretty that is. Beautiful. Now at twelve ninety nine, we are no way near done. We are going significantly lower. Are you ready? Make sure you check out. Thirteen is not a huge quantity, so if you're a lover of your lovely blush rose gold, the smallest amount, trace amounts of copper um, into the gold plating. What? Yeah, it brings you that lovely pink. Seven pounds and 99 pence um, only to get hold oh of this word. toggle class. Shop ahead on the yellow gold, shop ahead on the silver as well. We've got big quantities of the silvers, not so much of the yellow gold, but more than this. Um, and make sure you're checking out right now. Anita's got hers, well done getting three. London's got two, meetha has got two. Maker in Fife and Yvonne and Marion and Renfuchsia and Shirley and London and Veronica and Julie and Dawn and Anne and new customers getting involved. Um, if you all check out and can see multiple quantities in your basket, um, yeah, uh, I think this could be pretty much an on-screen sellout. So um, we'll dive straight into the yellow. Make sure you check out and remember that this hour you have got a curfew. So even if it's in your baskets, if you haven't yet confirmed out, uh, conf is this sold out? Oh, okay. That's sold out. Um, if you haven't yet checked out, you, uh, you'll miss out, unfortunately. Now, let's do the yellow. I love it. 50 of these, then. 50. Right. It's not a big enough quantity, is it? The rose I, is I'd, sold out. I'd, I'd make earrings and cufflinks, I think. Yeah, they'd be lovely. They're so beautiful with that yeah. hammer texture, aren't they? Yeah. Or as a pendant, just as a simple pendant. Beautiful. Yeah, they're gorgeous. Yeah, got, oh, sorry. They do look quite geometric, don't they? Yeah, yeah. It's that texturing that you Love see. Ah, oh, beautiful. Yeah, they don't have to be. Just because they are a toggle doesn't mean yeah. you have to keep it as a clasp. It could be used as two separate components. Now, I'm going to say it out loud. I'm just going to confirm it with Ross first. You did say what I think you just said. Yeah. <laughs> We're going to match the price. Match the price of the rose gold. <laughs> I'm going to say something out loud. Actually, let me just double check before I do say it. Um, because I, th I've done that before, though, Ross, and I've said the wrong thing on there. And then you're like, for goodness sake, Al, you don't listen. No, he doesn't actually talk to me like that. Sometimes, sometimes he could. I do listen, just sometimes I don't retain information.
matching the price seven pounds and 99 pence wow. cool screens have lit up lots of you clearly after these lovely toggle class threes fours anita's got three meath has got four london's got three five julie devon samantha and um, Anne, geraldine eileen's multi-bought mary and marion and susan and yvonne and margaret and patricia and new customers and those are the names that we can see and we're on a delay so yeah, 50 of them is not going to last very long at all. Um, I like Mark's idea of actually using them as little earrings and it'd be really yeah. sweet. I love that. I think that is so inspired, this toggle pearl. I love Initial that. Initial Us using, using it as a charm carrier. Yeah. I think that's so cool. I love that. Just pop in yeah. some, yeah, just a wrap loop or something like that yeah. and then. We've got charms coming up in the next hour. Actually. Oh, we have. Yeah. In Beautiful. fact, Mark, these would be perfect with they your would. kits. They would. When we do the silver one, I'll bring the charms over. You yeah, can perfect. Can we keep this photo handy? Yeah. Because it will go perfectly will, with Mark's yeah. kits as well. Um, yellow gold, uh, gold on the verge of selling out now. Okay, I'll leave that one with you. Let's bring you the right. silver colour. Yeah, so bring it over mark you're thinking take an inspiration from that yeah, necklace yeah. 168 pounds for that necklace can't remember where i found You've it got a dove an alhambra and a star ah oh. aren't they cute that's beautiful Little and they're the perfect size aren't they are they're they? cute they're so cute because some charms could be a bit too big i suppose but these together yeah. have got that perfect balance they See are love. Coming from. i love that little dove not seen a dove before very sweet. Yeah. And the Alhambra as well. I'd fill that with resin, that little Alhambra. Oh, very nice. Yeah, yeah, very nice. And maybe some little seed yeah. pearls. Some of the nuggets that you've got coming up in the next yeah. hour, I think would be absolutely beautiful. Now, we've got a big quantity of these. However, we all know that these have been flying out the door. Silver is the most popular colour as well. All that beautiful texture. It's like ribbon, isn't it? Look at the call screens. They've lit up. Yellow and rose have sold out at seven ninety nine. We've got, a lot of this one, haven't we got we? two hundred of them. Yeah. Um, so you know what that means. The bigger the quantity, the lower the price. Get it right, Adam. <laughs> <laughs> After all these years, Adam. The bigger the quantity, the lower the price. How many years have you worked with jewelry maker now, Adam? You don't know? Six years? I reckon it must be nine or ten years, I think. No, because Adam started when we were part of a media. Is that right, Adam? Yeah. Did you? Must be about five or six years, I think. Oh, I thought... It, it was Gems before that. Oh, we stole right. him. We right. stole oh, him yes. from Gems. Right, yeah. Um, and he's like, I'm yeah. not going back now. I like it here at Jewelry Maker because we're a nice, friendly bunch, aren't yeah. we? Not saying gems aren't, of course. Um, so <laughs> seven ninety nine only, but going even lower. Stock up your stashes while you get the opportunity. This is going to fill up the call screens. I can say that for certain. We always need a toggle. They're actually a, um, a favourite, I would say. Nothing wrong with your bolt rings or your or your lobster claws or any of those, but I find a toggle much easier. Do you? I think and they have so. a lot more metal as well. A lot yeah, more, yeah. More of a statement, and it? less to break. Yeah. You yeah. know, because a toggle has got yeah. uh, not a toggle, um, a lobster claw or a mm. bolt ring's got a spring, isn't it? Yeah. So if that spring goes, you can't use it. Yeah. So there's less for, less yeah. to actually go wrong with the toggle class. Sometimes simplicity is the key. They go perfectly with Mark's beautiful nine o'clock kits, which include sterling silver charms. The perfect balance alongside those. Um, we had two hundred of them, and at six ninety nine, they're flying out the door. But Ross says no. We got two hundred of them. I don't want to take just a cheeky little pound off that seven already amazing seven ninety nine price tag. I want to take more than that. We're managing the, uh, the volume on the website. We're managing the volume on the phone lines as well. Uh, Marion and Julie and Margaret and Carol and Kent and Lisa and Dawn and Merseyside and Dorothy and Mary and Pamela and Margaret. Margaret, well done to you. Jennifer and Dawn, Carolyn, Maker in Gloucestershire, Anne, Sheila, Joanne, Judith. Lots and lots and lots of you getting involved. Um, keep those messages coming through, everybody, as well. It's always lo lovely to hear from you. Beautiful kits coming up with Mark. These would be perfect to go alongside Mark's kits because you've got the textures, which I think are replicated in the nuggets as well. That are coming up in the nine o'clock hour. In 17 seconds, we're going even lower. Already, it's got to be approaching a third of the stock being allocated. Okay, yeah, over a third. 
Over a third has already been allocated because there's twos, threes, fours getting involved. I don't blame you. Wendy, I'd stock up on these as well. Um, you're not alone in getting quantities like that. Five pounds and 99 pence only for a huge amount of sterling silver. I mean, 7.99 was absolutely awesome. 5.99. Oh, when you've seen prices of toggle necklaces where the toggle is the main feature for like 168 pounds. I mean, and that is something that I think most of us could recreate um, and put your own version as well, your own twist. Renfusha's just got four. Yorkshire's just got three. Amazing. Well done to you. Devon's just got two. Conway's just got four. Sheila's just got three. Amazing. Miss Janet, well done. Catherine's just multi-bought as well. Hello, Mark in Lanarkshire. Hello to your new customer and Sandra and Teresa. Meath has just got six. Well done. Veronica in Berkshire. Amazing. We always need our toggles. And I've never really thought about it that way before. For. There is less to break there than is. toggle. Yeah, absolutely. It's one of the safest and securest, I think. Yeah. Because the weight is stopping it from opening, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. Once it's attached to your neck. Yeah. Love and, them. You know, and because there's such an investment in sterling silver, it's not going to rub through. It's, no, you know, you've no, got no. a big no. amount here. Well done, everybody. It is busy, busy, busy this morning. Hello, Raven. Hello to you, Bernadette. Hello to you, Shelley and Margaret in London and Carol in Gloucestershire and Anne. Keep on dialing through. You've got a matter of probably seconds, actually, to make really? your confirmations. Um, Raven Tempest. I don't know. I was intrigued. Yeah. It's a nice wow. name. Raven Morning, Raven. Yeah, yeah, lovely, lovely name. Is that your, uh, uh -huh. were you christened or were you yeah. named that from birth? Very interesting. Yeah, lovely. Let though. us know. Very beautiful. Yeah. They are beautiful ravens, aren't they? Mm. That bluey black colour. Yeah. Very nice. Anyway, coming up after the break, we've got some stunning kits, beautiful jewellery, and of course, inspiration with the wonderful Mark Smith. Make sure you check out your baskets and join us after this. <laughs> Did you know that calls are free from a UK landline and our phone lines are open 24 hours a day, seven days a week? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Maker has its own dedicated call centre with highly trained staff waiting to help you with your orders or any queries. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. It's easy to stay in touch with Jewelry Maker. You can like our Facebook page and join our community of over 69,000 people. You can follow us on Twitter and tweet us your messages and opinions. You can also find us on Instagram and even TikTok. Make sure you get involved and stay up to date with Jewelry Maker. Here at Jewelry Maker, we're always looking ways to make your shopping experience better. That's why on certain items, we've got split pay, where you can spread the cost over two, three, or four months at no extra cost to you. So you can buy your way with split pay. Did you know that when you purchase with Jewelry Maker, you have a 30 day money back guarantee? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Our friendly and knowledgeable help team are available 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. If you have a question or query, contact us on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Alternatively, you can email or drop us a direct message on our Facebook page. Jewelry Maker, happy to help. Want to know what's going on in the next show? then head over to our website, click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Makers, did you know that you can purchase as many times as you like throughout the day and you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee? No matter the size, weight or quantity of your order, how many times you check out that day, we will still only charge you that single P&P. Keep things simple on Jewelry Maker. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. 
When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30 day money back guarantee. So there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Maker are proud to be part of the Gemporia partnership. Our partnership family includes Jewelry Maker, Gem Collector, Gemporia, Sewing Street, and Yarn Lane. Oh, welcome back, everybody! Don't you just love cutting things? Yeah, really? Oh. Sorry, little interjection. What I was going to say earlier was my guilty pleasure. I only have one guilty pleasure. Oh, what's that? My guilty pleasure is bargain hunt. Yeah. I love bargain hunt. You that's should go what, on bargain hunt. I'd love to go on bargain hunt. Okay. I need somebody to come on with me because Andrew won't. Anyway, they were talking about they have a little segment in the middle just to waste a bit of time. Yeah. And um, they go to look at doorknob collector or somebody who collects beer mats or somebody and this, yesterday they were going to a watch collector oh okay and he and he's saying the thing to buy look out for now are 80s watches mm. you know your bright colored swatches and yeah that, yeah that yeah, sort yeah. Of thing. anyway he had this display of watches the most expensive watch ever sold go on was a rolex yeah worn and owned by the actor paul newman okay which sold last year for 17 and a half million pounds can you believe that for a wristwatch? But I will say... Amazing. See, my husband's massively into watches. I'd love a Rolex. Yeah, we've, I, my, my, um, my brother, my mum and I, and I will be honest, it was more weighted towards my mum, but mm. we did buy my dad one for his 60th oh, really? birthday because it was one of his goals. We right. all split it. Um, but but like I said, waited a bit in my mum. Right. <laughs> Who owns it now? Your brother? My brother has Your it, brother, yeah. Because yeah. in, in uh, Will, it was my brother gets all my dad's and I will get my mum's. So, oh, okay. yeah, that's how, it, that's how it's all written. Yeah. But, oh. um, yeah, they oh, are beautiful. And I will say about Rolexes and those kind of, whilst they are astonishingly expensive, they are works of art they as well. incredible. How yeah. they put them together. Yeah. Anyway, mm. we digress. I'll go on bargain hunt with you. Would you? I'm sure there's lots of people watching oh, right now who'd go on bargain I'd hunt with love you. It. As long as I don't do that, have to do the let's do it. No. Oh no, you have to kick at the end. Yeah, the kick at the end. Yeah. Mind you, I suppose I've done worse. You have worse. to go woo and kick your leg in the air. It's brilliant. But I think yeah. if but, I think it would be pretty good. But lots of because you look at the people and they introduce themselves and see their professions. They don't have many people who've been on telly. No. So I think or shopping and TV. We'd and we'd know what we're looking for in certain would. things, wouldn't we? Yeah. Should we, we look put up our names down, Mark? I think we should. I'll, I'll go do on. that then. Yeah. Would you promise? Yeah, I will, yeah. All if right. you want to go on Bargain Hunt, yeah, yeah. I will tick that box Amazing. for you, lovely. Love Bargain Hunt. Yeah, it is good. Love See, it. Escape to the Country is my not so guilty pleasure. Like that as well. If yeah, ever, yeah. I, I will be honest, if I if I got offered a, a presenting job on Escape to the Country, it'd, it'd be, be a tough that. decision, that would yeah, be. Yeah, you'd be really good at that. I'd have to moonlight, I think. Yeah. Uh, anyway, yeah, amazing. let's talk about your kits, Mark, because these are stunningly beautiful. So Show us the jewellery first. These are amazing. So we've got five kits, five incredible high-end gemstones. They are really high-end gemstones today. So we've, we've got Malachite, Peridot, oh, wow. Nephrite. Can you believe? I don't think I've ever worked with Nephrite. Can you believe I've never worked with Nephrite before? In nuggets? Well, in, how any, in any shape or form. Oh, really? Yeah, I don't it's think I've ever worked time. first time. And it's spinach green Nephrite yeah, too. And Carnite. They're just absolutely beautiful. And each in each kit, you get charms and you also get a threading material. So it's a really nice little mix of little kit. I like little starter kits. It's real old school. Kits. Old school They're jewelry really, maker. Really beautiful. And you yeah. were saying, Mark, the other day that it's been a long time since you've worked with nuggets. But can I, Massively. Can, can I answer mm. why? Go on then. Nuggets are really expensive at the moment. I've, I've heard this. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Wayne has said, like, whereas nugget strands used to be, chips and nuggets used to be a lot more it inexpensive is. to buy. Now yeah. they're actually very, very expensive to purchase. Right. Um, so that's why we don't have them so much on our screens anymore. Uh, because same, cause I, cause mm, the viewers love them, and I'm, you know, I'm a massive advocate for. Yeah, absolutely. For chips. Yeah. Absolutely. Now these ah. are all available on pre-order. Oh, no. I don't think we have very many, do we? Oh, oh really? There's only fifty ah. of each. Yeah, amazing. That's the kyanite. 
Uh, sorry, uh, Peridot. Peridot. No. And there's I've news on Peridot. the Peridot front, isn't there, as well? Nephrite. <gasps> Michael loved that child. And me. That's beautiful. Yeah. Oh, where do you want to start, Roscoe? Because these are amazing. I think we need to start with a nephrite. Now, firstly, just quickly, um, spinach green to nephrite is what imperial green is to jadeite. It's the most expensive, most sought after uh, desired color, of course. Um, and this is spinach green color. It's, it's totally amazing. natural. It's I, I'm gonna I'm gonna say it. I I lean towards nephrite above your jadeite. Not. For, for any reason, just as aesthetically. Now, Ross says, hold up. I think we've made a mistake. Why? Go on then. It's listed as nephrite. Okay. Yeah. <gasps> oh no. This is from Pakistan. Which means it's the word I can never Saran pronounce. Saran Skan. Sanon. Wait, 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 we've made a massive error then. Yeah. This is Sanon Scarn, not just Nephrite. Oh no. <laughs> and Wayne's, oh, oh no, he's on holiday, isn't he? That is, you can tell that, that green. 100% it's yeah. Sanon Scarn. How yeah. has this slipped through the net? Oh, Let no. me just explain how these kind of errors happen, by the way, because it's not just us in, here in this production office. There's a big team behind the scenes. Uh, Wayne does predominantly all the buying and the gemstones will be divided. A proportion will be allocated to kits. They don't necessarily know of the launches. So unless it's actually relayed to them, this is San and Scan, then they're not going to know that. And it could easily have slipped through the net. Because you've got to imagine there's millions and millions of carats of gemstones who arrive in this business on a daily basis. And also, Wayne will buy the gemstones and then they, they, they'll, all of the, the gemstones will get allocated to the kit team. The kit team might not know no. the difference between Sun X and, and Y. And, 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 and they'll just sit and they'll just see, oh, that, oh, that, that'll look nice in a kit, let's have that. Yeah, because they go on the aesthetics. And that's yeah. not that, that's fair to say, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, absolutely. Kit that's team what go, go what, what works yeah, together yeah, and yeah, what yeah. looks good together. They don't necessarily care about the location and all that, no. all that jazz. I agree, Ross. That's San and Scarn. Good luck to every single one of you. Now, we, we are, look, I don't think anything's going to be able to be changed because, uh, like I said, Wayne's away. <laughs> He's on holiday right now. Oh, right. Okay. But he has actually just had to step out and speak to one of the powers that be. What we're looking at right now is natural colour. So, Mark, not only are you working with Nephrite for the first time, you worked wow. with Sand and Scarn for the first time. Don't and I can wait. see why you loved it. Yeah, yeah. I think it's an ideal opportunity whilst we wait for uh, um, Roscoe to show you all the other components. So, as you said, Mark, you also get a threading material. This is lovely. Which so, is our our, our, um, our Eslon. Yeah. Lovely. Oh, here we go. Inner silver. Plus, plus you get that sterling silver component pendant, whichever you wish. Now, okay, you, uh, Ross is back. He's just said he's, he's ran through to speak to Dave. Told him the situation, yeah. Okay, and he said it's a slightly different composition um, to San and Scarn. <laughs> it's what, known as what? Known as Cashmere Jade. So this isn't San and Scarn. Okay, but it is Cashmere Jade. It sounds even packing. more impressive. <laughs> <laughs> oh Love it, gosh. okay. So, Dave hasn't actually officially launched this stone yet. Oh no. Oh. But it slipped through the net. Okay, it's a different composition to San and Scarn, but it is natural. And we shouldn't have it on the screen yet. And we shouldn't have it on the screen as of yet. No, so you're getting, oh, it gets better. You're getting a free launch. <laughs> That's why it's listed as nephrite, not San and Scarn. Right, I see. Oh, now, there no. are 50 available. I apologise for the error, but it's actually a, in positive. On another day, we might have just pulled it, but because obviously we've had to go behind the scenes and uh, um, have that oh, conversation. Have, they're on pre-order as well, aren't they? Oh, they've gone on pre-order. 17 have already sold, so well done. You're getting a pre-launch opportunity oh, here. No. This is Kashmir, uh, Kashmir Jade, natural, 
comes from Pakistan, amazing colour, not sand and scan as we originally thought, slightly different composition, different all better. natural, yeah. <laughs> um, even here at £89.99, Pauline, Patricia, London, Susan and Brian, Faith, Cheryl, uh, Manchester, Hilda. Yeah, I mean, we could have, on the launch, you've got to think about it, you know, if you go to Elsa Peretti, and she works with Nefrite, um, if you go to Elsa Peretti, they're not, they're not double-figure prices. No. They're triple-figure no. prices, if not four. Um, we could have started at four, 500, would you reckon, here at Jewelry Maker? It's not unrealistic. Wow. What was the most affordable sand and scan, which this isn't, and what's the most affordable Nefrite we've ever brought to air? We did the mutton fat, oh, yeah, yeah, the other day. Right. That's right. I think the lowest price tag was mm. double figures, was 99.99. Right. Yeah. Okay. Well, we're already beating that. There are only 50, so it's incredibly exclusive. If you are one of those people that want to get get it before the world, the rest of the rest of before Jewelry Maker officially launch it, basically, that's what I mean. World is a bit of an overstatement, but seriously, $49.99 to get hold of your cashmere jade. Cashmere jade, it comes with this beautiful sterling silver pendant. Love the contrast, the mixture between your uh, sort of matte sterling silver and then the high polish. It's like a cameo almost. I mean, that piece of jewellery, speaking of first dibs the, earlier on this morning, Mark, that mm, piece of jewellery, yeah. if it was on first dibs, is not going to be anywhere near what's on our screens um, because of the history. Enid's multi bore Anne, well done. Wiltshire, well done. Yorkshire, you're there as well. Make sure you're checking out 50 of you in the world. Um, um, will be successful. We haven't even launched this yet. 29 confirmations, but Ross has said, L, I will go to the price that I was given before we realized that it was cashmere jade. Okay. I'm, I'm with you. We didn't, you were the one that highlighted the issue, Ross, so we can't then be pulled up on it, no, can you? No. Let's go, let's go, let's do it. I had a lovely lady message me yesterday to say that they've bought this charm before, previously on the show, and the fact that the back... Yeah, you can, solid. You, you, you can do all sorts of um, stamping or engrave or all sorts of things. Yeah. You can, get a, you can get a dog's telephone number on that. Yeah, you could. It's that big. It's a, a huge amount of sterling silver. You could put coordinates, maybe anniversary dates. We've been yeah. talking about anniversaries. Postcode anything. Postcodes. Oh, yeah, um, we will go to the price point that we were originally set before us, learning that it is actually cashmere jade. Um, hasn't even launched our uh, um, cashmere jade here at Jewelry Maker or ultimately across the entire partnership. Maybe it's going to be part of the uh, Gemporia birthday celebrations in October. October, big occasion that is, 20 years. Is it their 20 years? 20 oh, years, my word. yeah. I think it's 20 anyway. I'd love to present an hour on there. On Gemporia? Yeah. Yeah, it's faster. She's, she's, it's it's, something it's frantic. That'd be lovely. It is frantic. It's, we can't just, you can't just waffle on there. No, no. It's much more high impact, let's put it that way. We will take it to that original price point. Well done. You're getting a pre-launch <laughs> kit here. £39.99 wow. only. Natural. Let's take the cashmere jade out of this equation mm. for a second. And let me just tell you that this is spinach green nephrite. That in its own, you know, that, that sentence there. Um, that's like me bringing you a strand of imperial green jade yeah. out. We mm. all know the level of luxury and rarity. Jeanette in Hertfordshire. Maya, Phil, London getting three. Another London getting two. Sarah and Anne. Dorothy and Sandra, Alison multi-buying, Cheryl Allen, well done. I had how many 50 did you say? Carol, Maker, Neil and Linda. Um, this is the quantity that we have left within our vault. Yeah, I'm not surprised. I mean, I would pay 39.99 for the sterling silver. Absolutely. I think that's a great price tag yeah. for that lovely uh, pendant. I mean, just feed that directly onto a chain. Lovely. Use your uh, cashmere jade. <laughs> Elsewhere, how beautiful. Lancashire, Susan, Yorkshire, make sure you check out your baskets. And also, shop ahead on the other kits that Mark has for you because they're absolutely beautiful quality. You've got uh, kyanite, you've got aquamarine, and also you've got um, some wonderful peridot, um, grass green peridot, all natural. So make sure you're checking out on those. The final nine opportunities. You said it was a long time since yeah. you worked with nuggets. Right now, you didn't just work with nuggets, you worked with cashmere jade. Before anyone else. <laughs> yes. 
before yeah. we even realise. Before we even knew it had to. We don't know the story. <laughs> so whoever, you know the collectors that are getting this right now, when 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 the time comes that we yeah. do launch Cashmere yeah. Jade, you're going to be holding this strand going, <laughs> and I got hold of it for an amazing uh, price tag because little old jewelry maker. Realized. No, and that's no. not a criticism, no, is it? You know what? No. We didn't know. No. We was just talking about spinach green nephrite. We didn't know Crazy, either. Down to the final four: Jackie and Lorna. Well done, Sussex. Well done, Jeanette. Well done, Susan. Well done. Um, it's going to be an on-screen sellout. Absolutely mm. amazing. I'll leave those final four with you because I've got more kits to bring mm. you as well. Um, okay. Where to Ooh. next, Mark? You choose. Let's go for um, Malachite. Malachite? Oh, I forgot about yeah. that one over there. This is amazing. This is stunning. Ah, can we just show... And again, I've only worked with, with Malachite once or twice. I've yeah. got quite a stash of it at home, but... Um, it tends to be a showcase, doesn't it? Yeah. A gemstone that you see in the showcases more. I'm just going to lay the Malachite down for a second, because I want to... These are cute. Yeah, really want to... They've got a little hidden feature, these. Can oh, you yes. see? They're double-sided. So, uh, that's cute. Sterling silver stylized yeah. heart. Yeah. It's lovely, isn't yeah. it? That would be nice on that hammer chain that we had well, a few would. months ago. Absolutely, yep. I'm just going to pop that down for a second. So you yeah. get that one. Big amount of sterling silver in then that too. Then you get a little moon. And then you get... cute. We've been to Bottom Moon. Follow Mr. Spoon. Bottom Moon. Um, oh. So simple. And then this next one, it's for your flat half-back cabochons to glue, to attach to. Oh, or a button pearl. Or a button pearl. Fascinating. How amazing. I was yep. wondering. Yeah. I guess you could secure yep. your gemstones into Ready the centre. Yeah. Ah, oh, perfect. Mind you, I like it like that. You could put initial in the centre as well, couldn't yeah. you? Talking about engraving and stamping. Um, absolutely beautiful. And these are sterling silver. Yes. Natural malachite. So with your peacock's eye, actually, can we turn that round? You can work that way. There we go. Yeah. That's lovely too, isn't it? Beautiful, beautiful detail. Um, let me show you the malachite as well, because you have your really wonderful... With malachite, you are looking for those colour zoning, effectively. Um, beautiful layers, like oh, I always say it, pages in a novel. Um, we've brought you malachite in showcases. We've brought it to you in different shapes, your alhambra, your clovers, your rounds, your faceted rounds as well. Haven't had nuggets. Love malachite. I love, I love these mugger strands because they're top drilled. You know, they're top to bottom drilled. As opposed than, to sideways, yeah. 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 Or off angle. Or, yeah. yeah. I was talking to my husband last night, yesterday actually, about malachite, just talking yeah. about how, how because uh, um, we're decorated at the moment now, we've decided to take the house off the market. It's, not, it's just not happening at the moment. Um, bad timing. Um, and I was like, oh, can we get some malachite wallpaper? He was like, <laughs> what? Was In the like, downstairs loo. Yeah, but it's it lovely. Room. Really nice. £39.99 yeah. for the three sterling silver charms. I mean, that's a fantastic price point for the three sterling silver charms. Yeah. Plus, you get the spool of taupe cord, which is... Um, what measurement's that? 0.5? Yes. Yeah, 0.5, so you can do all your knotting with that as well. Yeah. A strand of beautiful malachite, which is a gemstone. We always say it very much firmly in the limelight. We are going lower. Have I got 50 of these as well? 50 of all the kits. Shop ahead on your beautiful Peridot. Shop ahead on your amazing Aquamarine, by the way. It's stunning, that kit. Um, and don't forget to check out your basket on Nephrite. I've also got beautiful Kyanite coming up. So in total, I'm going to do five kits. Oh. And any questions that you have for Mark, then do text in. Loving that piece, Mark. I love it. I love it. So you've done what, macrame in between? Little sections and then little... I've knotted the gemstones in between. And they just added some little gold spaces. Beautiful. Yeah. Absolutely beautiful. In 10 seconds, we're taking it even lower. We only have 50. Yeah, of all the showcases that we've brought you of Malachite, which that in itself oh. is something exciting, to actually get hold of it in nuggets. Haven't seen it. Haven't seen it in a very, very long time. It's one of my favourite gemstones, Malachite. I think it's so distinctive. So remember that outlandish eccentric, as the, <laughs> as the jewellery editor uh, wrote, wow. Again, just drawing your eye down to these beautiful charms. That's a fantastic deal for the sterling silver yeah, yeah. charms because that's what six pounds sixty six mm. per sterling yep. silver charm, yep. and then everything that's else for free. Actually, five. Oh, 
half price. So three, yeah. four, f so so nineteen. Four pound, yeah, four pound a, a thing. A thing. <laughs> Component. There we go. <laughs> four pound. Is that right? Four, six, twelve. Yeah. I, here's me questioning your maths. <laughs> Four pound per component. You pop into somewhere like Pandora, I don't think you're going to be uh, looking at 19.99 even for the heart that I'm actually holding. Strawberry, well done, London. Strawberry? Uh, um, sorry. <laughs> Carol, Catherine, Devon, London. I, I'm just repeating what Ross has just Ross has just said. Strawberry, and I repeated it out loud. <laughs> um, you know, think after ten years that I don't do that. Good job it was only strawberry, wasn't it? <laughs> <laughs> strawberry. Um, <laughs> <laughs> Just as the MD steps into the gallery as well. It's fine, Scott, it's fine. Um, <laughs> we've got a customer. I could have I could have styled that out, couldn't I? I've got no, no, there's a customer called Strawberry. There's not, there's not. It's just me repeating what I've just heard. We're gonna go again though. Okay, yeah. Is it my strawberry comment? Um <laughs> 60 second clock on your right. screen. That's already an amazing deal. It, 19 99 for your Malachite's absolutely incredible, isn't it? 19 99 for, uh, I think, you know, that beautiful stylized, very Tiffany-esque heart would be absolutely amazing. Um, yeah. yeah, I was going to say, what I did you create? Scrap it. I took two of the moons and they're just these little ah. Malachite earrings. They're cute. I mean, that's all sterling silver. So, you know, you'd sell those for £20, wouldn't you? At least. Yeah. How... Beautiful. How beautiful are those? Are they relatively easy to create? Really? Is it just head pin through the bottom with a, with a little charm attached? A little charm attached and they're the perfect size, aren't they, yeah. charm? Yeah. Loving that. Absolutely loving it. And I ran it. out of shepherd hooks, so I made my own with some head pins. We need our essentials desperately, don't we? Desperately. We're going even lower. It's already an incredible price tag. We've got, we had, I should say, 15 of these available. Joanna, Pauline, Margaret, June, Christina, Manchester, Catherine, hello to you, Wendy and Carol and Linda, wow. and Northumberland and Marin and Claire. That's amazing. 14.99. You've got five components, sterling silver, not base metal. These are sterling silver. Malachite in nuggets, which we rarely ever see, and and a meters on that cord, that spool. 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 I don't know how many. I think it's ten meters. It might be more than that. I can't remember. How many Is meters on? Ridge? On the cord. I think I'm going to say at least ten. And you, you know, it goes a long way, doesn't yeah. it? Seven, 77 yards, 70 oh. meters. Yeah. This, 70 this, this, meters. This is one of our Eslons that we've had made wow. for us. Wow. Yeah. Exclusive jewellery maker yeah. Eslon. Three sterling silver charms as well. 14 99 I think that's a great price tag for the little heart. Um, Linda, well done. Yorkshire, well done. Good luck, everybody. You can still do it, but they are getting quite limited now. Likewise with your uh, cashmere jade, your nephrite. So make sure you're checking out on those. Let's move on to the next of Mark's amazing kits because, which, Mark, which one? Kyanite. Kyanite. Diving into the blues. Um, <laughs> I watched a I watched a documentary on ne on uh, Netflix the other night um, about free divers. Oh, it's yes, it's just it's a new thing, isn't it? Yeah. yeah I couldn't do I couldn't cope with that. It was tense. Mm. It was, and I and also do you know it's like I don't I don't understand how anybody would do that. It, no. It's what well, it's my greatest fear. I'm a complete chicken, but you've got to admire it, haven't you? Like <sighs> terrifying. Absolutely terrifying. It's very sad, actually. Um, okay, let's. I love these threading packs. Yeah, They're amazing. Look at, are these new? You I've get, never so seen you get, these. Um, you get tiger tail. Which yeah, you got a beading thread. Then That's you that get, one. Then you get two gauges of elastic. Oh yeah. Five and one mil. That's that. And then you get two gauges of your wax. I think. Well, it's an S long cord in effect. Your nylon cord in again in half mil and one mil. So you get all and a bag. And a bag. So all of that. Yeah. yeah. And then you get your sterling silver components, which I'm going to show you individually, because these, these lovely, feature the dove. Yeah, I've not seen the dove before. Oh, she's beautiful. Yeah, she's ever so cute. Dove oh, in flight. Yeah, look at that. <laughs> That's very nice. Plus you get the star. Ooh. Yep. Plus you get... Alhambra. Alhambra inspired clover. We call it a clover. That's yeah, let's word. call it a clover. Yeah. Well, it's basically what it is, isn't yeah. it? 
Plus, I mean, look how lovely that is. Gorgeous. Now, they're all sterling silver. You get your beautiful strand of kyanite. Absolutely love this. It's a big kit. This is a really big it's kit. Yep. Three sterling it's silver stone. components, yep. natural kyanite with those wonderful, like driving rain, beautiful silvery inclusions that I absolutely adore. All that threading, mixture of gauges, tiger tail, elastic times two, cords times two. Um, we're going to do it in one price crash, 19 pounds and 99 pence only. Amazing. That's absolutely wow. incredible. I mean, that, that bracelet, surely you wouldn't sell for 19 That's crazy, isn't it? It's lovely. That's the, that, that I've done, a, um, done the whole macrame slider. Ah, oh, Mark, that that's two lovely. Little, two little stones. Absolutely beautiful, yeah, with your Solomon's bar that's at the back. Cute. One of your uh, sterling silver uh, uh, charms at the front. Stunning, absolutely stunning. Even if you just took that 19.99, divide it by three because you've got three sterling silver components. Mm. What's that? Six pounds sixty-six, and then you're getting everything else for free. Absolutely unbelievable! Well done. There's a lot of you there. I've only got fifty of this kit. I've still got the uh, Peridot to bring you and the Aquamarine. Um, so make sure you're ready to check those out. Five Marion, well done to you, Manchester. Hello to you, Senga, Elaine. Hello to you, Hilda, Claire, Sheila, Carol, Linda, Renfusha, Wiltshire, and Sharon. Carol, Sheila, new customer. Wanda, Sandra, hello to you, and Northumberland and Judith. Make sure you are checking out those baskets. A big kit with a low price tag. Um, and any questions that you have for lovely Mark, then do text in. Make sure you're checking out. Still got two kits still to bring you. Mark, which of these amazing techniques are you going to show us? So, it's really, it really helps us if the viewers message us on Facebook to yeah. say, oh, a couple of months ago you showed us this. Can you show it again? And I've been asked to show how to do, funnily enough, the macrame slider. Oh, the Solomon's Bar. Solomon's Bar. So, it's one of those little techniques that, um, especially when you've got cord like this and all the cord we've got yeah, you get a lot. the clock hour. Oh, yes. It's a really nice little technique to so use. So, this will be perfect at, with, will. with all yeah, of yeah. these Absolutely. amazing pieces yeah. that Mark's launching for the first yeah. time to the world at 12 o'clock. That's amazing, isn't it? Okay. So, we're going to be using the two gauges of cord. So, this is going to be your half mil, and then we're going to use the, the one mil. So, the half mil goes through pretty much all of your, your strands of chips and well, the strands of your nuggets. So it's perfect. So I'm going to use a small macrame board and I'm going to cut two lengths and that'll give you enough there to do your, to do your um, ending. Okay, so first thing we're going to do is we're going to find the center, find the center of our bracelet. And what I'm going to do, I'm going to Go to the left, maybe inch and a half, and we're going to tie a single knot. So what we're going to do, we're going to do the knotting section in the middle of the bracelet, and then I'll show you how we do the sliding clasp. So obviously you can do macrame if you want to as well, but I'm going to go down the, the knotting route. Okay, so I'm going to pick up four of my kyanite, and I'm going to, in between, I'm going to use some 80 CBs just to add a bit of silver. So I'm going to pop on one of my seed beads first, and then one of the kyanites. There we go, find the, so you see the drill hole goes well so easily. Okay. I'm just going to, I mean, you can, if you want to, knot in between each one. I'm just going to pop one of these little spaces. And if you find that the, um, the cord starts to fray, just cut at an angle. I'll use a bit of nail varnish just to ease the, the path. I'm going to be really, this is really coarse, but you can't, you can't see this on screen, but um, there we go. I'm going to feed that through. They've got, as I said, they've got really good, good drill holes. That's the third one. And we'll do one more. So this is your fourth. Then 
finish with a seed bead. And then we're going to do our knot. At one end. And I'm just going to use your, your bead awl or, your, or a T-pin or something just to do your, your knotting. Slide that down. Okay, so that's your, your beaded section part of your bracelet. So now we're going to do our Solomon slider. So you're going to use our macrame board. And I find that there's different, there's, there's different ways of doing this, but I find the easiest way is as follows. So you've, you've got your beaded section in the center, and then you're going to take our cords and you're going to fold them over each other in opposite directions. And what I like to do is have the end of the thread touching your bead work, and then we're going to do the same the other end. Okay, so you've got, you've got that double layer of cord. And then what we're going to do, this is, this is find this so easy, is if you keep the bead on the front of your macrame board, and all we're going to do is we're just going to go diagonally across our corners. Okay, so diagonally across, hook that into position. I find it, as I said, I find it easier having the beads on the front. If they were on the back, you'd, it'd, be all, it'd be quite lumpy and it'd be uncomfortable to do your work. Then we're going to take a length of our millimetre. This is our thicker cord. And I'm going to go for about 40 centimetres. And what we're going to do, you'll find it easy to start, is if you take a T-pin and just go underneath the cords, just at the beginning, at the start, just to make a bit of space. And then we're going to take our thicker cord underneath the two cords that we've now got. And because I've turned the board vertically, again, it's easier to do your macrame. And what we're going to do is we're just going to do an inch of our square knot macrame. So you can do twist if you want to, but again, but it would be quite uncomfortable under the wrist, though I always do the square knot. And this, this is what they call Solomon's bar in paracord world. Oh, is that right? It's yeah. paracord, it's paracord. It's not it's macrame. Solomon's bar. No, no. Oh, so I've been getting it wrong. No, you I haven't. Call it no. Solomon's bar. no, no. So I'm just going to do, as I said, you do an inch of your square knot. And this is where nylon cord for me is invaluable. So whenever you see either nylon cord, as we're now marketing it at, or S-long cord, because it's a man-made product, it melts. So you won't need to use any glue, which for me is amazing. Okay, so I'll just do one more and then I'll show you how we finish it off. Okay, so we've got our inch of square knot. Except you don't need very much cord for this. Speaking of yeah. Monica Veneda, she's a fan of the Solomon's Bar, isn't she? Oh, she uses it, does she? Mm. <laughs> okay, so we've got our, 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 um, our closure. So we're going to take it off of our board. So the first thing we're going to do before we cut any threads is we're just going to make sure that our working cords is nice and secure. And then we're going to take each of our lazy strands, which run through the centre, and we're just going to pull in one direction. And we're going to take the other and we pull like so. So I've twisted that round. There we go. So we pull that through. So you always need to make sure that you close, and it's a very, very small bracelet at the moment, <laughs> but you need, to, you need to close your fitting because we need to then open it out to get it over the wrist. But before we do that, we're going to go in and we're going to, you, as I said, if you don't like using a naked flame, you will need, just need to use a bit of glue. Okay, so what we're going to uh -huh. do is we're going to cut our lazy strand, our working strands, just leaving a little tuft. And using a cigarette lighter, I'm going to go in using the blue part of the flame and we're going to melt and then squidge. So that's now melted and all the fibres are now glued together. And the yellow part of the flame would burn it? It would, it, it would burn it and it would discolour it, it would turn it black. Yeah, so always use the blue. As I said, if you don't like using a flame, pop a little bit of um, jewellery glue or the glue that's super. And as I said, you'll then have to... Wait, but I find this is much neater 
And as you can see, that's perfectly sealed. There's no glue involved and it leaves a perfectly nice, mm. neat. And then we're going to go in, we're going to open up. So you'd open up your bracelet to be able to then fit it over your wrist. So we'll, we'll go for that, pretend that that's the size of the wrist. And then what we're going to do then is each of our working ends, we're going to replicate the bracelet. So it would be an Ato, one of our gemstones, that through and then one of our eight O's okay whenever I'm doing dongles on a, on a bracelet like this I always try to replicate the design that you're doing in the yeah. bracelet as well so yeah. so if it didn't have a space of bead I wouldn't have a space of bead on the dongle so it just adds a bit of replicate and we're just going to go in and we're going to do a single knot and using your t-pin or your bead all, we're going to bring that down so it meets your seed bead, pull that nice and tight, and then we're going to do exactly the same as we did with our sliding section as we're going to cut. Good pair of scissors is important yeah, too, isn't it? The fiscars are the best, without a doubt. And then we're going to go in and we're going to melt it, give it a squidge, and then you do the same on the other side, and this would be your completed bracelet. So on the bracelet here, in between our seed beads, I've knotted in between, mm -hmm. and I've used 11 O's all the way through here. I've had the two kyanite in the center, and I've just popped on the little star charm on a jump ring. Mm -hmm. So again, it's, it's free forming. You can, if you want to, put this straight onto the bracelet, but then your star will be sitting the wrong way. Yeah. So I wanted it to be flat, so I've just popped in a little jump ring. And then we've got our little Solomon's bar. That's I've replicated pretty. the dongles at the back. You can't go wrong with the macrame board technique where you turn it diagonally yeah. Yeah. and you go corner to corner and it well, works every time. I think an ideal yeah. opportunity, Mark, to talk yeah. about what's happening yeah. at 12 o'clock today as well because it's pretty exciting. Um, I don't know if you noticed me. Um... Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> um, Mark is launching uh, his, and it, this is a long time coming. You think how long you've been actually I know, sort of I know. It's amazing. teaching us all macrame. So there are three ranges you know. coming. Launching um, this, to this, the world. Yes, three, there's three launches coming, and this is the first. Today is the first of the three launches. The other two haven't arrived yet. So. Ah, oh, it's beautiful. Yeah. So you are launching your first ever cord, mm -hmm. Mark Smith cord, with an ombre. With an ombre. I've designed the ombre. So the cord has been around forever, but I've designed the ombre tones. Yeah. I love this, Mark. It's absolutely beautiful. So Can in we? in um in paracord world, this would be known as the piranha's jawbone. That's cool. Not very romantic. But Piranha's jawbone. Yeah. yeah. Um, yeah. Okay, 12 o'clock for these. It's lovely though, isn't it? I love that colour, the teal is Yeah, beautiful. gorgeous, absolutely gorgeous. Yeah. Now I've got two more kits to bring you. So these come with, that, these come with elastic and your charms. Ah, which one yeah. do you want to do next? Uh, let's do the aquamarine. I love this one. Gorgeous, isn't it? So not only does it come with your elastic, which is, let me just double your check, half, point 0.5. Yeah, your half mil. So goes through the most, yep. mo most of yeah, your gemstones. Yeah, so yeah. this is the beadalon uh, elasticity as well. So um, perfect for things like your stretchy bracelets, which is obviously what you've created I've over created. there. I don't make stretchy bracelets very often. I think that's pretty much the yeah, bulk of what I make. <laughs> is it? No, <laughs> yeah. Because no, yeah. 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 they're easy. The yeah, little, they are, they're, they're the easy to do. But look how beautiful these pieces are. So using this exact elastic so it'll go through, breeze through, look how lovely yeah. that is. I think since I've been at JM, I've probably made five. Well, that's because you're- Five or six stretchy bracelets. You, you have the ability. You have, you have a lot of ability to yeah, make high-end Yeah, but it's quite a staple amazing. thing is in elastic. I wonder why I've not made Yeah, made they are more. amazing. Yeah. Plus you've got your three sterling silver uh, elements. So including that disc, which you could stick your gemstones to, or you can uh, engrave. You've got that very Tiffany's-esque heart um, that Mark, you have used. Oh, you flipped yours over, I like that. Yes, yeah. Love so one, one, that. one side is plain and the other side is beaded, ah, kind of little beaded. Yeah. Love that. And then you've also got your moons. Yeah. So you get three sterling silver charms, you get elasticity, and you get the beautiful, I'm going to say it, Santa Maria it looks blue. Like it, doesn't it? Yeah, yeah. such a rich colour. Yeah. Look at that. 
Certainly, some of them anyway. Mm. Santa Maria, they use that terminology not just for the location anymore. They use it. They use it as a description of the best quality of aquamarine colour. We're at nineteen pounds and ninety-nine pence. I think lots of people have been waiting for the aquamarine kit, or have already shopped ahead on it. It's absolutely beautiful colour. Yeah, with aquamarine, it should look like um, oh. it should look like a um, glacial blue, if you like. Um, it's totally and utterly natural. Did you notice that recently, actually, the largest uh, um, aquamarine rough has been found in Burma? And oh, it's really? This, yeah, it's this beautiful this blue. glacial yeah. blue. It's huge. £19.99. pence. Make sure you are checking out your baskets on this one. Again, you've got your elasticity, which is normally, what, £7.99? Something like that, £8. Yeah. 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 And then you've got sterling silver charms. Mm -hmm. Let's say conservatively, what do you reckon? Nine ninety nine. Yeah. Let's go for that. What for all three? Yeah. Okay, perfect. And you've got Aquamarine your for two quid. Two pounds. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Now I'll leave that one with you. Keep on dialing through on that one because we've got another kit to bring. Oh, sorry, Mark. There we go. You know, I've not seen Peridot for ages. Well, I don't know the full story yet, so I'm kind of tentatively mentioning this, but there okay. is big news in the Peridot world. Um, so, uh, yeah, I can't watch this space. Yeah, right. that's right. yeah. Okay. Thank you, Adam. Yeah, watch this space. I don't want to say something um, and, and sort of spoil an announcement, but basically watch this space. Big news in the Peridot world. Okay. I adore this gemstone. It's absolutely well. beautiful. And when it comes to Peridot, yeah. you know, like with your Tanzanite, you're looking for the deeper blues, aren't you? Um, with Peridot, it's about that really beautiful grass green it's totally natural remember this is a cool gemstone in a sense that this uh, um um, is the oldest gem, not just of our planet, but of our solar system. Now, this comes with the elasticity. This is, again, in the 0.5 black. Um, you get three of your charms, which features the dove, the four-leaf clover, the star, and then here it is, the main event, the beautiful Peridot oh, yeah. strand. Stunning. I love this kit. This is probably going to be my kit of choice. If I could only choose one, it would be this one, I think. I love that bracelet. Just with, I just Stunning. put little groups of jump rings in between. And if you were to sell that? 35, 40 pounds. That's an amazing price point. Mm, yeah. I mean, you're in profit straight away from one straight piece. Away, and you've got yeah. more, than, more than enough to make multiple pieces of jewellery. Lots of you reacting on the phone lines um, and on the web. Well done. 19 pounds and 99 pence. It is that beautiful grass green. Um, like little fresh shoots of the grass. That is, you want to see this with an F, right? Yeah, well, I can do that, Roscoe, if you, yeah, I can certainly reach oh, for that amazing that. nephrite strand, the cashmere jade you just said. That glow, it's beautiful. They it? work, they do work together. It's a lovely combination, actually. Yeah, beautiful. Let me move that out of the way for a second. There we are. Amazing together alongside the nephrite. Make sure you are checking out your baskets, though, at $19.99. They're flying out the door. There is a little bit of a delay with our call screens here in the studio, but we know you're there. Well done. Um, make sure you're checking out. 50 of each of these were available. If you managed to get hold of the cashmere, the first kit, it's, it's, it's listed as nephrite. We've, we've recently established it's It's not your uh, sun and scan. Um, <laughs> it's actually not even been launched wow. here at Jewelry Maker. It's a new deposit, very exciting on the horizon. But yeah, you've got a little uh, pre-launch deal. Well done. Beautiful quality of your Peridot. Well done, Lynn, June, Pauline, Sheila, Joanne, uh, Joanna, sorry, Christina, London, Sylvia, Maker, Hilda, and new customers getting involved. There were only 50 available. I love this. Using your mm. trusty elastic. Yeah, yeah, it's nice. Can't go wrong. And if you love your green gemstones, I've got a beautiful strand. Oh, hang on. Let me just have a look. I can, I think I do. Ah, oh, do I? You don't think I know? A gemstone we haven't seen on Jewelry Maker for a long time. Let me show you. Originally, I was gonna say chrysoprase. I thought it was that, that little hint of brown. Originally, I was gonna say chrysoprase. Yeah, yeah. Is it? Not uh, price appraise. Okay. Don't tell me this is Averite. Oh, 
Oh my word. These are huge. Absolutely huge. Oh my God. You know when you pick something up and you think it can't be that gemstone, they're too yeah, big? Yeah. A Zavrite garnet, one of the world's rarest gemstones, one of the world's most expensive, discovered in the same year that Tanzanite was, in the late 1960s. Zavrite garnet is one of the top 10. Well, firstly, this is one of the rarest colours of the garnet family, but one of the rarest gemstones. It's always been one of my favourites. And have you noticed, I've never entertained even owning a Zavrite garnet because it is so expensive. How on earth are we bringing Zavrite at a double figure price tag? Not one of them should be 75 99 I don't think I've ever seen it in this size before, ever. Oh, I mean, no, no, no. not on our screens, I agree. No. I saw it in Tucson, couldn't afford it though. Definitely, definitely couldn't afford it. I would literally just take one of these. Mm, yeah. Savorite Garnet is, you know, that's like one of the ultimates as a collector. To own, say that you own a Savorite Garnet. I remember watching Once Upon a Time and it was lovely Amelia who did the morning show on, on Gems. And she had a Zavrite Garnet star buy. And everyone knew about, the, about it lead, leading up to this. It was a Zavrite Garnet solitaire, just one stone in, a, in, I think it was 14 karat gold. Anyway, they were, I think, a thousand pounds or something like that on the launch. Wow. Incredible, which is an amazing price point. But they were all like the solitaire was smaller than these, much, much smaller, granted faceted, granting gold, but they were smaller than these. We're at 49.99, certified totally and utterly natural. I would never in a million years have guessed that, no, right? Never, because no. it's one of those, could it be? Nah, it's too big. Oh, one for the collectors and the connoisseurs. It's probably been years since I've brought you Zavrite Garnet in, uh, in, in any big quantity, in any big size. $49.99 is madness. It's one of my favourites, actually. But very expensive, very rare. And discovered by one of our own. 20, that's ridiculous. That is actually ridiculous. Oh, my word. Discovered by Campbell Bridges, who uh, um, launched it then, consequently, to, with Tiffany's & Co. True story, he resided in treetops with a pet python uh, to pr protect his bounty of this beautiful gemstone. I mean, it's just, just fascinating, isn't it? Absolutely fascinating. It was first discovered here in Tanzania. And the government didn't allow him to export it, so he had to basically, right, okay, have to find another deposit. And then sort of went over the border to Kenya and found it in the uh, Zavo National Park, hence its name. Um, uh, in rare, 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 and it's natural chromium green. That's a mad price tag. Uh, $24.99, Linda and Alison and Lorna and Ren Fuchsia and Sheila and Patricia and, Ma uh, and Maker and Fife um, and Pauline, wow. Sheila, Maker, new customers, Julie. Uh, look at the size of them. I totally agree, Margot. They're absolutely huge, aren't they? And if you're a July baby, I mean, how amazing to have not just sort of your, your red garnets, which are absolutely beautiful, Beautiful, but to say that you actually own Zavarite garnet, one of the rarest. In fact, that question's been asked to me. What are the rarest varieties of garnets in the world? I would go, these, I would say, Demantoid, in no particular order, Demantoid, Zavarite, colour change. They're the mm, rarest yeah, varieties. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> this, this next strand caught my attention. Oh my goodness me. Is it, what, what stone I've not seen for No, 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 I know. Um, what do you look for in a citrine? A uh, sort of a, a, a honey yellow. Yeah, more golden. Vibrant, yeah. Because yeah. lemon, lemon quartz and, and citrine... Oh, completely different. Very closely related, yeah. but very yeah. different in their appearance, yeah. aren't they? Because lemon quartz yeah. is much paler. You want your citrine to have that honey oh, warmth, that don't you? This strand's incredible. Ah! Oh! Oh, I'd use it with your peridot thing. kit. Yeah. Be lovely with your peridot. It's gorgeous. Rich, golden, natural citrine. This beautiful gemstone. They're big sizes. Yeah. £19.99. 
It is a very, a very yeah. much collector's section. Ah, we're just uh, throwing some Botswana at the end, shall we, Al? I would have known what that was. I wouldn't have guessed it was no, Botswana. Oh my million, goodness. Yeah. It would look lovely with this strand yeah, though. Yeah. I'm going to join you on this strand. I love it. November's birthstone, of course. Beautiful, love, lovely with the Zavrite. Amazing with Mark's kit. It'd be lovely with the deal of the day as well. Your strawberry quartz that's coming up with Dave in a few moments' time. 1999 again with your citrine, the more golden it should look like. Liquid sunshine, I always say that. Um, and if you got the size, incredible. Now, I. Like you would wow. never have guessed. No, not in a million years. Is this a colour that we've Must never be. seen before? This it's looks not like peach, doesn't it? It's it's not. Yeah, yeah it's, it's. This is peach. It is. But yeah. So we only launched is. Peach Botswana. What a couple of weeks ago? Mm, yep. Yeah. This has got to be peach. Look at it. That's amazing. Oh, it's. Ooh, wow. That. Has to be oh, Peach Botswana, peach. this one, yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm trying to think back during the Botswana launch, did we have tumbles? No. But, um, I don't think so. In the ordinary, in the ordinary, ordinary, he says, the Botswana that you and I had in the kits, yeah. we, bought, we bought a strand of tumbles at the end. Not before, in the peach. Not in the peach. No. And if it wasn't a showcase, would this have been 1999? Oh my goodness, now this oh is the no. last auction before we dive into a quick break and we welcome the lovely Dave Troth into the studio. It's not on our graphics, but I do, I think we're all in, in the same, uh, in agreement here that this has to be Peach Botswana. It was only launched a couple of weeks ago here at Jewelry Maker. The king of your beautiful agate celebrated for these very distinctive bands. You get layers, um, you know, as almost like the story of the gemstones formation. And I absolutely love that. Layers of your beautiful whites, greys. Uh, chocolate tones and of course these wonderful peach colours and actually when we were we were sort of relaunching Botswana because we have don't see it uh, uh, hugely um, it actually spoke about the rare varieties actually having That's the right. peach and red colours right. didn't yeah. it well I've got an entire strand there and it's going even lower how many do I have Russ 100 available I don't know why this wasn't launched alongside the peach Botswana Slip through the net, but I love those colour saturations. I get, still get those same layers. Good luck, everybody. Well done to those of you that have shopped ahead. Said, look, I'm happy at 19.99. That's an amazing price point for Botswana. <gasps> Single figures. Ten pounds. No, not in a million years. Mark. Oh my word. With the strawberry it quartz. It would be perfect with the strawberry. This, yeah. If you love strawberry quartz, use this alongside because it's the perfect colour saturation, don't you think? Just the most <coughs> joyous marriage. I, Ross, should we have been under tenor? God. Even he said no, a definitive no. We had 100, we've got the quantity. Uh, make sure you are checking out those baskets. Anne, Pauline, Patricia, Joanna, Gillian, Susan, Maker, Eileen, Teresa, Patricia, Sheila, new customers. Keep on dialing through, there's a lot of you there. Um, okay, now the launch, the relaunch of your strawberry oh. quartz, sargonetic quartz with these rare natural inclusions um, that are seldom ever found in the quartz family. We've launched that with you, um, and it's a huge success on our sister channel as well, one of their most popular stones. Um, but we don't believe we've actually had it in the faceted rounds before oh, no. until today. Mark, thank you. Beautiful Pleasure. kits, Pleasure. amazing Pleasure. demos. Don't go anywhere, lovely jewellery makers. Strawberry Quartz after this. <laughs> It's easy to stay in touch with Jewelry Maker. You can like our Facebook page and join our community of over 69,000 people. You can follow us on Twitter and tweet us your messages and opinions. You can also find us on Instagram and even TikTok. Make sure you get involved and stay up to date with Jewelry Maker. Here at Jewelry Maker, we're always looking ways to make your shopping experience better. That's why on certain items, we've got split pay where you can spread the cost over two, three or four months at no extra cost to you. So you can buy your way with split pay. Did you know that when you purchase with Jewelry Maker, you have a 30 day money back guarantee? 
Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Maker has its own dedicated call center with highly trained staff waiting to help you with your orders or any queries. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Maker are proud to be part of the Gemporia partnership. Our partnership family includes Jewelry Maker, Gem Collector, Gemporia, Sewing Street, and Yarn Lane. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30 day money back guarantee. So there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Our friendly and knowledgeable help team are available 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. If you have a question or query, contact us on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Alternatively, you can email or drop us a direct message on our Facebook page. Jewelry Maker, happy to help. Did you know that calls are free from a UK landline and our phone lines are open 24 hours a day, 7 days a week? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Makers, did you know that you can purchase as many times as you like throughout the day and you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee? No matter the size, weight or quantity of your order, how many times you check out that day, we will still only charge you that single PMP. Keep things simple on Jewelry Maker. Ah, oh, welcome back, lovely jewellery makers. We have an amazing showcase for you. And we've all been saying just how much we... What, where are you going? Just, just... Oh, th ah. thank you, Mark. <laughs> We're just saying how much we love, yeah. love, love strawberry quartz. I love it. I and love it. there's one yeah. person that oh. needs to launch in that is the wonderful Dave Troll. Thank you. Uh, and thank you, Mark, as well. And, you know, good morning to every single one of you. We are here, we've promoted the strawberry quartz, it's going to be incredible, but um, you know, we always talk about how we're live, how we are um, reactive, yeah. how we're not too corporate, you know, if things change, things change, it is what it is. Yeah. Well, today's a perfect example of that. You're all here for strawberry quartz. We're not going to keep you for too long. We are going to bring you that incredible material. But you'll notice just in front of you, that me, me and Mark were literally just oh, in awe of these. Um, three master carvings of type A jada from Myanmar. They're gonna become less and less as we know. These aren't 200 quantities, they're very small. They've arrived today, so I'm bringing them to you today. That's how incredible oh. they are. So we're gonna start with these three incredible carvings. And um, the reality is, um, my good friend um, Stanley Chu, who mm -hmm. I talk about um, quite a bit now, since getting back from China, someone that I met on that trip, mm -hmm. um, and is, part of a jadeite family, the yeah. jadeite royalty, if we can say that. His parents, his family have been in the industry for 60 years, largely in the often unseen, unknown world of kind of business to business wholesale. And what they do is they work you know, so closely with Myanmar. They owned mines at one point or another. Mm -hmm. um, they, they are invited to the, the jadeite emporiums that take place every season. So, you know, be between the weather and other factors, there's between one or three uh, emporiums throughout the, the, the season or throughout the year, which okay. is where the, the jadeite dealers, merchants, are invited over 
and it's sealed bids. They spend a week studying thousands of rough jadeites. Yeah. Um, then they bid on them. Um, they, they have to know what they're doing to understand, you know, what's it going to yield, how expensive it's going to be. If you don't bid aggressively enough, you're not going to win it. They only read out the winning bidder. If you bid too conservatively, you're probably going to miss out. You need to have even these jadeite uh, uh, merchants who are selling jadeite. My friend Stanley sold a bangle for 3.8 million. They're working on razor thin margins. Exactly. They literally look at the rough and they go, and they can't see all of it. And they go, does the color disappear as it goes deeper into the stone? Mm -hmm. You know, is, is, is there going to be more fractures as we go into the stone? They don't know. Um, on top of that, is it all fine grade? Is there going to be coarse materials? And they have to kind of really, really figure out what they can make out of it, how much waste there's going to be. And that will inform the, the bidding process. Mm -hmm. um, and, you know, then they bring the jade to the world. Now, since the summer of 2020, there hasn't been a single jade emporium um, previously every season yielded about 30 to 40,000 tons of jade. Like 99% of it needs treatment. It's yeah. like type B, type C, no problem with that, but being real. Um, the one in the million stones, the type A, the natural, the fine crystallizations, the translucent material. And we, we are gen genuinely spoiled here. You, know, you and I, Mark, were just holding up a jade art card. Who would have thought? And, and Mark said, you can see through this one. And it's incredible. like, it's to say then, that's the one in the million. <laughs> yeah. We've got it and we've got yeah. like quantity and we're gonna do a crazy deal is ridiculous. But I want to explain how this is possible because my friend Stanley has, you know, does sell bangles in the millions, does sell strands at like 11, $12 million, as well as other incredible uh, piece of jade, uh, jade jewelry. And on his website, he has like sections. So he's got like bead, beads, he's got the strands. Bangles, you can go to bangles, rings. He's got a collection called the Tassel Collection. Then he's got the classics. Mm. And the classics are the carvings, like yeah. the Buddha, the Guan Yin, the leaf, the, the lotus, the floral carvings. And they are all price, price and application. They're all going to be, it's, it's, it's almost unfathomable, but it's true. They're all in the six figures minimum. Mm -hmm. This is a gentleman that offered me a 56 point jade, remember? Yeah. 56 <laughs> points. You could hold it on your fingertip. It's absolutely insane. And, he, he, you know, I remember telling that story, which we can all kind of understand um, however many years ago, 2018, when I was in uh, Myanmar and I picked up a really low grade jade bangle and I thought I'll be the one person in the West, certainly that I know of that can own a jade bangle. I can give it to my daughter. I can say, you know, I went to Myanmar once upon a time. Here's a jade bangle. And I remember just, I remember thinking it's going to be a thousand pounds, you know, because I know how expensive it is. And this isn't Imperial Green. It was $15,000, 15,000 US dollars. Yeah, then, and that's not wholesale, that's at source. Yeah. And I like to think I'm so much more educated now. Yeah. I like to think, you know, and I always, I'm really honest, you know, my friend Stanley's forgotten more about Jade than I could ever learn in four or five lifetimes. But, you know, we talk about how educated we are now, how much we understand the market, how much we understand. And I was speaking with him on this trip, just me and Stanley, we were talking, you know, the whole trip about Jade. He's showing me his camera roll of like million dollar Jadeites, the rough that he's got, the cut goods, the auction records that his family have set. And it was amazing. And um, I said to him, look, I'm after a piece of Jade for my chain, so I don't wear any jewelry, I don't wear a watch, I don't wear a ring, I don't wear anything. I collect it, have it for my daughter's collection, I'm in love with it, but I just don't wear it. I wear one chain, which is this one, it's just mm -hmm. a, I think it's nine carat gold, and a crucifix that I got for my 21st birthday from my parents, I know I've told you this before. It's the only thing that I wear. And I was like, you know what, Jade is the one gemstone that's completely redefined my, 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 my life, my world, especially yeah, in my career. And so I was like, I need one that I can wear. And I don't want to be ostentatious, I don't want to be large, although I have sculptures and carvings in my own collection. If I want to wear something, I want it to be really refined and understated. And I was like, uh, I'm here with the guy that can source the best Jade in the world. Like this picture of him is him holding an $11 million necklace, US dollars. Right? Sharp, isn't he? Yeah, he's very, very smart, yeah. very sophisticated, very suave. Yeah. Um, and so I had this opportunity, you know, an opportunity that not many of us will get. And I said, um, Stanley, I'm, I'm after a, a really incredible piece of jade, but I just, I want something very small. And he was like, okay, we're, we're going all around the, the, the country. We're in Shenzhen, we're in Don Hao, we're in Guangzhou. We ended up in Hong Kong. He's like, when I get back to Hong Kong, when I get to my office, I'll, I'll, I'll look through my vault. He's got jade that no one else can get. Like anyone that's done a, an article on him, just say that their family's collection is second to none. There's no other collection yeah. like it in the world. And I was like, this is going to be amazing. And so he does get back to Hong Kong. And he, he WhatsApps me. And he goes, found just the piece. It's 56 points. And like I said, it was on the fingertip. It was borderline imperial green. It was sensational. Probably one of the best jades I've ever seen in my life. And it was friend to friend. No wholesale, no retail. I shouldn't really be talking about it. He says, you know, it's yours for 40,000 Hong Kong dollars. It's 4,000 pounds for 56 points. That's the reality. 
And when I talk about carvings like this, I'm going to show you something that I only got yesterday. And this is, this is you know, how no one does this. No jewelry house does this. You know, that everything that we share with you is up to date. It's everything that we get. You know, when, when you talk about like carvings, when we talk about moments like that, I'm going to share with you now a jade carving that in the current market is closer to a quarter of a million US dollars. It's that. I don't know if you can see it there. Maybe there. It's like kind of on an angle. But it's, in, it's borderline imperial green. Look how oh, gemmy that is. Yeah. You can see the size of it. Beautiful transparency, incredible carving. You know, when we talk about jade and the things we're valuing, we're valuing like the texture, the, the transparency, and of course the color in this case. That's nearly $200,000. $200, but that, that's the reality. And the reason I'm saying that is because the deal that we're about to do today is millions of miles away. Millions of miles away from the market value of this material. Yeah. And, and I want to explain why. And it, I won't take up too much time, but I think it's really important that we can kind of understand this. And I'm gonna tell you as succinctly as I can. Back in 2018, when I knew nothing of Jade, we got this incredible once in a lifetime opportunity to go to Magok. Mm -hmm. uh, Magok is like its own sovereign entity within Myanmar. People in Myanmar can't even go to Magok its own visa and you can go to or you could go to Myanmar like as a tourist you could go to Mandalay you could travel all around Burma but Magok's closed off it's got its own gun checkpoints and, and it's only been open to the foreigners to westerners three times in its 800 year history yeah and so we got this opportunity we dropped everything we're like right we're going we've got a cameraman myself Jake and Steve went we go out there we're looking at sapphire mines ruby mines spinel mines it's so gem rich and we invited some of our close friends who live in that part of the world. So Bernard is one of them, who's one of our kind of jadeite dealers. We said, look, we're going to Magok, we'd love you to join us. Um, we, we invited the biggest ruby buyer in the world, who buys like $4 million rubies, $20 million rubies. It's like, we're going to Burma. We all go there, we have the most incredible time. We do some sensational deals. And then um, that's where, by the way, that I saw that jade bangle that was 15 grand. It wasn't in Catching Hills, it was in Magok. It's 100 kilometers away. And so at the end of this trip, we're all ready to go home. We've had an amazing time. We've wrote blog posts. We've got a documentary. It's on YouTube. Um, and then Bernard said, I'm going up to the Catching Hills now. Because Bernard does get invited to the Jade, Jade Emporium. He's invited. He goes every season. That's his, that's his life. That's his livelihood. And so he's like, um, um, oh, extend, you extended me the, the trip to Magot. I'd love to host you in Myanmar, in, in the Catching Hills. And we were like, this is a once in a lifetime. Oh God, we knew nothing yeah. of Jade, literally. And so we all called home, we changed our plans, we rescheduled our flights, we get in like two Land Rovers, we drive to the very northernmost point of the country that borders Yunnan, and we're there. And our, by the way, at that point, our only information on Jade was half a page mentioned in Secrets of the Gem Trade. This yeah. is like five, six years ago. There wasn't yeah. any publications talking about Jade in the West. And our experience with it, with it when we go to the Hong Kong Gem Show every September, which is where you see the Imperial Green, the million dollar Jades. That's all we know. And so we get to the Catching Hills, and it's like the Amazon rainforest. It's a dense jungle. Mm. And Bernard's like, you know, this is, we go through, it's gun checkpoints, can't film. None of it's in our documentary, not allowed to film. It's so secretive, this world. And we go in and there's a clearing and there's dozens of, of jade art boulders. There's about a hundred Chinese businessmen and they're bidding millions of dollars on these rocks, millions of dollars. Bernard's there to buy as he is every season. And Steve saw an opportunity to buy rough jade. And to this day, I think he's still the only Western jewelry house that's ever acquired rough jade. Even Asprey, wow. if you read about Asprey, they say we bought these on the secondary market. A lot of it's estate, you know, it's old mine material. This is an opportunity. We have a very close relationship with Bernard because he brings us a lot of our pearls as well. Yeah. Um, and Steve said, look, what about if we partner on this venture? What about, you know, I'm here, you're here. Why don't we buy jade together, right? And, and Bernard was really honest and really forthcoming and said, look, I'm going to tell you a few things. One, it's going to take a lot of money because you have to buy big, you know, to win these bids. And he goes, two, you're not going to see any of that money for three years minimum because we've got to work through it. It's, you know, we talk about how the only people in the world that can carve jade are in China. We talk about it being harder than stainless steel. It's not an easy gem to cut. Mm -hmm. There's no big factory set up like we have for gemstones in Surat, in Mumbai, in Jaipur. And, he, and then he said, the other thing was, he said, we might not make money. But he, he did reassure Steve. He said, I'm telling you now, we won't lose money, right? Because Bernard knows what he's doing. He says, I know that there's jade in the boulder. It's just a grade. He says, if we win the bids, we won't lose money, but we might just break even. That's it. And he says, there's years when he makes a lot of money. There's years when he just makes no money. That's yeah. just the way the jadeite world is. It's always a gamble. But if you know what you're doing, you're not going to lose too much money. 
But he said, you know, you've got to tie up this capital, which is going to be a lot of money for maybe three years. I couldn't make that decision. I wouldn't be allowed to, obviously. Back then, Steve was so, so uh, in, in, integral to the, the running of this company that he said, yeah, I'm, I'm willing to do it. Because he'd just seen a bangle for $15,000. Mm -hmm. And he was like, we could be the only jewelry house in the world that makes jade affordable. Look what we've done, we have. So we come back. I'm almost done. We come back. And um, then we go, like we, a few months pass, we go to Nepal. Um, and we go and look for Kyanite. And then when we come back from Nepal, we're plunged into COVID-19. Okay, it's like March 2020, COVID-19 pandemic. Um, and this gave us these amazing closeout opportunities on Jade because no one else could buy it. And it was just on the eve of the first um, Hong Kong show. Mm. So they're doing in March and September. And so we cleared up. We got some of the most incredible deals, literally giveaway deals. Most people would have bought, what we bought could do most jewelry houses, 150 years of Jade the way they sell it, one at wow. a time. Da, da, da. Yeah. We've just absolutely, you've seen us, jade, 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 jade fatigue. We've seen it so much. They've been, we bought all, everything you've seen as finished products, right? That was all closed out. So we never even talked about the rough that we bought. Oh yeah, okay? yeah, yeah. So I went back to uh, the Far East in November and I saw some of the first kind of promising signs of our jade. I went and toured the, the factories, which yeah, honestly, the, we have filmed a lot. The documentary is still coming out. I just can't push the teams. Yeah. But like we went there and saw boulders being sliced open that we'd bought. And I'll be really honest, like a lot of the material, because we've been like five years on now, a lot of the material we've had to sell back into the market yeah. uh, because it's been type B and type C, which we'd have been happy to bring you five years ago. But because we had this amazing mm -hmm. closeout opportunities on type A, we've all got so, uh, mm -hmm. you know, we, we've all got these high standards now. Well, we're we only want tape snobs, we're, Yeah, yeah, we are, yeah. which is ridiculous. But th these are the opportunities. Now, what I'm about to offer you, just going to say it, we have no business offering you. Even those shipping container closeouts that we acquired in Hong Kong um, in March 2020, they take these things out because these, these are never prevalent in the market. This is from our own rough. For the first time ever, we bring you our own rough. I've never said that before. I've said this is from Bernard. This has come from uh, uh, Sally Hewer. This is actually from our own rough. And we have had this carved. And there has been moments when we've carved open some of these boulders. Remember, it's a joint venture. It's a partnership where Bernard said, sell this. It's that good. Sell it. It's got no, and that's why I say you've got no business having this today. Bernard's literally said, you, you, your audience don't even know about it. You've got a lot of jade that we've already bought here. He said, I would never even offer you this jade because it's too expensive. We've got an incredible deal. We just sell it back into the market. This is where we make money. Steve has been very staunch in his approach and just said, no, no, you can take your half of the boulder. And it's fortunate that boulders are sliced in half. He says, you take your half, you do what you want with it. We're actually going to create this and bring it to our collectors in, in the Western world. That's exactly what we're doing. This material, I already know the market value of it because Bernard sold it. Bernard sold the other half of the boulders on all of these offerings. In fact, I know we're going to show this huge floral piece, but before that, the one you and I were talking about. Yeah, before, it's amazing. Right, this, is, this isn't even the first piece that we're going to do, but this is what we call floating flower. And we found it in one of our boulders, right? And it's not the whole boulder wasn't there. We're not that lucky. But if you see it here, it's, uh, the lights might wash it out, I don't know, but it's green veins growing through the white jadeite or the transparent jadeite. <gasps> and then if I just... Amazing. <laughs> it's literally Look. transparent. You see my finger through it? Wow. It's, you know, and by the way, I know I'm showing you with a torch to really demonstrate that, but Mark just held this up in the studio earlier when we were under a break. I was like, I can see through that. Yeah. Like if this wasn't intricately carved, you could read newsprint through it. Oh my goodness. We have no business bringing this to our collectors. All hand carved. This has been five years in the making. And forgive me for cancelling, you know, not cancelling, we're going to bring in the strawberry quartz, but I got so excited when these arrived because I saw them, you know, a week ago, two weeks ago, that I was like, I can't believe they're here. Yeah. We have to bring them to you. Um, this is Taipei floating flower jade out. We have, uh, there's another one, a bird in bamboo, and then there's that huge kind of floral carving, which These I saw Adam's recording of, which is just outrageous. Insanely beautiful. The, 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 the bird in bamboo Taipei jade out carving is unreal as well. It's got a bamboo kind of wreath or frame around it. There's a bird in there and all the foliage, open work carving. And then those undulating petals on this, you'd probably know far better than I would what flower that is, Mark. That's amazing. But Chrysanthemum? I think so. Yeah? yeah. There you go. Um, but you can see the, the, yeah. the unbelievable detail. Yeah, these are incredible, Dave. Absolutely. And by the way, just and, you and put them on their profile, just show how thick, sure. just for instance, how thick that one is, right? It's so thick. And then I'm sorry to do this, Adam and everyone. I'm just going to take it out of shot. 
Yeah. And because this is so thick, and it's carved on both sides as well, so we've shown you yeah, the, the, the one that. side, which yeah. is outrageous. You know, we, we, we've shown you this with all the undulating and uh, overlapping leaves, the unfurling flower. It's so uh, gemmy as well. You can see the, the tight crystallization. As I turn it round, you can see even this side of it is impressive. But as I turn it back round, I'm going to put the torch through it again because something this thick has no business being as translucent as this is. No way! Yeah. That shocked me. Again, I wasn't expecting it to be at all. Again, you can see my finger through it. That's how transparent this material is. We're so excited it's by like this material. It's a centimetre thick. Yeah. So to have that translucency. Do you know what else I've noticed, Dave, as well? It's a different positioning of the drill hole as it goes kind of horizontally. Yeah. So okay. as not Sorry, to, Adam. Not to spoil, yeah. you know, the... the it's the a panels. hidden... It's because you've got that rim around the outside, yeah. you can actually tie yeah, a cord around yeah, I was the outside of the rim. And then oh, yeah, it. there you go. You can yeah. show that. So it's in the back. It's a seamless, hidden kind of jadeite bale. That's amazing. This uh, is the first piece we're going to start with. Remember, very, very limited. This we didn't have access to the whole boulder. Half of this boulder was sold. I'm going to offer a 30-second clock, and I'm going to make this one available. It's unbelievable, this. How I do you hold your nerve to buy a boulder that you don't I uh, To be honest, uh, like for me, it was like a kid in a beach <laughs> shop because it wasn't my money. You know, Steve was and Bernard yeah. were doing it. And I was like, right, the, these, we trust Bernard. We rely yeah. on the, the, the experience oh. and the, the knowledge of, of these people that understand jadeite better than anyone else yeah. in the world. And, you know, it's just so thrilling and exhilarating to be part of it and to see that it come full circle. And to know that in this instance, yeah, we're that's extraordinarily lovely. lucky, is remarkable. That's lovely to hear from yeah. the very beginning, the boulder, yeah, yeah. To, to this day. Yeah, no other jewellery house that I'm aware of in the Western world has ever done that. Wow. No, inter no intermediaries, this is us. Um, it is 250 carats. That is the same piece on the right. And there's a light just absolutely permeating Incredible. through every single moment of that top crystallization. This, this would just be an ornament for me. I would just I have get this that. I can as get an behind ornament. that, yeah. Mm. 50 mil, literally five centimetres across. Oh, um, but... Yeah. There's 50. There's only 50, yeah. There's no oh, more either. There is no more of this material. I've not ever been offered material like this in the wider market. That's a, another thing to, to reference. That's why we're so excited. The detail. It's unbelievable. Because we got such a good deal on the rough, We've gone up in terms of the, the, the master carvers that we've reached out to to work with it. And it really shows out in this finished offering. You know, every single moment of this, every leaf. I don't know how they do it. I couldn't it draw takes, that day. No way. It takes, yeah. I mean, how many hours, how many days to create something also, of this caliber? Also, where do you begin? Yeah. Do you begin on the uh, in the centre? Yeah, I have no I, idea. You know, how the level of artistry, mm -hmm. um, and I shared some time ago, David, there was an article written uh, Sotheby's writing, and it was Wan How You, mm -hmm. who said that when it comes to jade, I look at it not as a uh, um, um, a work of art rather than a commodity. Yeah, absolutely. Um, because it should have that wow factor. Yeah, and you've got it here. Oh, this is, definitely. This is spellbinding, and there's just three. Very limited opportunities across the board today. Yeah. Very distinct, different opportunities from different boulders. Um, I'll give you a 30 second clock and we'll take you down to, you know, a, a more realistic price point. Although this is realistic in the actual market, we got an amazing deal five years ago on this material. Yeah, I want And you're that. about to benefit from that because of what we do. This, this is the one for me. I tell you what, I, as soon as I stepped into the studio, Dave, and I saw it on the desk, I was like, oh, wow. Yeah. It could also be a peony, couldn't it? Mm. I'm just trying to think of any flower just unfurling. Yeah. It's, it's incredible. Absolutely incredible. Good luck, everyone. There are 50 of these in existence. So from the very beginning, that journey has been. Ross, let's take... This is, this is how wild what we're doing is and why we're so excited, why I've stopped everything that's brought this forward today. I'm going to take £11,000 off the price straight away. And we're miles and miles and miles away from being done. Oh, and nothing has changed. Top crystallization, mm. impressive color distribution, the wet look finish, the, the incredible yeah. worksmanship that even Julie is commenting on here, and the ability for the light to pass all the way through this significant master carving. It really is master carving, absolutely. Again, just a sketch, something yeah. like this would be difficult, let alone yeah. do it in And time consuming. Yeah. And then to think to do it on the world's most expensive canvas. Yeah. 
Because can you imagine you get to whichever point, whether it's from this side out or yeah. the other yeah. way around, and yeah. you break one of those petals. Oh, my word. Yeah. You'd just be heartbroken, wouldn't you? Yeah, absolutely. By the way, we're, we're nowhere near stopping. Even if it sells out and there's Leslie, Rupal, Cheryl, Anne, Jenny, Sheila, Patricia, Maker in Gloucestershire, Valentina, all the way from Vermont. Great to see you uh, this morning, Valentina. You've got Maker in Leicestershire. Um, and, and you can see down to that translucency, it's referred to as aqua jade yeah. on the certification. And these are certified 100% you know, natural in the Far East. Wow. Amazing. This is the material you're about to acquire. Um, Adam, please, may we have another 30 second clock? That's the aqua nature of it, just being demonstrated clearly on the right. Mm, amazing. I mean, even here. Yeah. Like three and me. Yeah, three figures. Do you know what? If you wanted to wear this as a piece of jewelry, the strawberry quartz would be the perfect. Oh, God, on, yeah, imagine. Yeah. Those two together. Plus, you've got your split payment, so you can use uh, break it down into bite sized chunks. Good luck. The only issue is there's not going to be enough of them to go around. No, there isn't. So be quick. Do you know, um, it hit home with me. I'll let the clock run out and I'll tell you. So I've got something to share with you, Dave. Okay, uh, this, this, I'm just, Ross, I'm going straight down to where I know this sells out and I'm going to tell you I'm not done. We're going to go straight down to 299. Not done. 299? 299 and I'm not done. Not 499, not 799. Going straight down to 299 because I know how competitive it is on the front so I want you to know how crazy this deal is going to be. Yeah. So 299 is amazing for this carrot weight, for this detail, for this, everything to do with this. And I'm still nowhere near done. It's one of the biggest carrot yeah. weights we've actually done in a long time yeah. in Master Carvings. And, and beyond that, it's transparent. It's aqua. You know, the light does not struggle to, to, to no. you know, uh, permeate through the crystal of this jadeite. And no, that that's amazing. And the detail in the artistry that we're seeing. Absolutely incredible. Good luck, everybody. Remember, there's only 50 of these. Um, if you want a multi bar, go for it, because I am taking a significant amount off this. Susan, Brian, Patricia, Sheila, Maker, Diane, Leslie, Linda, Rupal, Cheryl, Anne, Jenny, Ron, Maker, Maker, Jackie, Sandra, Valentina in Vermont. You've got two in your basket. Maker in Leicestershire. This is where you decide if this is the one for you. There are three very important carvings mm -hmm. coming your way. This being the largest by a mile yeah. uh, carat weight. Yeah, there's a lot of collectors getting involved. Good luck, everybody. Make sure you check out, get it home. You're gonna fall in love with it the moment you see it. It's mm. absolutely incredible. It's like a lily pad, isn't it, as well? I've, um, I think I've realized what it's called. Ross, can you go, oh, I don't know how you spell it, but it's called a ranunculus, R-U-N. Yeah. It's a member of the it's, it's a poppy it's a member of the poppy family, and it looks just like this. That's wow, just unbelievable, yeah. isn't it? Yeah. The artistry. Love it. You know when point. when when how you was talking about yeah. that wow factor, he was visualizing yeah. this, wasn't he? Yeah. Right there. Good yeah. luck, everybody. Ron, Rosemary, Linda, Jackie, Sandra. So many of you there. But just to show you how good this deal is, we had uh, a similar kind of floral carving in mm. the Olmec Jadeite, which is 50 carats, and that sold out at this price. 50 carats, 200 yeah. carats bigger. And that is the reality. We didn't go to Guatemala. We didn't buy the rough from Guatemala. We went to Myanmar. That's how good these deals are. Yeah. I mean, 299 for a 50 carat Olmec impressive master carving is sensational. We're at 250 carats. And I'm going to ask uh, Adam for a 30 second clock. This is going to disappear and we may never see deals like this again. That's how good it is. We know that the selling price on this should be higher than 299. We know how special material like this is. Mm. I know you know, but because of what we did, there we are able to unlock <gasps> the most sensational deal. Is that the ranunculus? Yeah. That yeah, you can really see um, how this is echoed in the jade as well. Yeah. That's, That's amazing. Beautiful. Lovely plant. Wow. Yeah. yeah. It's, oh my goodness. <laughs> Wow. Okay, 30 second clock. We're taking a significant amount off the price. We should be done here. It probably sells out here, but not today. We are going to give you uh, a, a crazy low deal to kick off this. You know, I wanted to bring something special. We brought this forward. It only arrived in the building this morning or maybe yeah, late last I night. I can see why you're and excited. And you're about to acquire it. Linda, Julie, Maker, Ron, Rosemary, Linda, Jackie, Sandra, Valentina, Susan, Brian, Patricia, Sheila, Maker and Gloucestershire, Diane, Leslie, Rebecca, Linda, someone uh, on the front line's got five in their basket. Leicestershire, you're there as well. 17 of these are left, so good luck. Just 17 remaining. We only had 50. Ross, we, we're going to do something wild. 
We're going to take this one. We're going to take 100 pounds off. We're going to go to 199. We know 50 carats sold for 299. Yeah. We know how important the carving is. We know that this is certified aqua jadeite, 100% natural, grade A, type A, transparent, and everything that goes with it, as well as that 250 wow. carat weight. But also, David, the, the fact that this has been the entire journey, hasn't it? Yeah. It's been from Boulder, that purchase, yeah. the purchase of the unknown, effectively. Uh, uh, for sure, the unknown. I mean, a lot, 90% uh, probably of the jadeite that we've acquired and looked through so far, there's still more to look through isn't of this caliber, isn't of this grade, has had to be treated in some way, whether that's polymer or dye. And that's yep. fine because there's a massive appetite for that you know, globally. Yeah, and, we're and selling you sell that, that back, back into, into the, the market. market. For sure, yeah. no problem. You know, we would have brought that to you genuinely oh. if we hadn't got the, the deals that we did in 2020. And we hadn't turned ourselves into yeah. type A J. Exactly, snobs. which is just <laughs> insane. I'm amazing that we can say that, though, yeah. isn't it? Um, seriously, good luck, everybody. Julie, it's Pamela, Sandra, cool. Jay, Maker, Alexis, Margaret. Um, we've got Rebecca, Maker. Someone dropped seven in their basket. Wow. Um, Leicestershire, you're there as well. We've got a queue. Uh, make sure you're checking out if it's in your basket. It's absolutely incredible, isn't it? Yeah. Amazing. Bidders from California to Vermont and everywhere in the British Isles. Yeah. This is a truly international moment that we're all you know, privy to, that we can all benefit from. Um, but you have to be checking out if that's what you want to do. Amazing. Truly amazing. Well done, everyone that's, uh, that's checked out on this. Um, okay, Ross, we've got, what, 12 or 10 left? Yeah. I'm going to do something unbelievable. Right now. It's going to affect everything else in this show. Oh. There's only 12 remaining. We had 50. Adam, please have a 30-second clock. We're about to destroy the price on this. If, if anything, we should be going up. A lot of you are aware of that. We didn't promote this. There are people right now that are just hearing of this incredible opportunity. And for that reason, that reason only, we're going to take this to uh, a this low deal. There are over 51 people with it in their basket. I'll check out if I was you because we, we don't do things by halves here. We're not just taking five or 10 pounds off. We're going in a massive Absolute way. Absolute madness. So, uh, again, what I was going to share with you. Mm -hmm. Oh, no, I'll wait till the clock goes again. Oh, one second. I do it every time. Three, two, one. Ross, one, four, nine. I know, what? I know, I know. And you know, Ross was there when we brought the Olmec material, 50 carat floral carbon yeah, yeah, for 299. Yeah. This is half the price for more than twice the carat weight. Yeah. Five times the carat weight. In and, what, the and, and genuinely one of, the, one of the most beautiful carvings oh, I've seen. Oh, for sure, yeah. I, I shared this earlier on with Mark. Over the weekend, and you know this story about yeah. the jade carving. I in. do, yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Now, and I've always said to you, it's not the best carving. Yeah. It's not the best. No. Sentimental though. Sentimental, yep. absolutely, that we own. Um, I was looking on first dibs. I saw one on first dibs. Yeah. The same. How much? Five and a half thousand pounds. Yeah. There you go. Probably type B or C. Quite possibly. Probably. You know, we'll have to read the details, but I mean, I've seen sculptures on there for four million. Oh, absolutely. That's dibs. what makes yeah. me think it's yeah. probably great. Uh, you know. I mean, that material is super gemmy though. The four point five million. Yeah, it yeah. Is not so that. insane. <laughs> it's definitely not that. But you know, that's the that's the reality. Whereas the price, here we are now at one four nine. Absolutely, and it's the price madness. differs from type A to type B by ten thousand yeah. times. Ten thousand times. But the point: this is so much better in terms of its carving. Oh, the artistry yeah, on this yeah. is on in line with the sculptures that we brought to yeah. a few months ago. There's eighty two people with it in their baskets, mm -hmm. and one left. Oh, word. Well done. Okay, well done, this is everybody. this is going to set the tone for the rest of this show. Um, we have the bird in bamboo, and we have the floating flower. Again, extremely limited. This is so gemmy. It's a bicolor carving. You can see it's kind of like mm. a bluish color coming through it, and it's got this Amazing. bird. It's got the foliage. It's got all of that carved meticulously into the body of this jade, and then it's got a bamboo wreath or a bamboo frame around the outer. I love the bamboo. Polish. I love the bamboo. Yeah, yeah. so traditional. Um, Symbolic of love, birds and flowers. Oh wow, it's got everything here for me. Isn't it beautiful? Mm -hmm. We're gonna we're gonna bring the graphics in for this. Bicolor bird in bamboo, Taipei jadeite, and with eighty carats from our own rough. You, you, we can't even commission this elsewhere. No. You know, it is transparent or translucent. Totally. totally. Very fine crystallization, which we can see. You can see the actual crystallization of the jade. It's not coarse. It's not chalky. 
It's Double struggling carved to emit well. the light. Yeah, double-sided carving. Again, because it's from our rough, we've, we've managed to secure for you the bamboo, mm. um, the aqua grade of jadeite, which is so difficult to find. When we talk about jade, we talk about it in properties of water, you know, uh, moss in snow, ice jadeite, water jadeite. And water or aqua jadeite should look like a still body of water. And you can see that there. Yeah, you can. There's only 50, and you know how low we went on the previous piece. Look at that. That intricacy, front and reverse. Jenny, you're there. Susan, you're there. Maker and Gloucester's multiple. Leslie, you're there. Yeah, if you see it, you love it, just dial through as quickly uh, as Ross, you can. Ross, straight down, 199. Not even done. Wow. But we, let's give you an idea right now because it is extremely busy. There's a lot of collectors joining us. We've got a floating flower master carving coming up, which is just like as transparent as, as tracing paper. And this piece is outrageous. Outrageous. Maker in five, Linda and I, we're nowhere near done. We are going to do a phenomenal deal for anyone who wants this. This is hand carved, meticulously done, as you can see. Um, so many different disciplines, you know, the open work carving where we are piercing through the jade act, creating like this cutout effect. You've got the, 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 the silhouette and the detail of this incredible bird in the center. And then you've got the bamboo put together all the way around the edge, carved from one single piece of jade eye. And we're already at £49.75 on, on split payments. But because we bought the rough and because we bought it five years ago, we are able to do something rather special. And it's those of you that are on the phone lines that are going to benefit from it. It's those of you that have in your basket that are going to secure this. I'm going to ask um, Adam for a 30-second clock, and we're going to destroy the price. There it is with our you know, unbelievably Perfect. rare strawberry quartz. Perfect. Oh, my goodness. It looks amazing. The perfect colour combination. You knotted this, knotted Marla. Yeah. That is your... Oh, gorgeous. Incredible, wouldn't it? And both completely and utterly natural. Yeah, I just, I just love this combination. Your bamboo, is there something so special about the bamboo I love ones? bamboo in the design. I think it's absolutely beautiful. I would imagine that's a pheasant in the centre. Oh. I would have think. OK, clock's, clock has, has, has stopped. Oh, no. We're at 199. We have, we're going to do it. And, and this will prove to every single one of you how impressive what we do is going direct to the source, taking the risk and securing the rough. And right now, every single one of you is going to benefit from that crazy deal we did all those years ago. It's finally come full circle. It's finally here in the studio. We'll be with you in a matter of days, five years in the making, millions of years before that, uh, geologically speaking, beneath the ground. Ross, I'm actually going to go double figures. We're going to take it pounds off. We're going to go 99 pounds. You've got your split pays as well. Um, they're going to remain. But if you want to get some of the finest jade out we have ever offered from Jempori's own rough that we acquired as part of a joint venture five, six years ago, this is it. You know, no expense spared in the carving, no in the detail. You know, it takes as long as it takes. And this is your chance to secure a legacy piece of jade out for 99 pounds, or I think it's what, 24 pounds something? Yeah, 24, 24 pounds, pounds 75, 75 Interest free pence. split payments. That is absolutely Unmissable madness. at this price. It, it, yeah, it really is. I remember some time ago where the phone lines and website have lit up. Dave, you yeah. were talking about the story of bamboo. Yeah. Uh, uh, and how sort of the older shoots protect the younger shoots. Yeah, I mean, um, it has, amazing. There, there's, so, there's so many stories that are intertwined with jade eye. Yeah. And it's important for us all to, to understand them, to, to, mm. to get to the bottom of them. This is kind of poetry, you know, to have that, yeah. that beautiful bird in the center, to have that frame of bamboo, which, you know, we very rarely see. This is your opportunity. Linda, you've got two. Gloucestershire, you've got two. Janine, you're there. Leicestershire, you're there. Rosemary, you're there. Oh, Lindy, you're there. This is the sensational deal, the penultimate jadeite deal. I'm going to do a minute clock to close out on this one. This is yeah. all we have. This is brand new in the building today from our acquisition we made in 2018. Yeah, wow. Just it's so exciting mm -hmm. to be part of that entire story. That's yes. Incredible with the strawberry course. I agree. Yeah. I agree. It really works, doesn't it? Mm, absolutely. Both type A, effectively, both natural. Be quick, checking out your baskets, though. We only had 50 of each. I say only. That's me being very complacent there, isn't no, it? No, no, no. Look, you're right. You know, we're used to much bigger quantities, yeah. sometimes 300 plus. Today, we have just 14 opportunities remaining. Yeah. And absolutely. we only had 50, which, yeah, is, is, is better than one. But you can see how, how small these, these jade deals are becoming. 
Yeah, truly Vesna, incredible. Vesna, Maker, J, Carol, David, Fund Me, Janice, Maker, Maker. Someone's got six in their basket. We've only got seven available. Valentini, you're back in all the way from Vermont. We've got Maker in California who's checked out. Greater London, Shropshire, West Midlands, Hertfordshire. You've got five, four seconds. Make sure you're securing this. All Make around sure. the world, word has spread, Dave. Yeah. yeah. California getting involved as well. If we'd have promoted something like this, if we'd have been you know, advertising, you know, like Southern Bees do, oh, God, oh we've yeah. got Jade coming up at auctions, then you would have... Oh, well, this would be gone in a second. Yeah. Absolutely. This is, you know, as, as large, as impressive as the other pieces are, um, this is my favourite piece. I think, you know, like I said, me and Mark were both looking at this earlier on. So transparent. The most gem quality it, material. Dark. Yeah. Um, <laughs> So Ross is just saying, just before we get into the last of the jades, mm -hmm. can we just do a stock update? Yeah. The first, that beautiful flower, yeah. at 149 pounds, there's one. Okay, make sure you're checking that out. There's the details on your screens. There is one, and still 55 people with it in their basket. Wow. You can always wish list it too. Yeah, but right now you don't need to. No, you can still, you can get it, absolutely. And the one we've just played, Bird and Bamboo, detail on your screen, there is currently four available. Check that out, we went to £99 Gosh, on the Bird and Bamboo, which is just outrageous. There's a, a lot of you within your baskets. Make sure you're checking that out. The first one, you know, one left, this one, just a few. Make sure you're there securing that. Yeah, good luck, everybody. Now, it this is, is time this for... This is special. Is this the one that you two... Yeah, yeah. we both were looking at. Yeah, it. Yeah, okay. I can it's, see why. You can literally see... Yeah. Your hand oh, through it. My goodness. Yeah, and like I said, if there wasn't the, the detailed carving on this, you could read newsprint through it. It is so finely crystallised. It is, you know, bicolour jadeite with the, the green veining running through it. When we found this in the jadeite boulder, it's one of the most excited we've ever been. And we've commissioned these impressive carvings. The, the green, I mean, you can barely see it because the light's so so uh, harsh in here, but mm. you know, we could see it. We've seen the, the green running through it. And then when you talk about the transparency, it is unbelievable. Right, we're gonna bring this live for you. Only 50 of these available. That's beautiful. Only 50 yeah. of these available. I can and we're see. gonna do something special on this one. This is I'm 20 go carats to... larger than the previous piece. And it's jade unlike we've ever seen, to yep. be honest. Mm -hmm. it's, Floating flower is, is what you know this is deemed in the industry. Of course, on the lab cert, it is talking to the transparency of it again with that aqua uh, notation on the, on the lab report. Aqua jadeite, again, 100 carats, bicolor, which is so, so significant, so special. And you're about to acquire it. And I wish you the best of luck. Good luck, everybody. I've got my torch here as well, if you want me to. Here we go. I can pass just it take to it you. Out, that's okay. There you are. Thank you. I'm going to show you the transparency of this material. Maybe out of the, some of the brighter lights, you might get to see the bicolour nature of this piece, which is just possibly for all to see. You can see, Gosh. for me, you can see the greens here. You can see the greens running right through the middle of this, but it might not show on the screen. When you get it home, it's going to blow your minds. But it's that. Look that, at that. That is just, there's my finger through it. It lights up. Yeah. It's just, it's like a stained glass window. Like I said, without the carving, without that wonderful detailing, you would be able to read newsprint through it. And Dave, you said earlier on, I mean, you're watching, you're holding like a professional jade torch. Yeah, yeah. Here. So you said earlier on, but Bernard was talking about the translucency running deep into the stone. Yeah. I assume like this is one of those. Yeah, well, this is as good as it gets. It doesn't get better than that for jade. Yeah. It's like the jelly bean jade, as they call it, where it's just completely so finely crystallized that you can see entirely through the, the piece. We probably won't ever encounter material like this again. Again, it is the floating flower jadeite, um, which is where it is bicolor. You've got the green running through, not just white jade. Yeah, you can opaque. see it. It's running through transparent jade, yeah. which is sensational. West Midlands, you've multi-bought. Jenny, you've multi-bought. I'm going to tell you where we should be on this piece. And it might sound crazy because we're like, oh, it's 100 carats. Even by jewelry maker standards, Ross, we should be at 249. Can we put 249 on the screen? That's where we should be. It is the, 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 the rarest material that we've seen this morning. It's mm. not the largest, but it is indeed the rarest. That floating flower material with that level of unparalleled transparency. Yeah, it's incredible, isn't it? And that would be an incredible deal. And, but I'm saying to you, we brought it forward. We're offering it to you today. 
and I'm going to ask Adam for a 30 second clock and I'm going to do something really, really, really special on this last piece of our impromptu master carving event. Remember, there are only 50 available. Yeah. Sorry, I know complacent saying yeah. only 50. We're lucky. Um, but it is that quality. Yeah, absolutely. Flow. There you go. This is floating flower, Jada. Thank you, Ross. And if you go further down, the one below that. Wow. The, the next one along. There. Yeah, that's where it's within the body of like really transparent, translucent jade. Yeah. There, this is the material we're talking wow. about. Wow. And we couldn't carve bangles out of the material we had, but what we have done is brought you this sensational carving. I'm gonna do something ridiculous. This is 20 carats bigger than the previous piece, but we always like to go out with a bang. This can make no sense. I hope you're ready to check out. Ross, we're gonna to go to 99 pounds on this. We're gonna match the price of the previous piece. That's what we're doing for you. If you want to get involved, it's 100 carats, average carat weight, but it's the supreme grade of this material. We're going from 249, which is where we should be, to 99 pounds. We're matching the price of the 80 carat bird in bamboo. This is 100 carats, the rarest jade out we've seen this morning. It is so, so unique when you get this home. Good luck. Maker in London, California, Gloucestershire, Caerphilly, Hampshire, Hertfordshire, West Midlands, Multivise in West Midlands, Middlesex, Multivise in Dorset, Susan, Brian. <gasps> in the queue, we've got Linda, we've got Dorothy, Christine, Maker trying to get three, Stephen and Susan and Susan and Essex, Moira, uh, Moira in Perth and Kin Ross, Essex, you're there. <gasps> Do not miss this opportunity. £99 will not be happening again. So I'll be honest, Dave, you completely lost me for a minute because yeah. I was totally looking at this carving and then yeah, I looked yeah. up and it's double figures. £99, yeah. Wow. Flower, Jada. Janet, wow. you're there. Valentina, you're back in. Donna in Wrexham, you can get this. Any one of you that's here can get involved. Good luck. Good luck. Again, with your strawberry quartz, it would be the most perfect combination. Val oh, there's loads of you there. It is so translucent, so fine. Well, I've got, I've got this thought about trying to suspend it vertically. Yeah. Turning the lights off and putting a tea light behind. Yeah. I mean, how romantic. I yeah, just beautiful. Be just lovely, so you it? have the flickering flames yeah. to kind of show off that floating yeah. flower. Just unbelievable, isn't it? What a work of art this would actually be. Um, what this? I imagine being able to say that you're the custodian yeah. of it. You I can try. Oh yeah. I can try. Yeah. Does that work? Oh yeah. Oh look. That, you can, that is a, so, it's such a great idea, Mark. With a Usually we need a professional yeah. jade torch. That's how Light through a jade. To do this with a candle or with, yeah. a, with a, a, a flickering flame. I love that. That <laughs> is how good this jade eye is. Even wow. with a really soft light, it can't be diffused by the, the transparency of this jade right. eye. Good morning, can you get us some jade torches, please? We will try, we will absolutely try. The crazy thing is that jade torch will cost more than this jade. That's how great these deals are. Um, good luck. Yeah. Ten Last left. ten. Last ten of them. Yeah, they're expensive though, jade torches, aren't they? That's what they? I mean, it would cost more than this. Yeah. It's more than the jade. But then that's a tool that you'll have forever. Of, of course, it's an investment for a jade buyer um, because obviously they've got to go and look at the boulders, yeah. they're looking at the rough, they're trying to adjudicate the value of it, and so it's worth more than its weight in gold. You know, a jade torch, a good jade torch like that, a professional one is, like we said, something. Wow. Um, use, your for, use your torch on your phone. That works, doesn't it? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah that but works. obviously when they're thinking of a, a boulder, a big boulder, where, yeah. where you want to see how far the light can penetrate into it, uh -huh. that's why they use a jade torch because obviously that would dictate how good the grade of the jade is. Uh-huh. That. Six of these left, absolutely stunningly beautiful. I'll leave those final. Four? Yeah, they're yeah. not gonna, there's the flowers sold out. Mm -hmm. The bird in bamboo. I think there's still four there, left or something. Three. Three. Yeah, and there's a couple left of the last one. So unfortunately, I am gonna have to love you guys and leave you. No problem. Um, it's been amazing to be with you guys this morning. Um, we're not gonna keep you, I'm sorry for the strawberry quartz. L, I've just been in to speak to Ross. We're gonna do, they're gonna do, these guys are gonna do your apology deals okay. on the strawberry quartz, because I kept you waiting. I just could, I get excited. The plan goes out the window. I wanted to bring you those impressive jadeites, but we're not gonna keep the strawberry quartz from you any longer. The team are, are gonna take you through it. And you have, as always, an amazing masterclass to look forward to at midday. And I'll be seeing you guys very, very soon. Oh, Dave, thank you thank so you. much. Oh, I love the fact that we're that spontaneous and we get to bring master carvings <laughs> like that. Um, the wonderful Dave, I'm sure we'll be back on your screens very, very soon. You've got your beautiful Strawberry Court Showcase coming up. We believe it's the first time we've ever actually seen them in the faceted. A very rare variety of courts. Um, sargonetic courts where natural inclusions occur completely naturally within the gemstone. But remember we said earlier on, red is generally speaking not a colour that forms in 
this family. So very rare, very beautiful, and definitely one that you could use alongside your jadeite carving. So join Mark and I the other side of this. Here at Jewelry Maker, we're always looking ways to make your shopping experience better. That's why on certain items, we've got split pay, where you can spread the cost over two, three, or four months at no extra cost to you. So you can buy your way with split pay. Jewelry Maker has its own dedicated call center with highly trained staff waiting to help you with your orders or any queries. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. It's easy to stay in touch with Jewelry Maker. You can like our Facebook page and join our community of over 69,000 people. You can follow us on Twitter and tweet us your messages and opinions. You can also find us on Instagram and even TikTok. Make sure you get involved and stay up to date with Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Makers, did you know that you can purchase as many times as you like throughout the day and you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee? No matter the size, weight or quantity of your order, how many times you check out that day, we will still only charge you that single P&P. Keep things simple on Jewelry Maker. Did you know that when you purchase with Jewelry Maker, you have a 30-day money-back guarantee? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30-day money-back guarantee, so there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Maker are proud to be part of the Gemporia partnership. Our partnership family includes Jewelry Maker, Gem Collector, Gemporia, Sewing Street, and Yarn Lane. Our friendly and knowledgeable help team are available 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. If you have a question or query, contact us on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Alternatively, you can email or drop us a direct message on our Facebook page. Jewelry Maker, happy to help. Did you know that calls are free from a UK landline and our phone lines are open 24 hours a day, 7 days a week? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Welcome back, everybody. Wasn't that amazing? And don't you worry, those of you that are desperate to see the sort of strawberry courts, we haven't forgotten it. It hasn't been sidelined. It's about to be launched today. Um, do you know, way back when we were in, in Ivy House, um, and I'm going back probably about six years ago, I'm going to say. Um, it was the first time I ever saw Strawberry mm. Courts. And it was a purchase made by Marie, gemologist right. Marie. She yeah. joined me on air and we launched it for the first time. And it was her that actually educated me in the terminology of sargonetic courts. So technically speaking, your golden rutile, your black rutile are sargonetic courts. Right. So courts is that form with an inclusion. But the rarest of all is strawberry. Now, this as, as a gemstone family, so Quartz is a gemstone family, one of the largest gemstone families, 
Um, once upon a time, we used to say that red doesn't happen in, in courses. So, um, but we also used to say things like blue don't happen in mm. your garnets. And then what's discovered? Yeah, yeah. Blue no. garnet. Never say never. But it certainly is the rarest of colours. If you can remember, think back to when Moroccan amethyst was launched to the world. What was so yeah. excited about Moroccan amethyst was it had hematite inclusions inside, which flamed red. And that's a quartz. Incredible stuff. So, yeah, it was like, oh, my goodness yeah. me. It does happen. It does happen. But it is astonishingly expensive and very, very, very rare ordinarily up until jewellery maker. And I just want to show you a few other locations or examples just to sort of highlight and emphasise, really uh, uh, solidify and back up my statement. It is a gemstone that normally fetches a very much considered price point and is usually found at auction houses. So take a little look at this. Now, it is um, quite small in its size. It's sold for 3,000 US dollars and it says rare strawberry, that's the first word they use, yeah. rare yeah. strawberry quartz, a rare quartz for the collectors. This is an exemplary specimen of one of the more important varieties of included quartz, frequently confused by laymen uh, with synthetic imitations. True strawberry quartz is actually a naturally occurring and very rare red stone having inclusions of scintillating hematite needles. This uh, single well-terminated crystal point of strawberry quartz with its su superb luster uh, presents a rare opportunity for the collectors of included quartzes. So it is, I'd say, probably the rarest mm. of yeah, all. Yeah, it sounds like it. Yeah. Um, and it's beautiful. You see where it gets its, term, its name from, strawberry. You have these almost pip-like mm. uh, um, patterns inside, and they are microscopic hematite inclusions, very similar to that what we actually found in uh, your Moroccan amethyst. But I can read on. And that's a specimen, so you're talking a couple of inches, that. Uh, you've got one uh, cabochon, I think it is. Look at the price point. They've got the estimate there between 5,600 uh, to 7,400 pounds. Um, this actually has uh, star oh, inclusion. So those, not only have the hematites coloured its strawberry, they've also given it a star inclusion. It will reach much more than that, I should imagine, at auction. This is back in 2018. Suitable for mounting as a ring or sure to serve as a conversation piece. This gorgeous high dome stone displaying not only an adventurescent effect of time hematite inclusions, but also an unusual, I don't know how to say Trapeche. that, Trapiche mm. uh, phenomenon. What does that mean? Trapiche uh, phenomenon of a six-rayed spoke um, with faint hexagonal lines, irradi uh, sorry, radiating out of the centre. This is an excellent gem for the collectors with phenomenal stones and included quartz. Absolutely beautiful. Um, I can show you other examples like this wow. cat's eye quartz. You can see there sold for one thousand one hundred and thirty-five dollars. Oh, it's positively affordable, isn't it, in comparison? <laughs> Still, uh, you know, 1,000. Um, high dome circular cabochon with a pleasant strawberry red colour and good chatoyancy, weighing in at 30 carats and measuring 17 and a half by 13 millimetres. So we are talking about one individual stone. It's a big stone, don't get me wrong. Um, but, yeah, four figures. And then that was back in 2006. We're talking, you know, almost 20 years ago. Yeah. Moving on, look at that. Sold for £2,400. Um, Creel, Mexico, the original site for this material was discovered in 1960, so very recently, in Mexico. The strawberry court specimen lives up to its name. It's a beautiful colour, reminiscent of fresh strawberry jam. Beautiful, <laughs> absolutely beautiful. But again, I think we've shown somewhere, look at it, three and a half inches. So we're not talking about a large specimen here. No. We're talking about something no. that is much, much smaller, beautiful at the same time. Okay, um, look at this one. Look at the price, 2,000, uh, 2,000 British pounds. Again, from um, Creel in Chihuahua, is that right? Yes, Chihuahua, Mexico. The original site for this material was discovered, it says the same again. Mm. A rare quartz for the collectors, an exemplary specimen of one of the more important varieties of included quartz. For, I think they've pretty much coffee, copied and pasted that. Uh, very rare stone having inclusion, scintillation, and hem hematite needles. Fascinating. Again, that's almost, well, it is, it's 20 years ago when that was sold at auction. Think about what kind of prices these would be fetching these days with inflation, etc. Superb, rare, fantastic strawberry quartz. 
crystal from Mexico, eight centimeters, <laughs> and we're at 6,688 pounds. It's stunningly beautiful. Um, you can see the location, you can see the fact that it is totally and utterly natural. Uh, this material came from uh, sure, one wow. small find <laughs> over half a century ago and considered to be one of the rarest dark red and sparkling, one of the best Mexican strawberry courts available. Yeah, it's absolutely beautiful. From Chihuahua. From Chihuahua. <laughs> now, we are wow. bringing you, here's another example, sold more recently. This is called Aww. Beating Hearts. Isn't that amazing? Sitting on a plinth. How much? 11, no, only $12,000. Wow. Doesn't tell me how big that is no. either, does it? <laughs> it's the kind of thing, can you imagine, I'm gonna, if you had the money, can you imagine, I'm going to buy that and it turns up just like that. <laughs> can you imagine? <laughs> um, that'd be my kind of luck, to be truthful. Back, sold, what, a few years ago. Stunning. I love the fact that it sits on that plinth. Absolutely beautiful. Now, we are launching for the first time the longest strands of strawberry courts we've ever done because they were, tw they were 19 centimetres when we first launched strawberry courts. Oh, yes, yeah. And none of them were faceted. So today is the launch. First time ever bringing you faceted strawberry courts and over, well, double the length, it is double the length. So back in April, we had 10 millimeter rounds, eight mil rounds, and six, that's it. And they were all 18 centimeter strands, which is about that. Today, I have, in terms of sizes, all faceted, 12, 10, eight, six, and four all wow. 38 centimeter strands but less than 50 of each of these available so you do need to be quick i know sorry michael look at that color do you know some of the specimens that we have seen adam this this surpasses it the color actually, saturation yeah. 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 you know that yeah. that beating hearts that we just saw it's beautiful mm. isn't it but this beats the colour. It's a stronger colour saturation, more of your hematite inclusions within. And remember what they said, the finest specimen of, uh, of, of strawberry quartz ever? I mean, big statement, that one. The one previous to this, I think it was. Yes. Oh, yeah. There we go. It's the depth of colour that's giving it that. And they say that, don't they? One of the best uh, Mexican strawberry courts available, dark red and sparkling. These are exemplary, exemplary quality. We are going to start with, did you say the 12 mil? But remember, we've never had a carat weight this scale before here at Jewelry Maker. We've never done 38 centimetre strands in strawberry courts and we've never done it faceted before. There will be collectors, not just our Jewelry Maker wonderful family. We're going to be seeing welcoming collectors across the entire partnership. There'll be collectors from Gemporia. This is hugely successful on Gemporia. I don't know if they've ever done a strand of this size or a necklace of this size. It's going to be welcoming uh, our friends from our Gem Collector channel as well because this is a huge collector they use that word quite frequently, don't they? Collectors, opportunity, rare. Good luck, everyone. Just So just getting the housekeeping out of the way. We've got it in 12, 10, 8, 6, and 4. First time ever being faceted, um, but limited. Now, the 12 and the 10, I've got less than 40. Oh, gosh. In the world. <laughs> in the world. That's not 40 scheduled for another day, another occasion. That's 40 in the world. Auction is open. We've brought you strands of strawberry quartz before at 19 centimetres. This is 38 centimetres. It's natural in its colour. And you are getting a full 20 centimetres more. We have never had them in 12 millimetre size. Never had them faceted either. They would go perfectly alongside the jadeites. If you've got any of those carvings earlier on, I think this is an absolute must. It's just beautiful, beautiful saturation, and it is totally natural. Once upon a time, the gemolo gemolo uh, gemological world said, no, you don't get red in quartz. They also said, no, you don't get blue in garnet. <laughs> you know, and what happens? You get red in quartz, you get blue in garnet. It is one of the rarest varieties. Um, and commands are pretty... Uh, um, well, you think about red beryl. 
Absolutely. The yeah. prices, yeah. it really reminds yeah. me of Red Barrel, actually, yeah. and the prices that Red Barrel fetches. Good luck, everyone, because we've got less than 50 available. We could all day long stop here. That would be an unbelievable deal when we've just been flicking through various different auction houses and prices that we've seen sold for X, sold for, uh, sold for Y. Uh, none of them were double figures, were they? They were all four figures. And you're talking like a couple of inches in terms of its, in terms of its size. There's only one of those available. It's regarded as the best because of that intensity of colour, those natural reds. Gemol uh, gemologists will refer to it as a sargonetic. The more red rather than pink, the more desirable. There was only 40. USA, UK getting involved. Amazing to be with you. First time ever bringing it to you in a 38 centimetre strand and first time ever in your faceted rounds. Wow. Were you expecting that, Mark? No. That's incredible. £99 for a full 38 that... centimetre strand, plus you've got yeah. your split payments. Remember, this does have a knock-on effect with all the other strands as well that we bring to you. Um, they're all very, very, very limited, 50 or less. Um, like I said, significant, uh, significantly less on this one. Ross, you haven't put them on pre-order though, have we? What? I'm sorry, no. You the boss. They're on pre-order, but we've got less than 50 of each of them. Oh, he's brave. Now, Dave said just before he left the, <laughs> left the studio, ah, uh, yes, he did. Sorry, he said to Ross, do apology prices. Um, he picked up Ross's star buy sheet and he made a few alterations. Okay. Apologising for bringing you something that has literally just landed, which, you know, he doesn't need to apologise. Isn't that known as producing from the floor? What, Dave? Mm. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. He said what? Last time we had strawberry quartz, he said ten, we had 10 millimetre, 8 millimetre and 6, and they were 19 centimetre strands, yeah. Sorry, 18 centimetres. Shall we match the price on the faceted 12 mil, but 38 centimetres? No but for what you paid on the 10 mil smooth rounds. <laughs> Does that make any sense to you whatsoever, what I just said? Oh, so double the, double the length. Half of the price. Half, bigger cat size oh, too, because yeah. you just said 10 mil. Gosh. Yeah, these are 12. So the 10 mils that we had back in, was it March? April, beg your pardon, was what? 110. We've got 375 carats in this strand. But we will match the price of the 10 millimetres, half the length, bigger, triple the carat weight, over triple the carat weight. Apology deals from yours, uh, from the wonderful Dave Troth, everyone. Good luck. Minute clock on your screens. Again, this very much has a knock-on effect with all your other strawberry quartz opportunities. Shop ahead. I'm really surprised that uh, Roscoe's put them on pre-order. Plus, you've got your 0% interest split payment. Well done, Valerie, Jenny, Susan, Gillian, California, Nora, Valerie, Oxfordshire, new customers getting involved. If you want your 10, your 8, your 6, your 4, we're bringing those to you. But no, it's 50 in terms of quantity or less to guarantee your success you need to be checking out nice and early you know again you know when we show you these prices they're not pie in the sky these are if you research strawberry quartz and make sure it is certified completely natural not imitation like they said at the beginning yes, yeah. that's so 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 important that you are looking at the the genuine real deal like what's on your screens right now and ideally get the laboratory cert Unlikely that you're going to be seeing it anywhere near double figures, especially 12 mils, especially with that deep red. Where is he going? Apology deals, apparently. <laughs> so, let me just show you this. Hang on. I'm fairly sure somewhere there's a ruler, isn't there? I can guess. That's about, would we agree? That's about 18 centimetres. That's crazy, isn't it? Yeah. That, last time, in 10 millimetres, non-faceted, smooth, was £79 
today purely because Dave had to get off and, uh, uh, and, and yeah, uh, couldn't complete, stay with us for this show. So I do apology deals on this one. You get 38 centimetres and we've matched that price. Double the, uh, triple the carrot weight, double the length, natural colour and faceted. Fiona and Valerie, oh. well done. Gail, Jay, Surrey, well done. New customers getting involved. I'm going to dive into the 10 millimetres. Again, they are all 38 centimetre strand. And I'm going to lay them all up together because look how beautiful that They're is, lovely, Mark. They're gorgeous. I'd love to see. You know, you said about the Botswana Marla. Mm, Botswana Marla. Can you imagine a yeah. strawberry quartz Marla? Knotted with some of your beautiful cord that's launching to the yeah. world. I think which I'd go for turquoise, I think. Like that, that teal, like your bracelet colour, I think. Yeah. That looked really nice, knotted in between. Beautiful. Now, even here at £1,976, that's an absolutely unbelievable deal, isn't it? We're talking about the 10 mils right now. Good luck and well done to those of you that got hold of the 12. It does tend to have a knock-on effect, doesn't it, Roscoe? We'll do it in one price crash. Straight away, collector say, not leaving this to chance. You've got, right, we're in the same size that we had back in April. But again, instead of being 19 centimetres, you've got 38. Instead of being 110 carats, you've got 250. And instead of being 79 pounds, you're, you're at 69 pounds with split payment as well. Natural certified yeah. strawberry quartz, those beautiful hematite little pips that give you that wonderful inclusions. Uh, Susan, Jenny, maker in Nottinghamshire, London getting involved, multi buyers on your screens as well. Would you team it? Would you contrast it with other gemstones? Would you use it with maybe? Because oh, yeah. you, you mentioned this teal. How yeah, about yeah. the most gorgeous Peruvian yeah. turquoise strand that we've got coming up? Works, doesn't it? Absolutely works. Now, they are the most limited now. <laughs> here at Jewelry Maker, Mark, you and I have, well, we've all been here a period of time, haven't we? One thing, you know, your Jewelry Maker crew tend to stay. We do tend to stay. <laughs> um, it's a nice place to work. But of these, we've learned from experience there are certain sizes yeah. that are more desirable than well, others. Well, between us, you and I have been together 21 years together. Yeah. So that's, yeah, it's amazing. 21 it? years. Yeah. How long have you worked here, Michael? Uh, maybe eight years. Eight yeah. years. Adam, how long have you worked here? About, about since 2016, yeah? Nine. That makes sense. Nine years. 29 plus nine, 38. And Roscoe? Ross. Five years, years 43 us, years. We, would we all agree <laughs> that we know 864, the most popular size, aren't they? Yeah, 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 yeah. We all agree? You know that. We know that. No, not your 16 mil, although they're lovely. <laughs> Eight, six, and four, the most popular yeah. size. Now, we, when we launched, and I know I keep harping on about this, but when we had strawberry quartz back in April, they were half the length, half the size of these strands. They weren't faceted. And also, we've surpassed the prices that we were bringing back in April. Now, these are flying on pre-order. Let's dive into the eight mils, and I'll be bringing you your six mils and your four mils too, because they're super wearable, aren't they? I mean, an eight mil... In Amala, how beautiful. Now, we have 50. It's the biggest quantity that we have of the entire strawberry quartz opportunity. The likelihood, if you're thinking, I've never seen strawberry quartz before, but it's incredibly rare. Don't be fooled by the terminology quartz or the gemstone family name quartz. Quartz as a mineral is not rare. Quartz as a gemstone is incredibly rare. And that's what we are looking at here. Gem quality, the highest quality, the rarest variety of all your quartzes. Um, apology deal, says Dave. We've got a bigger quantity, marginally, and we're going to do some apology deals. Doesn't make any sense. Does not make any sense. 
You know, sometimes when you go to like, a, I don't know, an event and it's it's running late or whatever, or you might go to a concert or something like that and the artist is late. Mm. Do you think they go, I'll tell you what, apology deal, we'll give you a percentage of your ticket back then? No, they won't. No, train no. delays, do they no. do that? Let's just give you a, let's, let, let's give you a percentage no. of your ticket back. Has to be a certain period of time before they do. Half and an flights. Hour. Half an hour at least. Is it? Train. And mm. flights, it's five. Mm. Five hours. Oh. <laughs> five hours or something like that before they will. We're bringing you one of those beautiful, beautiful, rare opportunities. We're already bringing you amazing deals because we've doubled the length. And we're at 49.99. Eight mil, mm. six mil, four mil still to come. 50 or less in terms of their quantity, those beautiful, like, yeah, like strawberry jam, delicious. It's a gorgeous colour, isn't it? It's and soft. natural. It's a very soft colour. Totally natural. Ross says, okay. I can hear tapping. He's crunching numbers. Are you a typist? I'm not too bad. Yeah. Not too bad. Yeah. Probably, I was probably faster when I worked in the office, but right. if you don't do it, you still Andrew don't. touch types. It's weird because he's at his monitor and he's just tapping away, tapping away. He's not even looking what he's doing. Yeah, he's no, I do impressed. have to look. Yeah, I do. Uh. Um, he's crunched the numbers. Mm -hmm. Ross is just saying, I'm just making sure the price that Dave gave oh, this, Ross. These, the, the whole range is a Dave baby, is it? Yeah. Right. Ah. Uh, can you do what Dave said? <laughs> He says, it's, it's worrying, but we're going to do it. He says, I think Dave has put these in thinking they're, they are your, your 18 centimetre strands. Oh, gosh, right. OK, but they're not 18 centimetre strands, are they? They're 38. I think for me what's more important is the fact they're faceted, yeah. not the length of the strand. Yeah, that's true. I mean, the that's fact incredible. that you've, cut, you've yeah. cut some of the carrot weight. Do you notice all those are specimens? Yeah. You know, and they're not faceted, are they? No, you know, no. they are celebrated for being their sort of, their, you know, their terminations, their crystal structures. You might have a bit of polishing on there, but they haven't faceted them because they are incredibly rare as they are. In 31 seconds, we've crunched the numbers and Ross says, yep, I can confirm we're going to do what Dave said. He walked through the gallery, made a few notes, Oh, really? You think he thought they were 18 centimetre strands as opposed to being 38? Oh, no. Elizabeth's multi bought, Gillian, Jenny's multi bought, Susan's multi bought, Liz's multi bought, Nottinghamshire, Stephen and Susan and Karen and Pauline and Jackie and Derbyshire. He was in a rush. Where was he rushing off to? Do we know? Jade meeting? Probably. Probably he's a busy. He's oh, no, he one hundred percent thought these were eighteen centimeter strands. If that's the price that Dave gave you, twenty nine ninety nine for natural certified Sargonetic strawberry quartz, a full thirty eight centimeter strand as opposed to being your eighteen centimeters and faceted as you say, Mark. Look at that wow. berry light colour. Um, again, we're going back to extremely good and rare strawberry quartz with hematite inclusions, polished crystal, um, a rare old time example of strawberry quartz from Mexico. This incredible specimen uh, owes their unique colour and scintillating internal sheen to a network of fine reddish needle like inclusions like that. A network. A network. Um, yeah. This material came from just one small find over half a century ago and considered to be one of the rarest dark red and sparkling oh. strawberry quartz available. And they're talking about this rich colour, so the more of those scintillating internal sheens from a network of fine reddish inclusions, um, the more of those, the deeper the colour will be. Um, they're flying out. This is the most affordable price tag we believe we've ever done on red, uh, on red quartz, yeah, of the two parcels that we've actually, or big parcels, I should say. Um, we took the six millimetres to 39.99 oh, and they were not faceted, uh, were not faceted and they were not a 38 centimetre okay. strand. You've doubled the, the actual length effectively. Um, we had 50 or less. Is that the case? Yeah, okay. And there's still loads of you with it in your basket. We haven't got 50 reserved for another occasion, another show. 
Six mils are up next. Start shopping ahead on those because you know the kind of price points that we're doing today. So if you want the six mils, if you want the four mils, they are, I can say it, it's actually a, a, an avalanche. You've done an avalanche, an avalanche. on raspberry quartz. Uh, raspberry quartz? Strawberry quartz. I don't know where raspberry came from. Just shouting out fruit today, aren't I? <laughs> <laughs> Love it. Let's bring you the six millimetres. Um, 60 second clock on your screen. Let's give you a... A minute warning, not warning, that's the wrong word, heads up. That's your call to action for when the graphics will appear on your screens. Um, no, I, I always give you the housekeeping where possible. We've got 50 or less. In fact, I can probably tell you exactly how many we've got. Uh, 48. I've got 48 of these. They're going to sell out though. Because you know that it's going lower than 29.99. You know it's double the length of the last showcase that we had of Strawberry Quartz. Certified natural, this isn't included, uh, sorry, this isn't treated or fisher filled in any way, shape or form. The inclusions make those beautiful colours. In 14 seconds, we're taking the six millimetre. Is that the quantity that I've shopped ahead and pre-ordered? Wow. Uh -huh. Okay, yeah, they've proven very popular on pre-order. Oh, it's like strawberries and peach. Uh -huh. Mm. 24.99 wow and these absolutely erupted on the launch back in uh, april for strands that were effectively that length without a single facet were higher priced than what's on your screens so we get a great deal you get a great deal now you don't just get that length you get that 38 centimetres, natural in their colour, lots of multi-buyers getting involved, absolutely incredible. Again, I'm inclined to go to reach for the Peruvian turquoise that we've got coming up. We're going to do some absolutely unbelievable deals um, on some of the rarest, most beautiful collectible stones. Yeah, it looks amazing, doesn't it? Alongside Peruvian turquoise. Elizabeth, Isle of Man, Susan, Gillian, Susan and Stephen, Susan, Jane, Julie. Um, it's going to look like what? The blue and the reds. Oh, do you mean the Harry Winston ring? Yeah, Sleeping Beauty with, um, that's with like a mandarin garnet. Yeah, so yes, yeah. it's a kind of inspired by that, that wonderful sort of quite opposites on the colour wheel. Um, well, last one of your strawberry quartz. Now, these are your four mils, Mark, micro crisscross. Mm, absolutely. Have you ever done a micro crisscross with your strawberry quartz? No, I've never, I've never been, in, well, I don't think I've ever been in the room with strawberry quartz. Beautiful, isn't I don't, it? I don't own any strawberry quartz. Isn't it lovely? Mm. I love this strand. I like the different colours in the in the strand. I love four mils. Yeah. You do, don't you? Yeah. 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 Four mils, my favourite yeah. size, because I think you can build it up. It's versatile. You can keep it really simple. You can do lots of techniques like oh, your beady beads and your looming and your kiss cross. In 41 seconds, this is flown on pre-order. Oh, my goodness. Uh, flown on pre-order. I've got, what, 48 again. Is that right? Yeah. 48 available. Use this time wisely to make sure that you don't miss out on this opportunity. You can see on this recording the tiny, tiny, tiny yes, microscopic yes. hematite inclusions, and that is what turns this beautiful gemstone into that natural strawberry colour. Um, there's less than 20 of these already, so lots of you have you know, used the initiative and shopped ahead. Um, 48 is not going to be enough, not when we're bringing you double the length, first time ever facets, same amazing quality, a rare gemstone. They use that word rare in every single description of your strawberry quartz that you found elsewhere. And some of them weren't even faceted. They were specimens. No. <laughs> you know, not pieces of jewellery. They were just kind of, I don't know, ornaments, effectively. What? $19.99? Goodness me. It's not... Laughing, this is it? not at the beginning of that uh, you know of that presentation they said be mindful because there's imitations out there why do they imitate strawberry quartz because it's rare it's rare and it's beautiful and people will pay you know considered amounts of money for it this is not 
imitated. It is totally natural, laboratory certified. It's just madness that we're bringing it to air for under £20. Isle of Man, Kent's got two, Liz, Stephen and Susan, uh, lots of repeat purchases as well. So um, wonderful if you're getting a collection of these as well. Samantha Karen, hello to you, Merseyside, Frida, Ruth, Ayrshire, London's getting two, Jenny and Dorset's getting two, Susan, well done. Melanie, sorry, uh, Dorset, good luck. Now coming up in one auction's time, I want to oh. show you the these turquoise Lovely. these are your peruvians aren't they peruvian turquoise um so i've got them in two different sizes four millimeters and also three millimeters the price on these are absolutely unbelievable i've got 50 of each of these available um and i'm going to say this quite a big statement now this is one of the rarest colors of our universe That's gorgeous. yeah i'll explain some more during that auction opportunity mm. it's coming up as a big star buy one of the maddest deals on turquoise you could possibly imagine um did you hear me gasp mid-auction mid then <laughs> i kind of went, oh, oh yeah oh sudden intake of breath rather special isn't it and this is one of the larger bangles as well oh my goodness me you know it's not that's all natural this is not dyed it's not reconstituted it it yet yeah, that color certified totally and utterly natural so going back to sorry roscoe one more just one more time go back to that last article that talks about the best example yeah now at six thousand six hundred and eighty eight pounds this specimen they say extremely good and rare strawberry quartz with hematite inclusions polished crystal um the uh, all uh, sorry broken english this a rare old time example of strawberry quartz from mexico these incredible specimens owe their unique color um, and scintillating internal sheen to a network of fine reddish needle-like inclusions this material came from just one small find over half a century ago and is considered to be one of the rarest dark red and sparkling so i assume they're talking mexican quartz it's the color the intensity of that strawberry color i'm going to stick my uh, um my neck on the line here and say that's one of the deepest color strawberry quartz yeah, pieces i've yeah, seen it's incredible isn't it do you see where i'm coming from how many have we got ross 25 available oh. out of 108 that we once upon a time had. Natural. Look at that. It's amazing, isn't it? Wow. Natural hematite inclusions produce this beautiful strawberry colour. Can you see the scintillations inside? Just ever so slightly, they kind of twinkle a little bit. A bit like your adventure essence does. You have these wonderful kind of twinkling inclusions inside totally natural what is that start price what is that start price you know we i i, I think what i thought maybe closing at 299 <laughs> did you launch this yeah ross launched it was i with you on this launch Oh, what happened? What happened? Because I don't remember. I've slept since then. Oh, no. I can't believe this, Mark. I can't believe we, we, we started at some random 200-odd number. I would have, if this had closed at 299, because this is, you know, it, it is the rarest example. Oh, no. So Ross has just said, ignore that price. I remember what happened. We closed this auction... Got a little gas bubbles in there as well. Oh, amazing. At 129. Yeah. Oh, and no. then Dave did a deal wheel, did he? You've got a great memory, but he didn't realise what percentage that deal wheel went to. And of course, the fact that everybody oh, got it. He no. thought it was just one customer, didn't he? That's right, I remember. He thought it was just one customer got that deal wheel. 
So he spun it. Oh, did he? That's not what he thought. Of course, it landed. He it was one customer. And yeah. It was all of them. Yeah. And it landed oh, on 30% oh, no. the highest number. Yeah. <laughs> so he was like, what? Oh, he gets on board, though, doesn't he, Dave? So instead of closing this, the only strawberry quartz bangle that we've ever had here at Jewelry Maker should have closed at 129, which is insane for everybody. Instead, we took 30% off. That's why it's a random price, okay. Yeah, that is a random <laughs> price, isn't it? 90 pounds and 31 pence. Looks very strong and tough to wear. As a, well, as quartz a, they, they wouldn't do it as a bangle, would they? Quartz 7.5 on the most yeah. scale. It's right up there, yeah. isn't it? Yeah. Absolutely. I love and it's a large bangle too. So if you struggle, struggle with some of the jadeite bangles, then try this one. It's a bigger diameter. Um, and you've got your split payments. Well, that's because it was meant to close at £129. £22.57 pence only. Or maybe we should actually brief Dave, shouldn't we? <laughs> we should brief him before things like this. Good luck and well done. How many do we have left? 14 left within the vault. Pauline, Gillian, Grace, Gail, Patricia, Jenny, Maureen, Elizabeth, Maker, Melanie, Julie, Jay, Gail, uh, Barbara in West Midlands as well. People still on the phone lines. I've got, I've got a, deli uh, a, a delay. A delay. A delay. <laughs> <laughs> I've got a delay. A delay on Michael's screens. Um, hello, Alison. It oh. went low enough for me to buy two so I could decide which one I like best then. Actually, I kept both, yeah. Well, that's the kind yeah. Of, do you know what, Alison? That's the kind of thing I would do. That's the kind of thing I would do. Oh. Um, I have one of these bangles, superb colour. Yes, I totally agree. They are stunning. Lovely, and it's it? natural. It's yeah. absolutely natural. Look at the split payment. Would you wear them together, Alison? I'd, I'd be putting it alongside maybe the, um, you know, my jade bangles, like whether that's your nephrite or whether that's your jadeite or whether it's your broncharonyx. Hiya, Grace, OMG, thank you for this bangle. That's crazy. I know, absolutely. Um, actually, Grace, you can thank our, our Dave for this because he didn't realise the wheel deal actually applied to everybody that was getting involved <laughs> in the auction. So loving that. Well done, folks. Now, it is time for an absolutely awesome star buy. The world knows that uh, turquoise, well, we've always, we've got a history of gems, this gemstone. It's been treasured, adorned, and loved for thousands upon thousands of years. And we know that turquoise forms in lots of different locations around the world, all very shallow forming, all incredibly rare, all usually very pricey. Just you wait. Okay, so some time ago, Celeste, some time ago I spoke to you, sorry, I was just answering Ross then. Um, I launched a parcel of turquoise and it sold out in a heartbeat. And this is part of that same parcel. Now, what's really exciting, like I said a few months ago, you can get turquoise from pretty much many planets, uh, many countries around the world, rather. Many planets, many countries. Um, and it tends to be a gemstone that forms in very dry and arid areas, so sort of where the landscape was kind of craving some kind of moisture, like Arizona, for example, like Mexico, like Tibet, very dry, arid areas. Um, but these, this is a gemstone that is very shallow forming. So if you think about diamonds, for example, they're massive, vast open pits, aren't they? Mm, yes. um, or tanzanite where they're digging uh, vertical shafts, you know, equivalent to almost the, the height of the Burj Khalifa, you know, staggering how deep some mines go into the earth. Whereas turquoise, your malachites, your opal, are very shallow forming. Now, it's great, I guess, in terms of accessibility. However, it means there's less, far less of it available. Turquoise also forms in um, where moisture is kind of trickled down. 
between cracks within the actual host rock itself. And if you go to USA, you'll be able to pinpoint usually you'll be able to say oh that's usa turquoise because it's got that kind of blue you might even be able to decipher what the uh, um which mine it is from the patterns of the host rock itself certainly when you start talking about your mexican turquoise your tibetan turquoise or your peruvian turquoise now they are very 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 distinctive um, and peruvian turquoise as i said a few moments ago is one of the rarest colors of Mother Nature. Because if you've heard of the terminology celeste, celeste translates to heavens. Mm -hmm. And if you ever Google celeste blue, it will show this exact color. In terms of gemstones, in terms of flowers in terms of birds of paradise whatever it might be it has been proven celeste heaven blue translates as one of the rarest of all colors in existence and that's the color that peruvian turquoise sells out at here's here it is that's it roscoe so peruvian turquoise and the reason why it sold out the last time i launched this parcel was because it's a colour that we not only don't see very often in turquoise, we don't see in any gemstone or any flower. And it can command pretty much whatever price point it wants. It's my favourite colour of all turquoise because it's so distinctive. It's very soft, isn't it? It is. Lovely. Soft is the perfect yeah, word. Yeah, Take yeah, a look, just yeah. a bowl of, of Peruvian turquoise, large stones. But there it is, that colour. And try and imagine, Mark, I mean, you're, you're an amazing gardener. Um, horticulturalist. There aren't any flowers that colour. No col flowers no, that colour. You think like about anybody rainbow. that's good yeah. with the wildlife and, and birds. Are there any colour uh, uh, birds that colour? Very few. No. Um, I mean, look how beautiful this. And I'm just showing you pictures that I've sort of pulled off the internet that describe Celeste as a colour. So this might be, I don't know, a wallpaper or something like that. Moving forward. Look at that. Maybe that could be the only thing that could be described. Sorry, go back one. Only thing that could be described as Celeste Blue. But actually, if you physically cupped that water, it's not that. It's, no, it's no. not Celeste. It's clear, isn't it? Right, absolutely. Moving on to the next, the beautiful roses. But they don't form that colour, do they? <laughs> They're actually treated that colour. Yes. Oh. Beautiful. Cute. Heavenly blue. Celeste Blue. Peruvian turquoise. Now, I'm bringing it to you today in the two different size, the four and the three. They are totally natural. With such a rare colour saturation, these haven't been dyed, these haven't been polarimpregnated or, or, or I, I don't know, reconstituted. This is how they form. That's why Peruvian turquoise is considered to be one of the most treasured because it has that celeste heavenly blue. Now we are going to do, it's going to sell out. I can tell you that for certain. I'm imagining putting this with the, with the dark Zambian amethyst. Oh, that would be lovely. Wouldn't it? Yeah, uh, beautiful. Love combination. Lovely. Or maybe like a white, white pearl. Oh. Mm. That would be nice. Just Very thinking romantic. back to that image yeah. where there's one yeah. single white flower perched on the yeah. celeste blue waters, but actually the reality is they're not celeste blue. No. no. They're crystal clear. No, yeah. It's the reflection of the sky, isn't it, that turns it that yeah, colour. That's right. Now we have 50 of each of the size. I'm going to start with the 4 mil and then we're going to step into the 3 mil. The last time I had the privilege and honour of actually bringing you your four millimetre celestial blue Peruvian. Do you notice I have to, I have to say it all? <laughs> I do. Um, last time I brought you your celestial blue Peruvian turquoise was a sellout. We have 50 available for you today. I personally believe this is one of the most beautiful colour saturations in existence. You know? Here we go, heavenly. Celeste is a light turquoise blue color inspired by the color of the sky. It is based on the Italian word celeste, meaning heavenly. This is compar um, comparable to other colors inspired by light blue of daytime skies, um, such as sky blue and the Japanese color Sora. 
Oh, I've not heard of that. Sora. Oh. It's a heavenly. The moment the graphics appear, if you're loving your your uh, Peruvian turquoise, then make sure you're dialing through um, as quickly as you possibly can. There are only 50 available. Natural colour, one of the world's rarest <coughs> colours in existence. The graphics are live. Look at the starting point. My goodness me. This is not Fisher Phil treated, reconstituted. It's natural. The phone lines have lit up in a heartbeat. Um, yeah, to, to bring you the size, the color, the beauty that Peruvian turquoise is, totally and utterly natural. And you might be thinking right now, actually, Elle, there's this, because I think last time we spoke about Celeste Blue, somebody said, no, this form, so I can't even remember what it was. But I was like, okay, I'm not saying it doesn't exist. I'm holding no, something that no. actually forms in Celeste Blue, but I'm saying it's one of the rarest colors in Mother Nature. Okay, good luck. First price crash, and not where we are closing. Turquoise from wherever, whether it's Mexican, Tibetan, USA, Peruvian, wherever it's from, is expensive because it is so shallow forming. Triple figure prices and then some. First price crash. Good luck, everyone. A massive congratulations to those of you that have already multi-bought and checked out. There were 50 in existence. Can you believe we're here? Will you imagine there to be a digit in front of that number? Yeah? Will you imagine this to be a three, I don't know, 129, 119 pounds? Because I would. And that's an amazing deal. It's shallow forming. We haven't got to dig to thousands of meters below, beneath the Earth's surface to source this gemstone. Yeah, which might think, yeah, great, that's fantastic. Much easier to get hold of. Yeah, but it means it's far less of it available. Yeah. Far, far, far less of it available. We're at 19.99, and that is our starting point. We had 50. They will sell out today. Beautiful faceting. You'll have, I mean, we've all got our favourites, haven't we? Some will like Sleeping Beauty, some will like Kochi, some will like Kingman Turquoise, some will like Mexican Turquoise um, because it's more green. Some will prefer the glow, the lure of your Celeste Peruvian Turquoise. I have to say it's probably my favourite out of all of them. I absolutely love it. Um, yeah. it, it. It's not a gemstone, though, that's normally 20 quid. In 30 seconds, we're taking it even lower. Nottinghamshire's got two, London's got two, Fife, London, Ruby, Geraldine's multi-bought, Linda's multi-bought, Dorothy, Soraya, Julie, Sheila, Jane, Susan, Barbara, Samantha, amazing, well done. There's a bit of a queue forming, but it's not massive, so you can still do it. Shop with us via the web or the app if you want. Julie and Durham, you've got yours, and maybe pre-order. Can we do it? Shop ahead on the three mils too? Yes, uh, knowing that they are very limited. They will sell out today. There's no if, buts, or maybes about it. Nobody is paying $19.99. 35 carats of natural, celestial blue, Peruvian turquoise for £14.99. <laughs> Can you imagine this in a tassel? You know, in Tiffany's and Co., you know when they were like imagining their branding? Do you think it was on the back of seeing a Peruvian turquoise? <laughs> Do you know what I mean? Uh, it is, it, it's such a beautiful colour saturation when they were imagining their little, because it's, it's not Sleeping Beauty Blue, is it? No, 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 no. Yeah, that's actually that, much um, darker. Well, I thought it was Amazonite when I came in this morning. It's got yeah. that Amazonite yeah. tone to it, doesn't it's it? It's more pastel, isn't yeah. it? Much more pastel. It's gorgeous. If you think, it, maybe you own yeah. a Tiffany's jewellery box, it's much more pastel. It's much more like these colours behind us. Um, softer. Well done, everybody. Sold out. Congratulations to you all. You are now the custodians of one of the rarest colours in existence. Now, we're not done yet, though. These are cute. <laughs> oh, you could loom a bracelet. You, you could, could do a simple stretchy bracelet. That's nice, isn't it? You could tassel, use them as an alternative to knotting. They go perfectly with your cord they coming up in the next hour, beautiful. Mark. Yeah. What, what um, colour wire would you use? What metal? 
Normally, I would say yellow gold. Exactly. But I with this, I'm, I'm leaning toward rose yeah, or silver. I would, the I'd softer colours. Well. Yeah. But I think they would work with them all. Yeah. Do you know what, Mark? That, yeah. on, a, that on elastic. I just love that as it is. Really. Me simple. too. This look, yeah. this whole get up. Love all that. Put it either side. Put it either side. Oh, yeah, look. Oh, look at that. That's perfect, isn't it? Absolutely yeah. amazing. Already the phone lines have completely lit up. The last one sold out three millimeters. You can treat in the same way that you can do your four. Still got the drill hole. Heavenly celestial blue, described as a light turquoise blue inspired by the colors of the sky. Based on the Italian word celeste meaning heavenly, this is comparable to other colors inspired by light blue of daytime clear skies, such as sky blue and the Japanese color Sora, if I'm pronouncing that right. But it is, without doubt, one of the world's rarest uh, colors in existence. And that's flora, fauna, birds, gemstones mm. flora and fauna yeah, encompasses yeah, yeah. birds yeah. doesn't it but you get where i'm coming from um and your gemstones uh, the graphics are live good luck we've got 50 yes 50 available and let's start moving our way towards your amazing price point um already people multi-buying on this tassels, tassels. lovely tassels. tassels rosary link really fine rosary oh, link nice. that'd be beautiful wouldn't it yeah 19.99 do you think we're stopping there though mark I wouldn't have thought so. Probably not, because the four <laughs> mil were actually less than that, weren't they? So, you know, you can wait until we introduce that price onto your screens, or you can make your confirmation, guarantee your success, and know that everybody pays the final low price tag. It's been months since I've actually had the opportunity, the privilege, frankly, of talking about Peruvian turquoise. I absolutely love it. Um, another price crash. Do you think we're stopping there? <laughs> Perhaps should be. Addy boy. Oh. Uh, minute clock, Addy boy. Addy boy. Yeah. Oh, and you're Rossi boy, right? I'm saying. Oh. <laughs> the love is strong in the gallery. <laughs> Let's put a 60 second clock on our screens. And can we just flick through those beautiful colors? Yeah. It doesn't really matter what they are or it's just, it's all about that Celeste blue. Can we go through those, Russ? You know, from the pebbles, the bowl of pebbles, of pe which are Peruvian turquoise, of course. Oh, it's, it's having a funny five oh. moments. To the little white flower floating in the perfect celeste blue. But we know when we actually cup the, that, you know, that water, it's not celeste blue, is it? It's crystal clear. We're going even lower, 14.99. Julie's got four. Susan and Brian multi-bought. Kathy's got three. Jenna Weaver, Patricia, Gary, Gillian, Chantal multi-buying. Samantha multi-buying. Geraldine multi-buying. Carmen and Norman. Uh, good luck, everybody. I mean, it's great, isn't it? Turquoise for 14.99, wherever Crazy. the location. Yeah, it's mad. Twelve ninety nine only. I quite fancy going to Peru for a holiday. Yeah, me too. I think it'd be fascinating. Isn't there like it? a um? Isn't there a trail that you can yeah, walk? Yeah, yeah, me too. Yeah, yeah. Oh. Some of the best restaurants in the world in Peru. You can go on a trek, can't you, mm, in Peru? Yeah. I'm not a fan of llamas, though. Why? No, I'm not a fan. Are there, of is there lots of llamas in Peru? In Peru that's yeah, where of they course come there from. is. Yeah, yeah, of course there is. Why? What's wrong? What do the llama do? Alpacas. I'm not a fan, to be fair. Yeah. They are funny looking, aren't they? Mm, They're ever so yeah. funny looking. I can embrace the llamas. Yeah. It's going to be beautiful, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. that's bucket list, that is. Mm. I'd sooner do that, the trek in Peru, than go on a safari. Yes, I would. Because I watched the Idris Elba Beast film the other day as oh, well. Oh, did you? Mm. Not very good, is it? <laughs> <laughs> well and truly put me off for going on a, on, on a, on a safari. Um, amazing. Well done, everybody. Isle of Man, Soraya. New customers wow. getting involved. Amazing. Totally natural. No enhancement. Um, no fisher filler. No stabilization. All Mother Nature's uh, doing. Fabulous. Congratulations, everybody. Strawberry quartz, Peruvian turquoise. Beautiful. And they work together beautifully, don't they? They really do. Yeah. But still, Mark, we are not yet done because we have the most amazing amazing launch happening in the next hour don't we mm -hmm. the most amazing I've been waiting launch months for this this is again this is another product that should have been here for birthday ah 
that has been delayed at some point for some reason. We have, so. to, we have to be reactive, don't yeah. we? Yeah. Hiya, Julie. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, did an amazing tour oh. of Peru, oh, amazing. including the Inca, Inca Trail. Trail. That's that what I'm referring it. to. That was it. Yeah. Oh, Julie, I'd have to pick your brains on that because that, that's that's something we want to do when we're uh, when the girls are a little bit older. We'd like to do the Inca Trail. Right. I've got no idea with how. The girls. Would you not do it with the girls? Maybe. Not. Mm. No. Maybe not. Okay. No, no, I don't know. Take grandparents, I don't know. Yeah, yeah, Again, need to yeah. research this. Date night. Date night. Yeah. <laughs> just pop along the Inca trails. Yeah. Um, amazing. Okay, yeah. now just before we dive into oh. a break, I'm going to bring oh. you two of the smooth strawberry courts. Um, oh. These are the, uh, the only other strawberry courts deals that we actually have in the business. Um, Maybe if you wanted to create contrast or texture um, in amongst your faceted rounds, I think that would work. I think it would be an amazing idea. We don't do that enough. I mean, we mix colours together and but not sizes, facets. but not facets with smooth, do we? Oh, look at that. It is beautiful, oh. isn't it? That's totally natural. That's beautiful. Totally natural. So if when, when we were describing the tiny microscopic hematite inclusions... They're you know, amazing. it's 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 this that you're seeing. I wonder, Michael, Sorry? how I wonder how close we can get in. Oh, look at this! Oh, it's got flashes. It's like um, adventure essence. Thank you. Look at that. Hematite inclusions giving yeah. you adventure essence, and it's all totally natural. Oh, That's look at it. Gorgeous. It is gorgeous. And it will go perfectly with the with the showcase that we brought you. Now, yes. I've got it in the 10 mil. I've got it in the 8? Eight, 8 mil? Yeah. And that's all that oh, we have. Right. That's our entire strawberry court opportunity. It's got a glow. Of, it's like moonstone, isn't it? It's got yeah. an inner glow about it. Sorry. Wow. We've done some apology prices. Hang on. Look at that. That's On launch, amazing. this very strand, 10 millimetres, 18 centimetres, smooth, beautiful, natural strawberry quartz. We're talking about this one now. Um, look how lovely they are together. Could that be the most beautiful perfect, kit? We launched perfect. the 10 mils at 79.99. It's perfect, isn't it, Mark? If you were sent this kit... Amazing. What would you do? Rose, really? I'd have to do some sort of caging, I think. Nice. Maybe. Oh, do you remember that um, technique I did on our last show where we had yeah. the four beads and we did the little 15-0 yeah. surrounds? That's nice. You could do that, you could replicate that with them and use the turquoise to go around the outside. That'd look amazing. We've apologised a fair amount today, haven't we? Oh. That's your launch. Three-way split pay. Should we do a brand new low price tag? On the smooth 10 millimeter, 18 centimeter strand. These are the only strawberry quartz that we have in the entire business. That's it. That is it. And if you want to see strawberry quartz on our sister channel, they have it too. It is one of their most successful. What do they? Yeah, very successful what do they collection. Set it with? Um, all sorts. Silver. Right, I think they've right. done it in gold. I'm not yeah. entirely sure. I think so. Right. Um, but yeah, it's considered because of its rarity. We've done a few apology deals, and I think today is going to be exactly the same. Um, Team it with your Peruvian turquoise. That I think that would just be a yeah. gorgeous combination. You know, I'm a very basic jewellery maker, so even if you just, rather than knotting your strawberry quartz, pop a few of your three millimetres no. in between. 30 pounds, no, yeah, 30 pounds back in your pocket. You know when maths is really simple sometimes? It confuses me. <laughs> I pull that face. Uh. Uh, 30 pounds off that price tag purely because you've tuned in on this day and we've brought you a launch of your beautiful strawberry quartz and just on the back of that amazing uh, uh, showcase um, we're bringing you some more apology deals 16 pounds and 66 pence on your split payment for the 10 millimeters we do have the smooth eight millimeters as well if you wanted to create that uh, um, um, if you wanted to create that uh, contrast. Yeah, we were talking earlier on, weren't we, about, about the Beatles and yeah, favourite yeah, yeah. songs. Strawberry Fields is up there, isn't it? Yeah. 
Let me take you down. Is that it? Uh -huh -huh. Strawberry fields. Bad news, real. Who did a read? Who did a? I don't know. Somebody in the sort of the um, the Britpop era did a version of that. Who was? Um, uh, who did that? Yeah, I feel like it. Yeah, someone like Blur yeah. or something like that. Yeah. Oh, wasn't it? Um, no, it wasn't. Stone Roses, did they do oh, it? Somebody, been. somebody like that. Oh, less could have known. been. Right. Not sure. Uh, Forty-nine ninety-nine, thirty pounds back into your pocket. Yeah. Uh, do you know I, another amazing Beatles song? Live and let die. Oh yeah. But that was Paul McCartney, really. True. Yeah. But True. that was that's one of my favourite Bond themes. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it is good. It's one of my favourite Bond films. That one as well. Really? It's a good Jane one. Jane Seymour used first to film. absolutely terrify me. Yeah. The little, Voodoo. Chat. Yeah. The the yeah. The, 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 the coconuts. Mm. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Terrify me. Right, moving on. Sorry, Roscoe. The last of our strawberry courts. These are your eight millimetre rounds, always a popular size. Um, beautiful intensity of strawberry colour. So, called Candy Flip, this band that did a cover of that Ooh. song, apparently. Right. Gosh, well done, Mark. Yeah. In when? 1990. Oh, Manchester. Who's the Manchester? It was that like pop, wasn't it? It was... It was it oh, it's all Manchester, yeah, Manchester. yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. okay. Right, Just I in my it. melon man and all that sort of thing. <laughs> Whatever that melon. meant. <laughs> um, <laughs> no, but I can relate to it now. I can, do you know what? I can relate to twisting my melon after because it's school term, uh, summer holidays right now. Oh, I've developed like this kind of like, oh, goodness me. My melon gets twisted Already? on the schools. Yeah. yeah. Right. <laughs> You need two weeks in. I know. I know exactly. <laughs> um, I'm a third away through it, Mark. Yeah. Come on. Um, right. Um, let's bring you the eight millimetres again. Apology oh. deals. Oh. Another apology price point. I don't know what we're apologising oh, for. for. I don't know. Because Dave couldn't play them. Okay. Sorry. We just said sorry. Um, <laughs> Adam says we've probably got things to apologise for, so just do it. Tiggy does that, you know. She's like, oh, sorry, mummy. What, what for? <laughs> what have you done? $39.99. She wants you to stockpile them for when she does something really I'm bad. Sorry, I'm sorry, mummy. I'm sorry. already had the apology. Yeah. I swear she doesn't just say it. Yeah. Oh. Very cute. Uh, 1999. Well done, everybody. Beautiful strawberry colours. Um, and coming up after a very short break, we have got the launch of Mark's long awaited ombre cord. Your very own my very cord. Own. Put my name to this one. But this was like, yeah. th you know, this is something that, Mark, we've been, it should have happened years ago. Yeah, we never thought about Big it. Did we? No. Yeah. New suppliers, we've, we've found, I expect. But no, it's amazing. Oh, we've even got, we've even got a Kumihimo, Kumihimo discs. Oh, amazing. Which are like gold dust. They are, yes. So, and these are good quantities. So we're going to put the whole we, um, hour on pre-order. How are we actually selling it? Is it one big kit or separate? Um, or no, how are they doing it? Individual, oh, okay. I think. So you can, you can choose, pick and choose. So that's right. going to be exciting. Oh, okay. So yes, just before we dive into a break, Mark, you know, you have mm. been. Um, well, we, we came to know and love you through the art of that's knotting. That's how it started. The old macrame. All those yeah. years ago. Yeah. All those years ago. Just we behind. We didn't even have macrame true. boards back then, did we? No, that's we, true. We, we had boards with bulldog clips. Yeah, we used a clipboard, didn't we? I remember right. that. Yeah. I do remember that. Yeah. Um, but yes, I mean, fast forward what twelve years? Mm. Twelve years and. The launch of your very own. Oh, so this, there are three launches coming up. This is the first one that the stock's arrived for. Fabulous. So um, we will keep you posted for the other year. We're going down metallics and all sorts. Oh, that's exciting, Mark. Mm. I love that. Mm. Um, okay, it's happening in a few moments' time. Do make sure um, that you check out. You can shop ahead during the break, and of course, then all eyes can be on Mark through his demonstrations. Uh, you know, are these cords can you use them in the same way that you do your. Your Eslon cord. Your Eslon, your knotting, everything. So and because there are two gauges, you've got a finer gauge and a thicker, so you can oh. get through the drill holes and you can go around. So, um, yeah, so you can good. braid, knot. Braid, knot, thread. flat, thread. 
macrame, kumahimo, tassel, tassel, everything. Yeah, they're great. And, and they're nylon, so that you're gonna you'll be able to melt and do wow. that malarkey. Yeah. It's happening. No longer um, do we need to wait. The first time ever, Mark's very own ombre cord launch, and it's happening after this. <laughs> Here at Jewelry Maker, we're always looking ways to make your shopping experience better. That's why on certain items, we've got Split Pay, where you can spread the cost over two, three, or four months at no extra cost to you. So you can buy your way with Split Pay. Jewelry Maker has its own dedicated call center with highly trained staff waiting to help you with your orders or any queries. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guests we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. It's easy to stay in touch with Jewelry Maker. You can like our Facebook page and join our community of over 69,000 people. You can follow us on Twitter and tweet us your messages and opinions. You can also find us on Instagram and even TikTok. Make sure you get involved and stay up to date with Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Makers, did you know that you can purchase as many times as you like throughout the day and you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee? No matter the size, weight or quantity of your order, how many times you check out that day, we will still only charge you that single PMP. Keep things simple on Jewelry Maker. Did you know that when you purchase with Jewelry Maker, you have a 30 day money back guarantee? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30 day money back guarantee. So there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Maker are proud to be part of the Gemporia partnership. Our partnership family includes Jewelry Maker, Gem Collector, Gemporia, Sewing Street, and Yarn Lane. Our friendly and knowledgeable help team are available 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. If you have a question or query, contact us on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Alternatively, you can email or drop us a direct message on our Facebook page. Jewelry Maker, happy to help. Did you know that calls are free from a UK landline and our phone lines are open 24 hours a day, 7 days a week? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. That crash bang was as well. I Mark's, broke my chair. Yeah, Mark's chair. The hoop on your chair's fallen off, isn't yeah, it? Yeah. Yeah. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> <laughs> We're doing well, aren't we? We are doing well. Uh, yeah. Welcome back, everybody. And as if like that, straight away we're into the afternoon. I know. It's 12 o'clock. 
Um, we have the launch of Mark's Beautiful Chords, but first let's show off your wonderful creations oh. in the Wall of Fame. Starting us off this morning is Jim. Hiya, Jim. You're number 268. Uh, good morning, everybody. Here is my entry for the Wall of Fame. It's a necklace using soda light slabs, neon appetite rounds, and a poppy jasper carved flower. Very pretty. Best of luck to everybody in the drawer. Take care, says Jim. That's very oh, nice. Thank you, Jim. Good luck to you, Jim. Number 269 is from Catherine. Ah, oh. oh, very pretty, Catherine. Hello all, this week I've created a bouquet of colourful hairpins using lucite flowers and shell pearls from Jewelry Maker. I think the colours match perfectly together. Good luck, everybody. They're lovely. I'd love to work with lucite. I've not worked with them yet. Have you not? No, I think they're you need to, because you look perfect them. with them. Yeah, it. yeah. Uh, 270 is from Vivian. Hello, Vivian. Oh, oh. 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 Oh, hang on, Vivian. If I read out your message, see if we can place it. Who made what? Was it? No, I, well, it was <laughs> Catherine made the Lucite flowers, definitely. Yes. Yeah, yeah. Vivian saying, hello all, here is a necklace made with freshwater bicolored rice pearls, oh. lapis lazuli, faceted sea beads, and four millimeter aventurine um, rounds. Uh, finished with sterling silver hook and eye clasp. Um, I have added an extra hook and passed it through both the other hook and the eye. Um, mm. Thought it was a shame for the clasp to be hidden at the back. Best wishes to all. So, can I just say, I really apologize, Vivian. I'm so sorry. Um, yeah, we, oh, human error, human error. I'm so sorry, but you're still entered in the draw, so don't worry about that. Uh, number 271. It's from Sue Davis, yes. And Sue Davis says, hello, everybody. Here's my entry for this week's Wall of Fame. I've been making, f uh, I've, had, I've been having fun, sorry, making these stretchy polymer clay Heshi bead bracelets from kit boxes I bought from Jewelry Maker. They're such good value. Um, I've made 15 so far with beads from other kits. Lots, uh, and there are loads of Heshis left to make more with my granddaughters. Uh, more boxes of these colorful Heshis, please, she says. Amazing. I love those boxes, those Heshi yeah. boxes. It's fun jewellery, isn't it? And 272 is from Katura. Hello to Katura. Beautiful. Is that a beady oh, bead? Look at that. Amazing. Um, hello, all at Jewelry Maker. This is my entry for this week. It's a pair of pearl sea bead studs. Um, as you will see, it was uh, see it was a bit of a decision. Uh, where to put the stud as it's a beaut as it's beautiful on both sides. I've shown both sides. I hope you like it as much as I do. Good luck to all of us. Ah, that's very nice, Katura. It's absolutely oh. beautiful. Loving that. Over Amazing. To Number 273 is from Caroline. Oh, look at these. Very Here is my entry for this week's Wall of Fame. It's made from shell shapes through which I've threaded seed beads and peacock pearls. Good luck to all fellow entrants. I love that. Amazing. We need to get more of these a lot, these sort of hoop. Yeah. Oh, really yeah, like they work, don't they? Number 407, sorry, 274 is from Vera. And Vera says, hello everyone. Oh, I've created it. this necklace and bracelet set using Neon Appetite. I've added gold stars to both. I'm loving all of Botswana and Crazy Lake Agate you've bought to us recently. It's just like old times. I still have Laguna Agate. It only comes out for that special occasion. Very nice. <laughs> Good luck to all. And that's from Vera. I'm lucky to have a strand of all of the Laguna lace when we launched it. We only launched it once, didn't we? Yeah. Number 275 is from Jeanette. Oh, look at this. Very pretty. Oh, is that what I think it is? Hello, everyone. Here's my second ever Wall of Fame entry. It's a long line rose quartz, gold stone and seed bead half and half necklace. Good luck to everyone in this week's draw. I love that workstation as well. It's very very nice. organised. Number 276 is from Joanne. Oh. oh, he's cute. And Joanne says, hello, lovely team. My Wall of Fame entry this week is a set of simple wire wrapped earrings featuring rose quartz, hematite and amethyst. All products are from Jewelry Maker. Wishing all my fellow waffers good luck in the draw. Loving those, Joanne. And I, I like love the those fish. earrings. They're lovely, aren't they? And 277 is from lovely Isabel. And Isabel says, hello, lovely friends. This is a wire weaving technique I've learned from the wonderful Katie Parker. I've never managed to be so neat before and I'm very happy with it. Have a great day all. And that's from Isabel. Oh, isn't that's that beautiful, lovely. Isabel. You should be chuffed. That is very, very neat. Now, Mark, should we make some of our lovely audience a bit Let's. richer? Shall we? You, run, you choose the winner. 
And you're going to do, do the runner-up. Runner up. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. I was just thinking we need to go back to folding these. Yes. Because at the moment it looks like there's nothing in there. But there are. It's just we don't <laughs> fold them anymore. Um, right, let's give it a whiz. Give it a whiz. Give it a whiz. And it is also a massive tombola now. Yeah, yeah. Now, okay, here we are. So who's going to win the hundred pounds? Hundred pounds being credited to their jewellery maker That's account. That's a lot of money. hundred quid, isn't it? It is. Yeah. Ooh. Oh. Ooh. Oh. Two hundred and forty-one. Alison Quince. Alison. Oh. Alison Quince. Well done. Well done, lovely. You're our winner this week. You don't need to do anything. Hundred pounds being credited to your jewellery maker accounts, right? Amazing. Make it lucky. Mm. Quince is a pear, it's a fruit, you make jam and things with it. Mm. And the runner up. It's even 50 pounds. 227. Susan Good. Susan Good, well, well done, done well ladies, done, congratulations. Well All done. you need to do is send us a photograph, little message. The only stipulation is that they're jewellery maker products. Yeah. It's amazing. that simple, and we've done the Wall of Fame for as many days as we've been broadcasting. Amazing. How fabulous is that from the yeah. very first week? Now, Mark, this is exciting. The time has come. The moment has arrived. People have been shopping ahead. We have oh, everything amazing. to get yourself started. But talk us through your beautiful jewellery. I put the bracelet back there. Uh, I just marvellous. Think I was tea-leafing it. Okay, so, um, so the first thing I had to do was do some kumihimoing, because I love kumihimoing. Yeah. So the first one I did was this blue one. So we've got an eight warp Kumihimo braid. I've actually made these little peyote movable. They actually move. Oh, so okay. You can squidge them all down if you wanted to, to wear it completely different. So yeah. that was the first thing. And then I did this Helter Skelter. I did the Helter Skelter necklace. Again, Kumihimo. Now we've got these beads coming up. We've got these six O's coming up shortly. So you can you'll be able this, to replicate that. One, yeah. yep. So I've done the pink using the colours and then I just went to town on the old bracelets so I did the five on this end showing you the different colours of the whole ombre mm -hmm. so I started I, I started at one end of the thread and I took a whole ombre section and then I I brace made the the, um, the braided bracelets so you got the all five colours there then I did the two beaded weaves so these are remember Cavendoli? I haven't done Cavendoli for years no what? So, so Cav Cavendoli is, is doing um, macrame bracelets using single and half hitch, double half hitch knots yeah. to do the bracelets and then I've incorporated two different That's readings. cool, it's like a gate yeah. bracelet. Yeah, so we've got the gate and then we've got the zigzag oh, on that's here again amazing. using six O's. Uh, then I made the, 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 um, the other bracelets and the, just a little simple pair of earrings. I well. love the tassel all, necklace as well. All. Use it. So this yeah. board can be used for yeah. your macrames, oh, your kumihimo, yeah. your knotting. We do also have the purple that we were referring to during the break. Um, they're not physically in the studio, but we do have them too. So this is the first of three launches. Um, and we've also got components to go alongside, um, like your kumihimo disc, weights, bobbins. When do we have all of these things? I know. It's like know. gold dust. So, okay, shall you choose? So, what order are they? Do we know? Have you got your list? I do. Or are they, or are they in single colourways? Um, here we go. You choose which oh, one. Oh, right. Bundles of colourways. So, oh, you're getting the two different no, sizes. Really? Yes. For that? Yeah. Right then. Okay. Right. okay. This one? is ridiculous. This is stupid. But anyway, green. Yeah! Love this. Now I've opened one of them. Um, I love it. I absolutely Amazing. love this colour. It's absolutely yeah. beautiful. So, did you say earlier on you've got here what got one two. gauge? You've got two gauges. You've got a half mil and yeah. you've got a mil, one millimeter. So you can do your. So we. I wanted. We originally we were going to do the one mil, but I wanted half mil to go through your beads. Yeah. Because you thought if you're going to do macrame, you need to do be able to do the same. Um, the same threads to do your pieces of work. So, yeah. 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 I'm, I'm opening these just because you can see the colour then. You can't really see it through the actual. I've, uh, empty, I've got reels down here. Oh, sorry. sorry I, didn't, I, didn't, I, didn't, 
I didn't realise what you Never were Never mind, never mind. It doesn't matter. I mean, you can do all your tassels, you can do your macrame. And Mark, you've been for 12 years. You've been one of um, our amazing guest designers. And, you know, you've always had a passion for knotting. Love it. You've, it's yes, great fun. You know, you're... Well, I, it was, I went down the whole macrame and kumihimo route, and then lovely Susie got me into marlas yeah. and knotting and uh, just love it. So this is, this is the cord look. And again, you can see how the ombre changes. It's, it's fantastic. So but you had to actually go through colours, didn't it was, you? It was amazing. I bet that was quite yeah. difficult yeah. to create the perfect ombre. Yeah. So I think there was there was a green and there were 50 different shades of green to choose from. Right. So you then had to choose the five shades you wanted okay. and then you had to ombre those five. So there was a lot of work involved. Which, uh, do you yeah. know, our designers are very good at doing because you always talk about an ombre, don't you? Oh, all the time, all the time. <laughs> Now, this, the, is, this is ridiculous. How many do we have available? You've still got my sheets, haven't you? Sorry. That's all right. Um, of the green, we have a hundred of the green, wow. okay. And they are flying fast. So, I mean, Mark, you've worked with this, obviously. You designed it. Mm -hmm. You know, the fact you can actually, it's not going to fray because it's nylon. That's right. You it's can, not going to fray. You can, you can melt it using your, um, so you get, I think you get 10 meters on each reel, I believe. Wow. I think. You better, I'm pretty sure, I might be wrong. But that's a lot, is. isn't it, though, to, in terms of things that you can actually, um, in terms of things that you can do, you can use, you're only going to use a metre or so for metre a and bracelet, for bracelet, aren't you? Yeah. Uh, the phone lines have already absolutely lit up. We've got 100 available. We've got all of your cords, your weights, your bobbins, your beads. Um, sorry? How about £5 per spool? So you get, you get oh. 10 metres, you get 10 metres. So, ah, I uh, love this. So this is a spool which is taller than it is wide and a reel is flat, like, like wire. So yeah. you have a this, reel of wire and a spool of cord. There you go. Yeah, and you, so you get 10 metres on each. You've got 20 metres of cord altogether. 10 metres of your half mil and 10 millimetre, 10 metres of your one millimetre. I love that. That, yeah. that bracelet that, is stunning. That, show, so that showcases the whole ombre. So you, don't, you haven't added anything to it, it's all about the cord. Yep. Amazing, you could literally just sell those, just couldn't you? Those. And that's probably about, oh, I don't know, three feet of cord. So not so less than a meter. So you can make 20 of these easily. Wow. Like We're at 9.99. Sorry, Ross, what was that? Remember the entire hour is on pre-order, so you can shop ahead on each of these. We had 100 available opportunities. This is the first part of three shows, but these are the first ones that have arrived. Yes, yep. Um, cords, I mean, it's so lovely to see them back because they went through a big period, a chunk of jewellery maker, yeah, yeah. where we didn't have any. No, no, no. So nice to see them back, isn't it? <gasps> 4.99. Did you know that? No. Oh. No. Um, hi, Stephen and Susan does. saying hi, jewelry maker. The green looks like Malachi. I was There's thinking method exactly in my the madness. Same. <laughs> Love it. It's yeah, nice. that's it's gorgeous. Lovely. We hardly ever do green cords. So I it's love really that bracelet. Nice. It's really nice. That bracelet's stunning. And that's macrame. Yes, this is this is half half. Um, Half hitch, repeated half hitch. I love it. So I mean, easy. So, and that, and that yeah. clasp, absolutely yeah. beautiful. Four ninety nine. You can clearly make multiples of these. I mean, like you said earlier on, if you do your craft events or your summer fates, whatever it might be, your charity yeah. events, and you just made a load of these. Yeah, yeah. absolutely. I bet they would fly. Abs yeah. And gents and ladies would yeah. love this. And if you sell them at three quid each. What? You know, that's, 20, three pounds? that's, that's six, 60 pounds just out of those two you're meals. Be, you're not going to sell them for three yeah, pounds. Yeah, but if it, if it was for a kid is fate or, you know, a, a charity event or something like that. Uh, at least I think, I think three quid. Really? Yeah. Well, they're not going to hang three, around for three five, pounds, are they? Five, <laughs> at least yeah, five. Right, okay. And that's just because it's a paper note. Yeah, okay. But, I mean, how long does it take you to make one? Half an hour. I think more than that. Okay. okay. Sold out. Oh. Really? Oh no. And a hundred people have missed out on that. I'm so sorry about that. If you want to shop ahead on all of your cords, you can, they are on pre-order oh. right now. That was a hundred gone, like that. The purple is also on pre-order. I'm gonna yeah, put all those bracelets down just there a second. Well, let's, 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 let's do the pink. The pink. Fuchsia, the fuchsia. Yeah. Now, second most popular on pre-order. Which is the most? Teal. 
Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Okay. Amazing. So you get two different gauges. So you get your one mil. And your half mil. And your half mil. Yeah, yeah. So here's the pink. That's I ridiculous. love that. That's ridiculous. 25p a metre. That's yeah. just crazy. Yeah. These okay. are flying out the door. Can I? There's a certain charity that I'm thinking right now looking at the yeah, pink yeah. one. Yeah. I think these would be great for that if you want yeah. to raise money. You could make one for Mary Berry. You could. Your best friend. I could, yeah, Mary. <laughs> Full of the joys of spring, our Mary, isn't she? Yeah, lovely. They'd be absolutely beautiful. Why Mary Berry? I oh, know. Because you went, you went to her of the pink heart oh, event. Oh, right, thing, yes, didn't yes. You? Yeah. She loved you. She, <laughs> she, was, <laughs> she was having a hoot at that part. I bet that she wasn't at all. She didn't want to be there. She quite clearly didn't want to be there. Um, <laughs> four pounds. And I was having a lovely you time. You were having a lovely time. Um, you met Ainsley, didn't you? Ainsley. What a, yeah. what a sweetheart yeah. is Ainsley. Yeah. I'm Team yeah. Ainsley, I am. Yeah. Um, four ninety nine. Again, yeah, it just reminds me of. Oh, look at that. That's Plus, incredible. let's not forget what film's just arrived on the... Uh... Oh, Barbie. Yeah, mm -hmm. yes, of course. So yeah. very perf uh, very much yeah, perfect yeah. for that. And yeah. these are absolutely flying out the door. It's £2.50 per spool. That's mad. Spool. That's crazy. Yeah. They're amazing. They're really nice, really heavy-duty quality as well. I love these bracelets, yeah. Mark. They're absolutely gorgeous. That's fun. The, re the only reason I made these was to show the ombre that's, that's involved in the reels. I love yeah. them. They're great fun. Yeah, great for yeah. fundraisers. Yeah. You could team it for, yeah, you colour it to the, so, uh, mm, um, right. the, the actual cord mm. to the charity. Yeah. Yeah. And there's more on the horizon, mm -hmm. isn't there? Oh, that's very exciting. Very exciting. Um, over 100 of the pink have gone. There's over 100 in baskets. And how many do we have? Oh, we had wow. 200 of the right. pink. So just to clarify, you get... One spool of your 0.5, one spool of your one millimetre, they are both ombre. That Even if you just literally yep. cut a length, that's what it will do. And the ombre matches as well, so. Yeah, because you, you've done the most perfect. Yeah. So if you, you can knit with this as well, because so I can't knit. No, My I mum was a great knitter, but if you knitted with this, you get the ombre pattern. I made crochet? a teddy, I made, you can crochet. I made a teddy bear scarf once. What, knitted it? Mm. Fair play. Yeah, but you I don't know how it? to knit one, purl one, and drop one, and all that. How did you knit one then? My nan taught me. Oh. Yeah, years ago. Oh, I can, I can, I can put the stitches on and cast off and cast off. I wouldn't have a clue. Would... These would be brilliant because you get that really good on. Be a beautiful yeah. fabric to crochet actually... would be lovely. Yeah, very nice. Yeah. Four ninety nine. Look at the core screens. It's gone completely crazy. Well done. We had two hundred of these, wow. but a lot of you stocking up your stashes. I do like the idea of using these for things like your fundraisers mm. and stuff. That's yeah, a nice idea. But at the same time, I would definitely wear one. One hundred percent. Well done. Make sure you're checking out. And what are you going to demo? Just for the. Uh, just... I'm going to show the zigzag. There's, which one's the this zigzag? One, this one here. Yeah. That's cool. Yeah. That's quite Christmas, Christmas like. I can yeah. see little Christmas trees. Yeah. They're, they're brilliant. They're great fun. Oh, I like that. Yeah. Uh, that'll be here before you know it as well, yeah. won't it? Can't wait. Um, amazing. Congratulations. We had 200 of them. Lots of twos, threes, and fours get involved. Keep dialing through. Hold those phone lines, and we can at least guarantee you one. Let's bring you the next colour. So I'll Purple. move. Purple. Purple. Yeah. I don't physically have it I've in the got, studio. I've, now, I've after, it, t after teal, purple is the most popular. Yeah. Heads up, sorry. Teal, we had 170. Well, we can look at the bracelet, can't we? Yeah, yeah. Over 100 of a, these are gone. This is a beautiful ombre, this one. Yeah. Oops. Yeah, that's Gorgeous. lovely, Mark. Yeah. It's just lovely the way it, adds. it just... Ombre's through. It does ombre through. Yeah, right lovely. now for the purple. Yeah. Yeah. So I've only got marks here. You obviously get a full spool. <laughs> I've used so much of these. I think I've yeah, I've used four. Purple's completely. clearly one of your favourites yeah. then. Yeah. I can see why. From the lavender right the way up to the deep ultraviolet, you get the two spools. I know I don't physically have them here in the studio, but 0.5 millimeter and one, a mil uh, one millimeter. Is there still a photograph though? Okay, but you you know what they look like. Sorry, sorry, yeah. Um, you know what they look like. So you get the two spools yep. like this. Yep. Obviously in purple. Is it maybe because it's just landed? 
It might just be because it's just landed that it's been added to today's show. Absolutely gorgeous. Four ninety nine. This is still absolutely flying out the door. Over a hundred have gone. Did you say we had one hundred and seventy available? Two hundred. Wow. Uh, one hundred and seventy of the teal. I would recommend shopping ahead on each of the colours. I don't think we're actually going to get to the teal. I think it's going to have already sold out because you know the price. Um, this one's very quickly following suit. Um, I'd be intrigued to know. Are you just going to do? Are you going to do these? Lots of these? Are you going to go for the tassels? Are you going to go for the other oh, techniques? Let's do the teal then. Teal then, because um, that is looking like it's going to be an on-screen sellout. Um, okay. Oh, here you go. I've got those. That's all good. Who got those? <gasps> it's oh beautiful. The ombre is I, I so keep, gorgeous. I keep saying that's my favourite, and then it changes. I, I love them all. Hang on. Yeah. Love this. That is beautiful, isn't it? Yeah. The green's lovely. Mm. I can't choose. I the reason I put this together was I, I, I went through this 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 sort of moment. That I, will, I really like smoky quartz. Yeah. And this with smoky quartz just works beautifully. The brown. It's like Amazonite and smoky quartz. Again, a very rare colour. Yeah, it's lovely. Um, this. Beautiful. You know we're not stopping at 1999 though. Oh, yeah, that was your bracelet, wasn't it? That's the one I was wearing earlier on. Yeah, love it. That's the piranha jaw, yeah? That's it. Very cool, isn't it? Very, very cool with your teal. £4.99. This may well be an on-screen sellout, jewellery makers, but the reality is Mark Scord's first time ever launching his own cord collection. Yeah. Uh, we need to put your branding on there I as know, well. I know, we need to do something, don't we? Yeah, put yeah. your face on there. <laughs> I think that would work. Um, that's £2.50 per spool. They've sold out. Not Amazing. surprised at all. Not surprised at all. OK. I think the blue is my favourite. I really like this blue. Yeah. They've, all, it's, they've all flown. Yeah. They've all been incredibly, incredibly... The blue is lovely. Yeah. That, you could wear that on a daily basis, couldn't you? I can't, I genuinely can't choose, Mark. I love And these them are colour fast as well, so you can wear them in the shower or when you go swimming or really? in the washing machine. Yeah, so they're, re they're really good. Gosh, that's important because let's be I mean, honest, want, these are the kind of bracelets you don't want to have to take off. You don't off. want to turn your tighty whities pink, do you? No. No. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely no. not. You don't want to dive into a swimming pool and then have, I don't know. Oh, no. Teal or blue or green or pink, all of a sudden, sort of. No, you don't. Yeah, no, we want it to last. These are, you can see the quality, Mark. Genuinely, you can see that quality and you can feel the quality. Lovely to work with. So, again, you're getting the two spools, your 0.5 and your one millimeter. Um, right now, for the blue, it's hard to say which one's been the most popular because they've all absolutely flown. Um, okay, moving on. Mark, what do you want to do next? Let's do the. Again, this is the first time we've had this for years. The Kumihimo Bell Cap Ends. Oh. The Findings Pack. This Hang is on. I've been asking and asking and asking for this forever. What is it about these? Well, we're able to... So if I bring... If I turn this around to show Michael. So we, can you see I've, we've got the bell caps. Have we? I'll grab these as many as you can. We've got quantity. So you get, you get four toggle clasps, yeah. you get four sets of two bell cap endings in varying sizes. Yeah. And you also get eight oval jump rings. Eight right. other jump rings. And we get and we get carry, charm carriers as well. So yeah. So you get a whole kit. 300 of this. Yeah. And then if I turn this one around, Michael will be able to see the the toggle as well. So you now, get the without, whole set. Without your bell cap own. ends, you've kind of got those threads, haven't you? And you have to make them yourself. And which it's is not a bit ideal. Of a but yeah. these, these are absolutely perfect. And as I said, we, we never have these on the show. So yep. whenever you see them, grab grab 20 of them. OK, well, Honestly. on that basis, yeah. people wanting to multi-buy, yeah. you, can, you can bet your bottom dollar that we're going to be bringing the most amazing price point. Um, so, yeah, we had 300 of them, but as Mark said, they disappear. Yeah. That's because outside of a wag's wife, we never, we never, We never sell them on their own. This is unheard of. Wow. You've got the different colours, you can see. Um, two of each, obviously, because they go at either end. These are the charm carriers that Mark was referring to. There's your oval jump rings that you can see in the background. And you also get your toggle class. So you get four of those two. Uh, graphics are live. In total, 26 I know, findings. I know. Those, those charm carriers are amazing. And the yeah. reason that we put oval jump rings in instead of round is because 
the space in between the little loop at the top. Yeah. There's not enough purchase hole in there to, to feed through a round jump ring. Oh. So you'd, you really struggle. So, so you need them to be oval. Vehicles. That's a good point. It's Everything's brilliant. thought out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. We're just putting these in ascending order. Take Sorry, orders. ascending I size. I love so much. You are. So you get that perfect pairing. Good luck, everybody. We had 300. We're going to melt the phone lines. Yep, we are. They are yeah. flying. It's been a long time since we've seen bell caps, isn't it? Yep. I, as I said, I've, I've, I, don't think we've had them, I don't think we've had them since I've been back at Eagle Road. Yeah, I remember yeah. I remember them being launched and being called something yeah. very different yeah. and we had to rechange the name, didn't we? Because it wasn't a... Um, but yeah, you, you, you complete, you, uh, you, it's that full stop to yeah. your cord instead of having to, them just kind of frayed. Absolutely. Yeah, yeah. And they do look so neat, don't they? Yeah. Um, so yeah, stock up while you get the opportunity. Silver plated too. These are precious metal plated. We're at 19.99. That's great, considering you've got, what, 26? No, we can do better than that. Ooh, 14.99. That is for 26 pieces. We haven't seen them in many a moons. 300 available today. I mean, look, there's nothing wrong with doing your wags white cone. There's nothing wrong with that at all. There's nothing wrong with knotting, but it is, it does give you that perfect finish. Now we have a big quantity. You know what we always say, the bigger the quantity, the lower the price. Do you want to melt the phone lines? Yes, please. Yeah, yeah, oh, and, and yeah, Do you want yeah. to wobble the web? Wobble the web. Oh, that's a good one. <laughs> Do you want to aggravate the app? <laughs> love it, love it, love it, love it. Um, well, we're going to do that. We've got 300 of them. Good luck. Stock up your stashes, like Mark That's was fun. saying. What I've always thought is really odd is why do we say www dot when World Wide Web is much quicker? Much quicker. <laughs> it doesn't Strange, make any sense. No. Yeah, that, yeah, I remember yeah. reading about that. Strange. It's easier to say, to w say World, World Wide, Wide Web. Web than www. Yeah. yeah. It's anyway. Lots of syllables and things like yeah. that, isn't it? Good luck, everybody. Look at how many of you there. I would encourage stocking up your stash. Can I also just say it's a long time since we've actually had a um, a show where got everything you've in got it. You everything. <laughs> yeah, normally it's like, oh, sorry, you'll need to add this or you yeah. need to add that. But we've actually got everything from the Kumikimo Kumi 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 disc to the bobbins, to the weights, to the cords, to the, to the ends. Got everything. Everything. It's amazing. Could have gone so wrong that, couldn't it? Yeah. Uh, 9.99. Well done, everybody. Good luck. There was 300. The phone lines have gone crazy. Susan's got five. Paula's got two. Marion and Theresa and Pauline and Elaine and Derbyshire. Uh, Maureen, well done to you. Christine and Joan and Simon and Catherine, Olivia. We've melt melted the phone lines, everybody. Is there a queue on that? Um, okay. Uh, but not too bad, our call centre are keeping up with you. If you can, can I direct you to the um, World Wide Web? <laughs> Sounds just a bit posher though, doesn't yeah, it? Oh, but World Wide Web. web. Um, yeah, www.jewelrymaker.com or tap the app, that simple. Um, make sure you're checking out. We've got three full rows of names, lots of multi buyers because it's been, gosh, months. I can't remember mm. the last time I actually saw a bell cap. 2018, 2018 apparently. Yeah, I've yeah, just gone through a... the archives. Yeah. Thought... Has it been that long? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's been ages. Yeah, yeah. Where does time go, genuinely? Crazy, isn't it? 2018 was the last time we had a bell cap. Mm. It's mad. Crazy. Crazy. Yeah. I don't like. Madness, absolute so madness. We've, so we've had bobbins and we've had discs yeah. and we've had cords, but we've got had nothing really. Five to, years? So it's just, yeah. Oh, madness, isn't it? Well done, everybody. We had 300. Um, I would encourage multi-buying. Um, there's a bit of a queue on the phone lines. Um, I tell you what, we're going to dive into the demo just to allow our call centre to catch their breath and catch up with you all. Don't abandon those calls. Um, we've got literally the entirety of the hour. And as and when, Mark, if you queue me and I'll bring the bobbins, yeah, yeah. the weights, the Kumihimo disc, yeah, yeah. it's all available on pre-order right now. So you can absolutely shop ahead. It's on the website straight away. So if you need bobbins, if you need the weight, if you need the beads, if you need the metallic uh, silk, or sea beads, kumahima disc, 
Yeah. We've got it Shop all. Ahead. We have it all. We've got it That's all. That's beautiful and positively it's great fun. festive. That's great fun. And we've got these bees coming up. Yeah. We've got, we've got these six O's. We'll, yeah. We'll do those shortly. So this is um, um, a technique called cavendoli, which is just a posh word of, of, of saying half hitch knots. Okay. Okay. But it's, it's a Heaven really nice... Sounds thing. like a nice bottle of wine. Sounds like an ice cream, doesn't it? Or something oh, like yeah. that. Yeah. No, it's great fun. So to do this, you'll need three pieces of cord. Yeah. Each cord about six foot long. So fingertip to fingertip. And you know you've got enough then. Okay. Yeah. So I've cut them into three lengths and I've taken all three pieces, folded them in half and placed your one of your T-pins at the top. And then what we're going to do is we're going to take one of the cords and separate so i'm just going to take one keep it separate so i'll show you what we're going to do with that in a second and the four chords are then going to go down through a slot at the bottom okay so four through the top and all we're going to do is we're going to take a t-pin and a centimeter down from the t-pin that you've already put we're going to put a second one in place and all this does is we need to join these cords together with a couple of square knots, okay? And this just stops that loop from closing at the end because we need a closure at the end. Okay, so we're going to do one square knot and then we're going to do two, two square knots. Okay, so all this does, it just binds those cords together nice and tight. So what we've got now is we've got one, two, three, four, five, six chords. Now, chord number six, which is the chord that's going to be on the left, is going to go from side to side to side. It's not actually going to take part in any of the knotting now, but you need the five. So as you can see on my piece of work here, so we've got one, two, three, four, five, six. We've got our six chords, but one of them will be a, a hold, what's called a holding cord. Okay, so I just put this to one side. Now, you'll, if you've got, have we got any T pins in stock? I don't think we have at the moment, oh. have we? Right. Okay. I don't think we have. Okay, but a lot, lot. I know lots of viewers have got, got the T pins. Okay, so what we're going to do is, can you see we've got a right angle? So we've got the horizontal cord, and we've got the vertical cords. So where we get that little elbow, just inside, we're going to place one of our T-pins, mm -hmm. okay? And then our five chords at the bottom, we're just going to separate in the order that you can see them in at the top. So spend just a couple of seconds making sure these are in the right order. So that's in the right order. And then this one. Okay, so we've got our five chords. You'll only need to do this for the first couple of moves because after a while, you'll, you'll, see what, you'll see what happens. So we've got five separated. What we're gonna do is we're gonna take our holding cord and we're gonna swing it across and put it in one of the slots in the macrame board, okay? And can you see where our T-pin is? We always start to do our half hitches where we've added the T-pin. Okay. So what we're going to do is we're gonna lift cord one and we're going to take it over the horizontal cord and down and pull nice and tight up against that little elbow and then we're going to do it again so over the top under pull to the left and we're going to do the same with all of our chords so that was chord number one and then we've got chord number two pulling it nice and tightly towards the left What I do, as well as pulling to the left, is I just give it a little nudge up as well. Then we're going to take number three. And then number four, so over and under. Over and under. And then we're going to do the same with the fifth chord. So, so over and under, over and under. Okay, so that's your first row. So you can see now we've got a horizontal line of knots underneath. So what we're going to do next, and then you can now see 
because you've got two knots in between the cords are actually sitting apart in a nice neat row. Next, we're gonna take a T-pin. Again, where you've got this, this little elbow, we're gonna place another pin. We're gonna lift up our cord, and all we're going to do is now we're gonna swing it back to the other side. You could use your Kumihimo discs for this, couldn't you? Because um, I'm just thinking about the pinning. Yeah, because you're not, you're not using any measurements. That. You could pin it to that if you wanted to. Yeah, you could give it a go. I've never done it, but you could give it a go. You've got the little slots, that's all you need, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. Just thinking outside Bit the box. A spongy board, yeah. yeah. Okay, so we've done one horizontal line. We need to do an, a second one now. So I've got my T-pin in. We know that we always start doing the knots where we have the T-pin. So you take the cord nearest, again, over and under. Pull once, over and under. Pull twice. And then we're going to do the same with the other chords. Okay, so over. Oh yeah, let's do the disc. Should and, we bring it? Should yeah, we bring it away? It's been a long time. Around. Sorry. Yeah, one of yeah, the one yeah. of life's simple pleasures is this. Ready? <laughs> Get your Kumi Hemo disc, and if you wish, just do this. <laughs> just really enjoyable i think um a disc will last you a long time won't it yeah yeah they do i definitely recommend get as i say when, with the macrame boards always get three so one for your wire yeah because you can do wire kumihimo one for your thinner cords and one for your your thicker cords. so one for your half mil cords one absolutely for your, yeah it is definitely worthwhile making sure you have some so how many have we got ross Couple of hundred, <laughs> couple of hundred, uh, 145, there we go. Wow. Oh, okay. Wow. Well, that's not gonna hang around. They're gonna be out of stock. It's been ages since we've had the Kumihimo disc. Um, ages and ages. Get one for your wire, get one for your different <laughs> cords yeah. um, as well, because they're memory foam, aren't they? So yeah, they and, remember and, that thickness. And if you don't have a macrame board, just grab, just have one of these to do your knotting. Yeah. You know, if you're using your bead or all your T-pin Well, they're more portable knotting. actually, aren't yeah. they? Um, more portable, so you can absolutely use this in the same way. Yeah, yeah. 6.99 to get hold. Oh, not your price. <laughs> and you get to put that back in as well. Oh, 2.99. That's amazing. Work. Yeah, that's really good. It's been ages since we've had the Kuma Hemo disc. Get them whilst you can and stock up on them because, yeah. like I said, they are like gold dust, aren't they? Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Back to you, Mark, if you're ready. Yep. Okay, so can you see now along the top we've got our two horizontal rows? Okay. Mm -hmm. So what we're going to do is we're now we're going to start doing our zigzag pattern. So can you see we've got one, two, three, four, five of our chords. Okay, so we're going to pick up chord one, always working nearest the T-pin we've just added, and we're going to pop on one of our 6OBs, which we've got coming up in a second, which I can't wait for. These are amazing. Yeah, they're beautiful. Oops. Okay, so that's, uh, then you're going to miss a chord. So place that in your board. Then we're going to miss a chord. And then chord number three, we're going to add two of our six O's. So, so I'm using the 0 0.5 millimeter cord, which go on really easily. So we'll pop on one and we'll do a second. And again, we mentioned earlier, if you just cut your cord at a 45 degree angle, you have a nice point. Okay, so that's two. And then you miss the next chord. This is very festive, this one. And then you miss the next chord and we pop on three. So it's always one, two, three. So if we can bring these now, can we do these now? Yeah. The um, 6 OB. Certainly can. Here you go. Yeah. Here they are. Have, have five colours. Beautiful. There's only oh, 30 no. though. Oh, Sorry, they're right. quite limited. And they've been oh, very popular on pre-order. Right. They are cheerful, aren't they? Yeah. Six O's, but they're metallic. They're lovely. Yeah. And they're silver lined on the inside as well. Eggplant, hot pink, light cranberry, Aww. pink blush and teal. Oh, we tried to match the colours with the, the only one we couldn't, I don't think we could get was the, was the green colour. Yes, you that's can use perfect. The you can use the teal. There's the teal one there. Here you go. 
Ah, Mark, these look beautiful. Yes. And yeah, watch this yeah. face. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> watch this face. Amazing. Sold out. Oh. Sold out. Marvellous. Amazing. Well done. Okay. Shall we just shall, shall we put the ATOs on? Yeah, if you just want so to. that so yeah. that we've got something on our screen. Okay. Yeah. And a slightly bigger this quantity. Mix as well. Oh yeah. Ooh. Lovely. Two of them are hexes. The gold and the middle one are hexes. Which we've only had on the show once or twice. What so this, these these are if you look down on the tube, they're hexagonal. Yeah. The hex so we've got two hexagonals and three ato Mayu keys. Loving that. So you can use this technique with these. You can use that or um, to do your kumihimo with. Because you can you see on here I've used six O's and eight O's yeah. to do the kumihimo, the peyote sections. Ah, gorgeous. In between as well. Almost so like fidget net jewelry, yeah, isn't it? Absolutely. Um yeah. so within this bundle you've got your gold la silver lined. Atos. You've got your lilac silver lined alabaster. You've got your opaque white sea beads, sea foam lined crystal AB, and you've got your silver lined capri blue AB. Um, Fourteen ninety nine. That's amazing. For five Three tubes. Three pounds a tube for yeah. eight O's. Including two pecks. That's crazy. Um, back to you. Amazing. Okay, so I've popped on now my little macrame section. So all we're going to do is we've already popped a pin in. We're going to pick up our cord and what we're going to do is we're going to swing it round and you want to place it like at a sort of a, a right angle just just so it covers those beads so you're going to follow that cord down and pop it in your slot right so and then all we're going to do is we're going to repeat what we've been doing so we're going to pick up the left cord always start with the cord nearest the pin and we're going to go over and under once, and that'll pop that bead back underneath. There we go, okay, so let's pop that in, and then over and under, pick up our next cord, over and under, bring it to the top, over and under, bring it to the top. So it's exactly the same, it's your double half hitch. So this is your, what's known as your half hitch, mm -hmm. and this is your Double because you're doing it twice. There's triple half hitch or quadruple half hitch if you wanted to as well. And what you want to do when we come to the last, there's a little bit of nudge you have to do. So bring that up to the top. And what we're going to do now is we're going to go over and under. And before we pull it tight, all we're going to do is we're just going to push the beads so it makes a little curve. Can you see now we've got a curve? Yeah. Then we can finish off our knot. Like so. We've done our little section. We're going to pop in a T pin. And then we're going to bead up our next section. So wherever you have a single bead, the next row down will be three. So if I bring the piece across. Okay, so can you see? So we've got one, two, three. And then on the next row, it's three, two, one, three, two, one, three, two, one. So, so you get this three, one, three, one. The row in the middle will always be two, 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 two. And then the row on the opposite side will be one, three, one, three. And you get this curve. So all we're going to do is going to do this little cavendoli. So we're going to pick up our, again, we're going to pick up our cord. We're going to place our beads on. And whichever slot you came out of on the right-hand side, you're going to pop your cord in on the left. Then when you come to do your next two sections, you're going to drop a slot so you always know where you are on your, on your, um, on your bracelet. And then to finish, all we're going to do is the little section that you've seen me do at the top. If you, if you watch after the show on YouTube, all you do is you do it in reverse at the bottom. Mm -hmm. Okay. And then you do your two macrame knots, which bring your cords together. And then all I've done then is I've grouped the five chords and made a knot, which then acts as your closure to finish. So really okay. works, that closure, yeah. by the way. That it's, bracelet it's, I was yeah. wearing. No, it's on. really nice good. Easy yep. to put on. So all you remember to do is once you put your pin in, swing your cord around, and you always start your beading and your knotting where you've just popped the pin in. Okay, so it's, it's pretty easy just to... It's gorgeous, Mark. Just to keep an eye on. These will be so perfect. 
<laughs> with all year round, yeah. those cords, and watch yeah. this space. There's more cords yeah. on the horizon. Yeah. Firstly, can I just say congratulations Bless on you. every? every I love them. I, you know, I love cord. Yeah, and yeah. why have we? Why have we waited twelve I years know. to make this happen? Yeah, um, now I've got three more auctions between now and the top of the hour. Bobbins, bobbins, a weight, and also your Zari thread. So bobbins, wind up, bobbin up. Um, you don't just use them for cord mine, do you? So I use them for my Kumahima ring, obviously, yeah. which is why they come in a pack of eight. Yeah. Um, really good for headphones. Ah, that's such a good idea. In. And also, if you're if you're buying lengths of metre sterling silver chain, yeah. Um, they're really, really good for storage. So wind it around your little bobbin, pop in your anti-tarnished clasp, your little tag, yeah. and keep, it'll keep it. Keeps it nice and safe. Nice and obviously and use your bobbins yeah. on the end of your kumihim there. So it go, yeah. he's going to go through That's the right. centre. Yeah. Nine ninety nine. really, once you've got your bobbins, as long as you don't lose them, you're not going to need They'll to replace forever. them. Yeah, yeah they, they will last forever. forever. Yeah. Um, but I remember first launching these going, oh, are they? Mm, amazing. <laughs> No, no, what they were for, but that's uh, that's what multiples of use is in actual fact. Yeah. Nine ninety nine. Congratulations if you got your Kumihimo disc. That's right. That's right. You need your bobbins, don't you? Yeah. yeah. The reason that you need your you bobbins get, um, and you need this. And the reason you get eight in a pack is because I would say ninety nine percent of your your Kumihimo braids you will use eight strands. Right. That's why. Okay. If you didn't have the bobbins, they'd be hanging all into your disc and every time you did a move they would get worse and worse so in a tangle. So they go through here, don't they? They hang yeah. through they, here they, basically. They hang underneath with your cords. Yeah. That's right. Like that. Yeah. So if, you, if you're after the shift, if, you're going to, if you put in jewellery maker Kumahimo, one of us will pop up doing a demo. Yeah. And you'll see the bobbins. Yeah. You'll absolutely. see those bobbins. Well yeah. done. Yeah. If you need, if you are interested, something great if you're going on a flight to do Kumahimo. Absolutely. You don't need any tools. No. Yeah. It's, yeah. it's literally this. Um, and actually, our hobby oh, starter marvelous. is Kumahimo. Oh, brilliant. Is it you? Yeah. Oh, there you go. So I, so I do a cord Kumahimo hour and then how to add beads to your Kumahimo. Perfect. Oh, thank you. So we'll Adam. put it right at the start of the um, of our hobby starter thing so you can learn how to yes. um, how to do it. Yeah. Why do we need a weight? So if you imagine you've got your, your braid coming down the centre of your disc mm. and you've got your weight and you've got your bobbins hanging down. If you yeah. didn't have that weight in the centre, everything would, this is a good word, everything would conglomerate, all, the, all your, your warp would conglomerate in the middle of your disc and it would get really messy. So the weight pulls your braid down yeah. as you're doing your course, so it keeps the tension nice and tight and everything yeah. uniform. Again, it is needed, It's isn't desperately it? needed. And we yeah. haven't seen them for I don't know how long. No. If you are starting or, or, or starting on your Kumihimo adventure, which is an ancient Japanese form right. of knotting, isn't it? It is. You used yeah. to use them in... It stands for crossover. Crossover. Kumihimo, that's what it's And it was the warriors, wasn't it? It was. Japanese when, warriors. Was the, the samurai warriors used to use Kumihimo braids to tie their plates of armour together when they went into battle. Love it, so cool, 3 99 So that means, basically, quick tally up, 3 99 for the weight, 4 99 for the bobbins, was it 2 99 for the Kumihimo yeah. disc? So as long as I've got these and That's your cords... So you can get all of that for 10 quid. 10 quid? Yeah. If I add some of your cords with it, fifteen quid. You fifteen could, pounds, you're away. You you're kumahimoing. Yeah. That's your hobby started. And your bell cap endings now. So. Bell cap endings as well. Um, it's always been a very, uh, you know, affordable medium. I love kumahimo. Now let's do the zari thread because you can kumahimo with these as you well, can. can't you? And you can macrame, you can knot, you can do all sorts braids. It's amazing. I amazing. love this mix. So this is going to be our finale nice. auction of the day. Love it. You've got a rose gold, a silver, a gold, and Blush. A blush. Yeah. Yes, a blush pink. Mm -hmm. um, pretty. Uh, and you've got on there 125 metres. Yep. Wow. It's amazing. You, I'm, I'm, I'm not dreaming this. You have definitely macrameed with these recently, haven't yes. you? Yes. I thought so. Yeah, and could so. yeah. yeah, it looks lovely. It looks yeah. lovely macrameed. Yeah. Uh, 29.99, that's for 125 metres on each spool. So that's Crazy. what, 250. Uh, uh, 500 metres there. It's amazing, isn't it? Wow. That's nowhere near. Final auction of the day. It's been amazing. Thank you so much for joining us. Six ninety nine. Goodness me. Like I said, everything that we've brought you. If you do a bit of a tally up, I bet you find it's not Brilliant. that. It's not. No. It's not fortunes. And that's no. well and truly started on your no. Kumi. I definitely budget. recommend getting those bell cap kits. Yes. Because I doubt we'll have them again for months after that. Absolutely. We don't, we don't get. I've been 
begging people to get me these in forever. We'll put the graphics I'm on your brilliant. screen right now. Amazing. Mark, thank you so much. It's been absolutely wonderful, Amazing. as always. When are you back? I am back Sunday with my first show with Carol in two months. I know, I've st I've kept, I've, <laughs> I have stolen yeah, it. And, we've, and in the 12 o'clock hour, we have got the most beautiful angel I that I'm bringing to oh, her. I've never worked exciting. with it before. It's beautiful. Oh, we'll have a lovely show. Yeah. Thank you. Send my love to Bless our you. Carol as Have a lovely well. weekend. Thank you. Yeah. Um, I'm back tomorrow. We've got lovely Alison tomorrow and I've also mm. got some beautiful Jade opportunities, amazing showcases. So we'll see you bright and early. Take care. Mm -hmm.